Oh man. Oh man. Oh man. I've been waiting for this all week. I know, right? It's leaving me feeling brappy too. <laughs> I'm feeling pretty brappy myself too. Aren't you feeling pretty brappy? <laughs> I think I'm feeling pretty brappy. Ah, hello everyone! Hello, hello, hello! Super happy to have everyone here today! Yay! Hello, hello! Welcome, welcome! Today is Thursday, October 26, 2023. We're a couple of days away from Halloween. And what better way to spend Halloween than to play a game about a brother and sister who eat and who eat people and, and summon demons uh, all in the name of love? <laughs> It's a style that's fucking cool. I love this game. I heard it's actually aside from the meme guys. I know big meme game We love incest and everything like that. Okay, I get it. Y'all are disgusting degenerates. I actually heard It's pretty good. I Heard it's pretty good <laughs> Now I have watched only the second half of the first chapter and that's it. I have not watched anything else. I have not read any media about it. I've only read like a couple of like people being angry about it because of like the themes and everything. But aside from that, I am going in pretty much completely blind today. <laughs> I'm going in completely blind and I'm quite excited that I did hold back and like, you know, I want to experience this. I want to say the experience and like the gasp and everything. I'm doing the same thing actually with class in 09. I know a couple more people that I, that I watch regularly either play class of 09 or are currently playing it right now. And again, that's another game I'm holding myself back on. Um, <laughs> I, I, it's really, really hard when you're like a content creator and you have fans or you not have fans, but you have friends that play like, you know, the games that you also want to play, but you can't watch them because you don't want to spoil yourself and like ruin the ruin like the first time experience so um please clap for me tell me i did a good job in not spoiling myself or uh you know going too deep into like uh the story like offline or anything like that but i am so excited to finally finally be playing the coffin of andy and lele uh and <sighs> can i be honest i have major bro con <laughs> I have major, major, major pro con chat. Um, this stream is un is probably gonna leave me so unhealthy, <laughs> and you will probably find it very entertaining. So I hope you enjoy all the entertainment that comes out of this stream today. Thank you, thank you for all the love and support. I hope we can make it out of this alive. <laughs> She said it, this is your she she really is literally me. She really is literally me though. Seriously. She's literally me <laughs> I was such a girl. She's not like me yeah, But don't you don't you just like don't you want a little don't you want an idle little sister? Don't you don't you Don't you don't you want an idle little sister? Don't you oh sorry one one <laughs> Don't you want an idle little sister? Don't you want me to be your little sister? <laughs> no! No! Why not? No! Too much hammer for you! Cute little sister who's kind of sociopath. I am kind of sociopathic, I guess. I guess. <laughs> I guess I'm kind of sociopathic, but... Wouldn't it just be nice? Right? <laughs> Wouldn't it be nice? <laughs> no, I won't tease y'all that hard today. If anything, if anything, you guys are gonna be the ones that are gonna be clowning on me today. So I won't go too hard on you guys, but you can go pretty hard on me. I don't fucking care. <laughs> they said the Yandere game, so it's gonna be great. Not flat. What? I'm not flat enough. I mean, like, I'm sorry I was born with, like, huge, gigantic double Ds, I think. I haven't sized myself in a while. <laughs> Sorry, I sold my You sold your soul already? Oh. Ah, Pam! Thank you so much for the raid on Twitch. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> thank you so much. You were just playing it yesterday. I could, I really wanted to watch you stream it. I really wanted to watch you stream fucking, um, uh, Coffin to Andy and Lele so bad because I heard your voice acting was so good, but I had to resist. I had to resist because I wanted to save him. I wanted to save my first impressions for today. Ah! I can't wait to go back and watch your vibe. I'm so excited, man. <laughs> uh, thank you so much, Pam, for the raid. Thank you, thank you. Let me go ahead and introduce myself to everyone.
everyone. Ready, everyone? Say no. Take a fiber, say bye, 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 bye. Nyan, nyan, nyan. Hello, everyone. My name is Yadu. I'm the Eternal Shane Star Idol Show You Productions. And it's super nice to meet you guys. And today, just like Pam, how she played it yesterday, we, today we are also going to be playing the coffin of Andy and Layla. Woo! Thank you so much, Pam. Thank you, thank you. Yeah. <laughs> Oh man, I was just telling my chat like how I had to resist watching you and Pippa and like a whole bunch of other phase and like other mutuals playing it. Heck, even Kudai was playing this, is, is currently playing this right now and I wanted to watch her stream so bad. But like I have been just resisting so I can save my first impressions for today. Ah! I know she's playing it right now. I'm so excited. <laughs> okay, okay. So Thank you so much again for the raid. Uh, please, everyone, please go check out Pam. She is the CEO of Play Asia. We were just talking about Play Asia a couple of days ago, actually. How my first ever Project Diva game, my first ever game from uh, Japan, I ordered it on Play Asia many, many, many years ago as a baby Nyaru. And it was Project Diva F second for my PSP. <laughs> and that's how connected I am to, to Play Asia. That was so baby. But thank you, thank you so much again, Pam. Everyone, please go check out Pam. She does do streams both on Twitch and on YouTube. She does great voice acting content and, of course, very great singing content as well. Please check her out. Thank you so much, Pam, for the raid again. Thank you, thank you. And like I said, for anyone joining us, welcome, welcome. My name is Yadu, and today we're going to be playing The Coffin of Andy and Layla, which Pam just played a couple of, uh, uh, yesterday, and I'm pretty sure you've seen a lot of other people playing it recently. <laughs> so, I'm excited. I'm excited. Yay. <laughs> this game sounds like it's one of those late night horror movie shows with a host. It does not sound like that. Act it's not actually like that. It's it's very sussy. Very, very sussy game, actually. But I'm excited. So before we get started for today, guys, um, I want to go ahead and say hello to all of our lurkers and bot watchers. Thank you so much, guys, for being here. No matter what you guys are doing, working hard, playing hard, studying hard, or watching about at a later time, I really appreciate you guys, and I hope you have a lovely, lovely W day. Happy Thursday. We're almost to Friday. Hopefully tomorrow I can stream because, uh, for those that don't know, I am doing a Wagyu steak stream tomorrow. I'm going to be Pre prepping an expensive steak imported from Japan. I paid a hundred dollars for this bitch. We're gonna basically have a JBBQ party and I'm quite excited. Quite excited. <laughs> Don't burn it. Okay, that's what I'm scared of. I've been doing so much research about how to like cook it and so far I've been recommended just regular seasoning as you do with like any other kind of steak. Uh, the best thing to prep it with is like a um, with like some soy sauce, the big uh, grainy, the big gr uh, grains of salt, and then, um, I forgot there's another sauce I need, but those are, like, that's gonna be like my side sauces, and then I'm gonna have like a thing of rice, uh, some veggies, and then I'm gonna thinly cut it to do pretty much like JBBQ style Wagyu, because apparently that's like the easiest way to cook it, just 10 seconds on each side, go at it one at a time, and just, just go ham, yeah, just go ham, I'll be too scared to even try to cook it, listen, I'm very scared, I've been doing so much research, I'm still scared, but I'm gonna do my best, first try is always the hardest, it's gonna be okay, yeah, 10 seconds on each side, Wagyu has like a lot of fat in it, and that's like where the flavor is usually at, so you don't want to cook it too much what type of rice style uh I'm, i have jasmine rice i ran out of my sushi uh japanese rice unfortunately uh so i had to cook it with some jasmine rice but i do have some other stuff like prep to go and thank you for the hydrate thank you thank you wow so you're gonna uh sus it sus fight it sus vide sus vide sus vide I don't know what sous vide is. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna cook it. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna do like thin slices. I'll cut it live and then sous vide, sous vide, sous vide, sous vide, sous vide. <laughs> I'm a, I'm a, I'm a stupid sous vide is a boiling shit in plastic. What the fuck? Why are you telling me to boil shit in plastic bags? I don't want to consume toxic plastics. Sous vide, da vinky. <laughs> Da Vinky! Da Vinky! <laughs> Kinda of welcome, welcome, this is your first time chatter. Okay guys, feel free to say hi in chat and I'll say hi to you guys. We'll do, uh, we'll do Twitch first and then we'll say hi to everyone on YouTube as well because we are simulcasting onto YouTube, so whatever your preferred platform may be. Thank you so much for joining us and I hope you can enjoy today's stream! And I'll try my best to look at both chats today, unlike yesterday when I had like, you know, 
I had I had my VR headset on. It was so hard to look at chat, so I apologize. But thank you, YouTube bros. Thank you, Twitch bros. Let's go ahead and say hello to everyone. Let's say hello to Ki uh, Dosso, Kier6, Green Dissol, Zeon Kitsune, Casper, that, that is a bean, Evil Carton, Honor Blend, that boy you betrayed, Atlas Bean. This is a, this is a bean, welcome, welcome. Uh, Rogues do it from behind, Cake Nova, Teto DJD, welcome, welcome. Passing Passenger, Sama Hong, Fanpex, welcome, welcome, guys. How y'all doing today? Thank you, thank you for being here. Randy the Black Knight, welcome, welcome. Uh, let's see, do we have any? Notifications has been happening. Uh, Nanomancer, thank you so much for the follow. We'll go get a stage. Cat, uh, Cake Nova, thank you so much for the follow as well. And Katsu Ubu, thank you so much for the follow. Thank you, thank you. Alrighty, and from participants on YouTube, let's go ahead and say hello to Belmont, House Wilma, Kersey Deans, uh, LATTV, Nostoma, Puck Puck, Ren, and Tang. Thank you so much, guys. Kick Clots, welcome, welcome. Mr. Spanner, welcome, welcome. Uh, how y'all doing today? Thank you, thank you. Welcome guys, welcome, welcome, welcome. Okay, we'll be saying hello to everyone as everyone comes in. I'm pretty sure everyone is super excited to play this. Um, but yeah, as far as announcements go, shooty bop, tomorrow we're cooking that Wagyu steak. And um, I'm gonna be doing a little more office reconstruction over the weekend, uh, even though I technically already finished my office. This is my new office, guys. <laughs> it's not my new, new office. I mean, like, I have new desk. I got standing desk. Right now I'm sitting uh, because I I had a feeling I was going to be, like, jumping around and, like, blah, 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 all over the place. So I need to sit down for this fucking stream because otherwise I'm going to, like, go all over the place. <laughs> but this is my new standing desk area. I get it's adjustable, so I'm able to, like, electronically move it up and down. And um, I love it so much. I love it. The only difference is my mic is now to the right instead of to the left, which is kind of weird for me. Uh, but I'm going to do my best. Mm -mm -mm. Hey, I'm just welcome, welcome. See, I'm welcome, welcome. Hi, guys. Hello, hello, hello. Tia 2 Monday, the greatest day of the week. Monday! Mo Tia, we're going to play mo on Monday. We're going to be playing standing up. I'm so excited. Wow. <laughs> best to be seated for what's coming. I know it is best to be seated for what's coming. That's quiz. Welcome, welcome, by the way. Nice battle station. Thank you. Thank you. It's an upgraded battle station. I love it so much. Um, I also have a cute, like, little figurine weeaboo corner in on my desk now. I, I couldn't do it before on my other desk because, like, everything was, like, kind of weird when it came to, like, the positioning of everything. Because I had, like, a one of those little holes where you could put, like, the little wires through and then, like, it, it plugs into, like, the wall or whatever. Um... This one doesn't have that. I'm able to just put it all behind it. So now I have a lot more room to like put like little display figures and actually can I take a picture of it and I'll just put it on Discord real quick. Let me let me take a quick picture of it. Cause I think my little display corner is just so cute. I love it. It's just like in the corner right next to like all my other stuff. It's so cute. Let me show it to you guys. I can't I can't go on I can't go on without showing you guys. <laughs> it is just my cute little like best girls corner. I love it. it. Has all my cute cute people that I love and Emperor Aaron B Gaming too. Thank you so much for the follow. Look, look at this stage. Happy to have you here, friend. Thank you, thank you. Okay, dumping grounds, and then we'll go here and then put that here. And then I'm gonna minimize that and then we're gonna go boop and then boop and then that here boop and bam yeah look so i have like my nico my two nico figures uh my hachima nendroid that someone gifted me at offkai expo a pippa a little my little pippa stand i actually have another pippa standy but it just didn't fit quite right because like the base of the one that uh, I think it was like the first or second anniversary uh face connect ones uh it has a huge ass base and i <laughs> I'm sorry. Who thought it was a good idea to put that big ass fucking base on on that small little standy, okay? Uh, so I got the little swimsuit one and um <laughs> and it's there now. And then of course I have my little standy there. I'm look I'm going to try to rearrange everything to add more little like standies to this corner. It's just my cute little merch corner to remind me why I keep doing shit. <laughs> Holy cute, thank you, thank you. Hachima base, Hachima soul base. Hachima soul base, a Pipkin huge base, huge base, a huge ass, bass. <laughs> oh, the new standies have more reasonably sized bases. I haven't gotten a new standy recently. I gotta get one if I can. Um, I didn't order any Shipkin Shippas. I didn't order any, 
Uh, the only thing I just got in my 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 Pippa birthday merch and like I'm wearing my slipkin slippers right now. My my blanket blanca is downstairs on my couch because I usually have my blankets on my couch. Um, and uh, my posters, I still gotta figure out where I'm gonna put those posters. Um, I'm using the mat right now on my on my new desk. Um, and I got two keychains. I got a bonus keychain. Fishman gave me a bonus keychain. Man, I'm so happy about it. Thank you, Fishman. I also think he gave me a bonus poster, but I'm not too sure about that either. <laughs> I'm not too sure if he gave me a bonus post to screen the soul. Welcome, welcome. How are you doing today? And Cookie, welcome, welcome. I ordered some from PC Anniversary Plushies. Hope you're seeing this sometime in 2025. So true, Mfi. So true. <laughs> I mean, if you guys need to, just, just follow the face shop. They're actually pretty good at responding to everything. Okay, guys. Okay, enough about phase. Enough about phase. Before someone comes in here and they're like, oh, Johnny Faze win. Fishman hate. No, Fishman love. Le leave him alone. He's trying. That man is literally trying his best. He has to deal with so much bullshit. <laughs> Nico love her face. Hell yeah. Nico Yazawa was basically like my one true love. We love to hate Fishman. So true. And feet. Oh, thank you for the stretch. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Let's go ahead and now get started though. We have, we have to get started with this game because I am just now holding out. I'm excited. I hope you guys are too. So let's go ahead and just get into it. Let's go. Let's do it. Let's fucking do it. I'm so excited. <laughs> uh, give it a second. Oh, there it goes. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna make myself a little bit smaller, actually. I'm gonna make myself. I, I feel like I'm too big. I feel like I'm too big. Uh, why am I wide now? Hold on. Chotamate. Why why do I look weird? I look weird and distorted. Why do I look weird and distorted? Okay, uh transform reset. Ah, that's why. There we go. There we go. Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna put myself, yeah, I'm gonna put myself in just this little corner right here. Yeah. It's going to be necessary. It's just going to be fucking necessary for today. <laughs> okay, okay. Oh man, I'm excited. I'm excited. I'm so freaking excited. Big Smell, Murphy, Red Leon, welcome, welcome, guys. And Rhea, welcome, welcome. Heart Quins and Long Cat, welcome, welcome on YouTube as well. Welcome, guys. Okay. <gasps> ah! He's so tired. He's just like, okay, okay. Okay, hold on. I got, I got a good pull. I got a good pull. Who is literally you? Who is literally you? Are you are you Andy or are you are you Lele? Are you Andy or are you Lele? I'll put that for 10 minutes, fuck it. Who is literally you? Is this literally you from your Furo game? Yes, he is so me. Lele a cute. Lele a cute! Okay, I'm gonna vote, I'm gonna vote Lele, because I, I feel like no one's gonna vote Lele. <laughs> Because y'all are fucking self-inserting your- You know what I'm saying? This is a self- See? Now you guys understand what it's like to self-insert now. Because I'm pretty sure most of you fuckers are self-inserting yourself as Andy. And then here I am, I'm like, oh my god. Lele is like literally me. She's literally me. <laughs> Violet Gamer, both sex can self-insert. You're so right, Ophi. You're so right. Hey guys, welcome, welcome. And Chex will tell me, welcome, welcome as well. Thank you so much for the bonk. I'm gonna need a lot of bonks today. Y'all are free to bonk me as much as you want, by the way. Just let it- I'm just gonna let it fucking happen. I self-insert as Lele. I'm self-inserting as the de as the demon! Okay, kind of based, though. That is so based. So based. Okay, guys, it is time. It is fucking time. Let us go ahead and go on a new adventure. Oh, man. Okay, so yeah, WASD. I'm gonna- Move down my desk just a little bit more. Oh, wait. Oh, okay. That's as far as I go. Okay, cool. Okay. Okay, sorry, I had to adjust my desk because it was like kind of kind of weird for me. Okay, okay, okay. So shift to run, fast dialogue page down, F, full screen, F4, menu, ESC, SQ, okay, interact, E, N, E and Z? Where's my Z key? Okay, E and Z and space. Okay, now WASD. 
Okay, sounds good. Episode one, the coffin. I will be voice acting today. Lele, I don't want to. Well, I do. Just go over there and k eat to you. I thought she was your friend. Mom said you'd he Mom said you'd help me with anything. We'll get in trouble. <laughs> oh no, not a record scratch. No, no, not a record scratch. Good morning, Ashley. Uh, are you trying to do everything today? Just chapter. Oh, we'll see how I do. We'll see how I do. We'll see how I do because I ha my my I have a feeling I'm gonna go all over the place today. <laughs> as much as you love feeling sorry for yourself, it's time for a little interlude. It's a tight. It is titled Five Nutritions to Not Die." Ready, set, go. Okay, I love this. This is so cute. Okay, uh, I guess we gotta go to the fridge. Where's the fridge? Fridge don't go? What's this? Junk and other bills, they cannot be eaten. Okay. Inside the cabinets is nothing! Oh no. Okay. Uh, is there a fridge? Oh. The freezer is completely empty. Okay. Uh, the coffee machine sits alone, sand and abandoned. But there's only so many times it can brew at the same ground, so no more coffee in this house. Oh no, they're so poor. Wow, she's li she really is literally me. <laughs> you used to fill your you, you you're used to filling your stomach with water, but it's not enough. Your body demands sustenance. Okay, I guess it is trash. This is where you and your older brother pile your trash. It's already been scavenged several times, and it is truly and utterly exhausted as a food source. Literally me for real, for real. I'm a Tia Magnus. Welcome, welcome, guys. But wait, what is that? <gasps> a can of tomatoes! Amazing, you should show that to your brother. Okay. Let's show it to Oni-chan. Oh, is that- Is this where we have sex, chat? Oh my god, is this where we have sex? Is that where we have the sex? Ah! <gasps> There's Big Bro. You show on the tomato can. Ta-da! Uh, not the reaction you were hoping for. Ahem. <clears throat> Ta-da! We're not eating that. Huh? No, that's the very last thing we have, Ashley. I think we should hold on to it a lot longer. Or a little longer. Oh. Quit your complaining. You're energetic enough to go running through our trash, so clearly you're not dying yet. Huh? How did you know it was in... Because I hid it there, away from you. <gasps> I live in a den of snakes! Ah, don't rally me up. You're making me hungry. Do you know what you've helped with that, Andrew, my dear? No, put the tomatoes away somewhere. Put them in my mouth. I will. Mm, I can see that your heart is set on this. Fine, let's eat them then. Screw our future selves. <laughs> Time for you to go cook some tomatoes. Yeah, cooking tomatoes. Chat, can I cook you? Can I? Can I cook? Oh, good day. Are you still alive in there? Ugh. Hello. If you won't make a, if you won't make a sound, I'll assume you're dead. And I don't bring food to the dead. You don't bring it. You don't bring it to the living either. Ha! I'll take that as a yes. Still alive. And don't blame me for a delivery guy screwing up. Can't you go grab us something from the store for us? Nah, not my job. I'll check in on you later. I'll check on you again later. Bye! No, wait! Wait, wait, come back! He doesn't. God damn it. I hate it here. Wow. Okay, I'm cooking you guys tomato soup. Is that okay? Uh. We boiled a can of tomatoes and made delicious boiled canned tomatoes! <laughs> There's even a little bit of pepper left to season with. There's some gourmet stuff right here. No salt, though. You use all of it to spike your water in order to avoid overhydrating yourself while drinking to fill your stomachs. Well, how is it? At this point, you could feed me a can of worms and I say it's the best thing I ever ate. Kiss ass. <laughs> 
No, I'm not saying... I, I'm not saying ha that's how hungry I am. In that moment, an honest audio assaults your eardrums. Are you kidding me? The neighbor is at it again? You wanna go take a peek? Nope. But I'll come along if you do. Here, catch. Balcony key. Okay. So I guess we gotta go out here? Right when they gave us food and stuff? Good times. I bet they don't do that anymore because they're scared to open the door now. They could still squeeze something in through the mail slot. Like what? Pasta? Like, like anything! Are they just going to let us die in here? At this point, I'd be surprised if they didn't. Like, this whole situation is going to be a PR nightmare, I'm sure. I wonder if they- I wonder if they'd rather we die than talk about it. Cheery. They should come in and shoot us then or something. Get it over with. That wouldn't look very natural, I guess. I guess. <laughs> How am I doing, chat? Remember, when summoning a demon, have the have an offer ready. Oh, okay. Fox Gamer, by the way, welcome, welcome. This is a 20... This really is 2010 fanfic. Holy fuck. This is how obscure the game really to the gusting part. Hopefully, it finishes soon. I hope they do too, man. Go to the bed. Go to the bed with him? Your parents... <laughs> Your parents have fucked on this bed. Well, so have we. So will we, big brother. So will we! Soon. Uh, oh, I guess we gotta go this way? Unlock the- okay, balcony door. Okay, okay, okay. Hmm. Hmm. Can't really see squat from here. You contemplate if you should take a leap of faith towards the neighbor's balcony. It's only the fourth floor, Ashley. Don't you don't you even think about it? Ah, uh, he's no fun. Guess I have to set up some set up something up to cross. Okay, so we gotta find something to cross with. Okay, mm. what's in here? What's this? Oh, it's our bathroom. Uh, it's a cleaning closet inside our various supplies, just trash bags. Okay, maybe I'll take a shower. Not right now, you won't. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, big bro. I won't take a shower. It's a washing machine. Okay. So there's nothing there. What about in mom and dad's room? Ah! Oh, crap. Are you alright? These goddamn DIY shells, I swear. Uh, oh. Oh, what a plank! Okay, there we go, there we go. Hey, heck yeah! Heck yeah, I know what I'm doing, chat. Set down the wooden plank. Okay, there we go. Oh, wow, literally me. <laughs> She's already literally me. 42 of you guys are Andy. <laughs> well, today you guys can be my Andy, okay? Oh my gosh, she's, she's literally all me. She's, it's all you. All you. <laughs> Trash right now, sex. Welcome, welcome. Book said, welcome, welcome. Q, welcome, welcome. Uh, thick. How you guys doing? Heart Quins, welcome, welcome. Skellington on YouTube, welcome, welcome as well, friend. How y'all doing? <laughs> First Nyadu's uh, brother today, bros. Well, we're Nyadu's brother today, bros. The mom is better. Oh, demons from hell! Hear my plea! All unholy ones, I come seeking your advice! God damn it. What am I doing wrong? I thought I was perfect. I knew I shouldn't have killed the guy when I had the chance. What do you make of this? Everybody needs a hobby, I guess. Forget this. It's almost time to let us, uh, it's almost time they let us watch TV. <laughs> oh, you know, there's just like a, a fucking sacrifice, uh, a demonic sacrifice going on in the apartment next to you. And then we're just like, uh, let's just go watch TV. You know, like, ignore all people. Ah, uh, the remote's dead. Just push the buttons on the TV. Uh, what a pain. Fine. I'll fetch some batteries for you. 
I always have to do everything around here. Yeah, yeah, woe is you. It is! Okay, gotta go find battery. Um, maybe... Mother won't pick up no matter how many times you will call. You also tried ordering food a bazillion times, but for a reason, the orders never arrive. Okay, hold on, let's see... Uh, batteries. Where can we find batteries? Let's see... Oh, there's a clock! You take the batteries off the alarm yeah. clock. Got batteries, okay, cool. Wow, I like how easy this is so far. <laughs> okay, okay. I've got the remote right here. Nah, that's okay. I think I'll just push the buttons on the TV after all. I can see you how the batteries. Just hand them over. Nope, I decided I'll hold on to them. We might need them later. But what exactly? What are you being difficult about? Why are you being difficult about this? I'm not! I am taking on the Herculean task of operating a TV myself! Whatever makes you happy, I guess. She's so- she's literally me. She's quite literally me. Thank you for tuning in. Today we are sharing you some joyous developments in regards to the tainted water solution. We're happy to announce that all apartments in which the tainted water have been delivered have been secured. It has been three months since the first incident was discovered, and the death toll of now at a comfy 53 total. No biggie. And the quarantine period for those whom are at risk have been extended by another two weeks. Again? And to our friends in quarantine, thank you for keeping your disgusting, parasitic, infested bodies far, far away from us! Holy shit! What the fuck? That's so mean! Sorry, it's- thank you for consider- <laughs> Oh my goodness! I mean, I feel like this is how everyone was during, like, uh, the pandemic. <laughs> Thanks for keeping your disgusting COVID body away from us. <laughs> Damn, literal brain wars. Two worries of raw dog. Two worries of raw dog, you would sit <laughs> It's literally real life. So true. I mean, two worries. Two more weeks! Two more weeks! Two more weeks! <laughs> Sorry, it's thank you for your considered consideration to public safety. That's all for today. Cheers! I'm going to bed. We decided to do the same. Oh! Wait, Mom, where are you going? Me and your father will be staying at a hotel for a bit. I thought they said you would stay at home until... I didn't drink anything. Mom... No booze, no dirty contaminated water, nothing. The only thing I've drank is some orange juice from a carton. Well, thank you! Mom is going to get milk. She'll be back in a bit. She is not gonna be back, isn't she? She's not gonna be back, isn't she? <laughs> thank you so much, Ready for Prime for three months. Happy three month anniversary to us. Thank you, thank you! Anyway, I'm gonna miss my bus. You and Andrew can join us later. Alright, this won't hurt a bit. There's six and needle in you. It hurts like a motherfucker! So true! My face is literally me! <laughs> I hate needles! There we go. And now you! How long do we have to stay home? The results from your blood work will be done tomorrow. So if you're as well, you're free to come and go as you please after that. And if not, then you'll get to see what happens. Then you'll get to see what happens if not. That's all for now. Take care. Stop calling me, Ashley. Please. If you need something, ask the workers there. I can't do anything for you. And if I don't... And I don't want to hear these lies about starving anymore. Why the hell would I lie about this? Listen, this new apartment is a bit of a fixer-upper, so I'm really busy. Besides, isn't Andrew there with you? What do you need me to pacify you for? You get to laze around all day and do nothing. I don't know what you've got to complain about. Anyways, I've gotta go. Please don't call anymore. I won't answer. G Goodbye, Ashley. I'm sorry. Dude, what the fuck? This mom's a bitch! After reminiscing all night, you wake up and one does. As one does. Instead of remin uh, ruminating upon your misery, you decide to clean up on the house a bit. Okay. <gasps> Can I sneak? Can I sneak in with Big Bro? <gasps> Can I sneak in with Big Bro? <laughs> no, I can't. I guess I can't. Picked up some laundry. Uh, uh. You're cleaning? What a waste of energy. You are a waste of energy. Thanks. 
Just don't overdo it. Picked up some laundry. Picked up some laundry. Come to think of it, do you even have any detergent left? Hmm, good question. Can I... Oh. You have to clean with your bare hands, okay. Ha! <laughs> bare hands. You guys need to clean us with your bare hands. Clean up some books. Return all the books to the shelf. Now, where else could you clean? Okay. Shut up! You don't, you don't have to bonk me that hard. You don't have to bonk me that hard, chat. Mm. What can you do? The, movie, the, do, the movies are it's fucking over. You miss- oh, detergent! That detergent! You run the laundry. Now that's what you- now that's what you clean. Okay. Got a mop. Oh! He is easy to clean the spots. Okay. See, we're so good. Oh! Mm. You're feeling dizzy. Oh my god, she died! Damn it, Ashley. I told you not to overdo it. Mm. <gasps> She's on <laughs> it! You good girl? No, she's literally me. <laughs> This could be the risk. Let's just don't contribute to the household chores like this. <laughs> oh, serious, just bucking. <laughs> this is really this is just so me. When you're starving to death, but damn, the floor is dirty. <laughs> Good news, once again. Some of you may have heard that your loved ones that has been supplying shortages of the quarantine households. Well, boy, are we pleased to announce that all of that has been taken care of. It has. Does it look like a meeting right now? On that note, we'd like to rem remind all of you not to enter the contaminated apartments. No, your friends don't need anything from you. Everything is taken care of. You should still feel the urge to help. The staff will be administering bullets directly into your brain as a thank you. I hope that clears things up. What the fuck? This game is fucked. Moving on to our next story. A brand new art museum will be... You judge it back into unconsciousness. Okay, cool. Free bullets! Wow, I love living in Canada! Do they live in Canada? Maybe that's why they... <laughs> maybe that's- maybe that's why... They have, like... So much, like, just- just- just K- just KYS. Just KY- I'm pretty sure they live in Canada. Like, at this point, I- I- I can't... They have to live in Canada if they- if, like, the solution is just pulling a bullet to the head. By the government. By the government, of all people! Free euthanasia! Wow! Uh. Okay, there's a phone call. Hello? Of course, what is it? The shift in tone in his voice makes you strain your ears. No, n go ahead. Someone's talking on the end of the line, but you can't make out the words. They sound more and more upset as they talk, though. Well, that's... I mean, I can't do anything about that. Or I can try talking to her, but... No, I mean, yes, but that doesn't... No, I'm not angry. I'm just... No, I... <sighs> Can you let me talk? The voice on the other end must have said no. It increasingly louder, but you still can't make out all the words. Oh, it's about... You don't... Lee and Ashley and... I've had this time to think. Just can't anymore. So, that's it then. Now it's quiet on both ends. Well, alright, I guess. What else is there to say? Sorry? Although I really don't see why I shouldn't be held accountable for. <laughs> Based! Uh. <sighs> Who was that? My ex-girlfriend, apparently. Oh, she dumped you? Why is that? What do you think? H how should I know? Maybe... Maybe because you're a parasite-infested homebody that's apparently perma-quarantined. Or because she found somebody new. It's been a few months, buddy. Or 
Maybe she just didn't like you that much in the first place. <laughs> Whatever you say, Ashley. Mm. I have something more tactful to say. <laughs> She's so bratty! She's so fucking bratty! She's so bit. No, she's not even bratty. She's a bitchy at this point. <laughs> then again, I don't know. I kind of, That's not bratty. That's horrible, right? She's so smug! She's smug about it! Now you've been out for new who knows how long. You figure you should check on your brother. Okay. Let's go check on him. The poor... Someone from your apartment is getting hauled into an ambulance. Hey, me too! People are yelling from their windows and balconies. I need some help too! Please, please, I'm starving! Soon the ambulance leaves in a hurry. Color me surprised. They actually helped. They, they actually got that person some help. I figured they just let her die. Maybe she did die. She wasn't moving. And if they, and if they had their sirens blaring for a corpse. Oh. Eh. Oh. Oh. Yeah, but. Ah. Uh. Ah. Uh, shit. Ah. Uh, there's someone at the door. Fuck. Um, chat, I'll be right back. There's someone at the door. I don't know why. Uh, be right back. If you are dumb enough to buy a new car this weekend, you are big enough schmucks to come to Big Bell Health Cars. Bad deal. Cars that break down. Thieves. If you think you're gonna find a bargain at Big Bell, you can kiss my ass. It's our belief that you're such a stupid motherfucker. You'll fall for this bullshit. Guaranteed. If you find a better deal, show it up your ugly ass. You'll hurt us, right? Show it up your ugly ass. Bring your trade. Bring your title. Bring your wife. We'll fuck her. That's right. We'll fuck your wife. Because at Big Bell Health, you are fucked six ways from Sunday. Take a hike. To Big Bell Health. Home of challenge pissing. That's right. Challenge pissing. How does it work? If you can piss six feet in the air straight up and not get wet, you'll get no down payment. Don't wait. Don't delay. Don't fuck with us or we'll rip your nuts off. Only at Big Bill Hells. The only dealer that tells you to fuck off. Hurry up, asshole. This event ends a minute after you write us a check. And it better not bounce or you're a dead motherfucker. Go to hell. Big Bill Hells cars. Baltimore's filthiest. An exclusive home with the meanest of the bitches in the state of Maryland. Guaranteed.
my plumbers are here. Um, <laughs> they're 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 um, blowing out my sprinklers. <laughs> um, so I think that this does take like no more than ten minutes. Uh, but we'll keep going for for now. <laughs> we'll keep going for now. <laughs> Let me readjust myself again. There we go. <laughs> Pale on string. I know I'm gonna keep playing. I'm gonna keep playing. I'm gonna keep playing. Shut up. <laughs> We're gonna keep playing. But but I'm, I'm gonna have to be like a little bit more quiet than than usual. Also like Yoshi's like out there just whisper. Yeah, I'm just gonna do like ASMR whispering. <laughs> a little bit, a little bit of ASMR until they go. Okay. <laughs> yeah, you need to ask a crusher for a few minutes. Now you gotta shut. I'm not shouting your lines with with. Random strangers in the house. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> she can't. She can't. I can't loudly. Whoa. I swear to God, if a scene comes up where I just need to like actually let it the fuck out, I'm gonna cry. I'm actually gonna cry. The shame will add to the atmosphere. No, shut up. Shut up. Please, please. Oh my fucking god. They're blowing out my spring. They have to. It's gonna freeze soon. Okay. Okay. Anyways. Anyways. No idea. Nobody showed up when you're when when you fainted. Oh shit. 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 No idea. Nobody showed up when you fainted. Well, didn't you call- Well, did you call for anyone? What do you think, dumbass? Uh, I don't know. Maybe she went into labor or something. Yeah, maybe. Mm hmm. Thinking they'd bring me food if I got pr I want to scream so bad. I want to scream so bad. She's bright. What is she's bright? No, I'm not doing it, Chad. No, please, please. I can't. I can't control myself, Chad. Chad, I can't control myself. Guys, what if she is pregnant? What if she... Does, does this mean... Does this mean... <laughs> Nope. Let me finish. How would you even get pregnant in here? <laughs> well, we do have that one charming fellow right next door. Over my dead body. He seems a little off his rockers, so who knows? He just might end you. Forget this. Oh, this is so hard. This is so hard, chat. Well, excuse the hell out of me for exploring my options here. That woman didn't look pregnant. Didn't look. Oh, I, can't, I can't do this chat. I fucking can't. I fucking can't. <laughs> they're like, they're like walking downstairs and everything. <laughs> <laughs> You're gonna yell. No, that woman didn't look pregnant. Anyways, whatever. It's just a thought. Jackass. You like to go after Andrew and tell him it ain't nothing in his damn business anyways. But you're just too exhausted. But after sleeping a few hours, or maybe a few days, who knows? You fully revitalize and busting with bursting with energy. Ugh. Why? Marco Bro sacrificed fifty dollars. But why? I'm not active chat, but I wanted to donate it today. Love your content. Oh, thank Mario. you. Thank you so much for the fifty dollar dono. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> this stream is suffering. <laughs> thank you so much. <laughs> thank you, big bro. Thank you, lurker, big bro. So base. I know base lurker, big bro. This is cute, but this is suffering as fuck, Chad. <sighs> okay, okay. Oh, oh, oh no, she died. She died again. Oh. Sorry, I've seen it. It didn't need me or something. <laughs> oh, he's oh, he's silly lazy ones. Oh, I think they need me. Hold on, be right back again, Chad. Ah, I'm coming.
me to open the garage. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. What day is it? How long has it been locked in your apartment? I'm gonna have to be going like back and forth for like about like 10 more minutes, chat. Just give them time. Don't worry, they're almost done. And then we could be loud again. We could be loud and silly again. <laughs> you are alone. No, um, my plumbers are here. Uh, I didn't expect, I thought they were coming tomorrow, but they, they came today to blow up my sprinklers. <laughs> This is so suffering because like <laughs> this is so suffering chat. You don't understand. I have to I have to like voice act this game while there's while there's like my plumbers are here. <laughs> I am in agony. I am <laughs> I am suffering chat. I'm suffering so much right now. Okay, okay. What day is it? How long have you been locked in your apartment now? There we go. And where the hell does Andrew get these and get get the energy to make so much noise? Okay, let's go let's go check on Big Bro. <laughs> oh, what's he up to? He has unscrewed the lock and is attempting to kick it and kick the door in or out, depending on your perspective. How many more times are you going to try that? It's clearly barred from the other side somehow. What else am I supposed to do? Oh. If you don't stop banging that door, I won't bring you any food tonight. You won't either way. Says you, the delivery will be here in a matter of hours. But I guess you don't want anything. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Now you better stop bang, bang, banging on the door or I'll... Or next it'll be me banging your head against the wall. Giving him like a... Like a boomer. Southern boomer. <laughs> the man's footsteps fade away. Do you think they'll really get that delivery today? Like, I didn't fuck this up for us, did I? Unlikely. Though, I guess we'll see. And see you did. The absolute nothing was delivered. <laughs> oh, that's painful. <laughs> pain. Oh, pain. Absolute pain. <sighs> She's literally me. She's literally me, chat. This is so unfair. <gasps> she is literally me. <sighs> Talk about something. I got nothing. Try. So, parasites. It's been a few months. Are you feeling anything? Hunger. You think something would be happening to us by now? But I haven't noticed anything. That nurse never came back either. Like, don't you want to monitor us? Ugh, who cares? Me, Ashley, I care. Well, I don't. Care. Well, I don't care nor care that you care. Aside from starving, it's not so bad here. Come again? Aside from starving, I like it here. Well, I don't. I want to jump off a balcony. Oh, I'll race you! <laughs> no, seriously, let's go! Let's not, though I appreciate your eagerness to join me. But it's a bit too romantic, so I'll pass. Excuse me? What? You don't see it? Just imagine hitting the ground together. And with such force as our bodies turn into a pile of gory mush, never to be separated. I love this. <laughs> I love this. This is good. He's just, yeah, he is. Okay, seriously though, he is just as bad as her. Like, I, everyone's like, oh, thank you so much, Kench, for tier one at 30 moments. Happy 30 month anniversary to us. Thank you, thank you. Uh, you're projecting. No, I am not projecting. No, uh, he really is like, as bad. Stop projecting. No, I am not! Like, that's kind of bad. They both sucked. Okay, we can agree to that. Our remains would get so tangled up that they'd have to bury us together in the same coffin. Might as well. We've been confined together in this coffin of an apartment for what feels like an eternity already. I'm not jumping off the balcony with you. Get your head checked. I should get my head checked. And no wonder your girlfriend dumped you. If those are your plans for romance. Not 
romance. I said romantic. They're not the same thing. Romantic just means something is... Neighbor starts blasting his... Oh, the ritual music! Oh, he's back! He's back! Where are your thoughts on the game so It's actually pretty good. It's pretty good. Ah, I wish he just... I feel like you should check up on that. I feel like we should check up on that. I think we, I think we should check up on that chat. I think we should, I think we should check up on that. I think we should check up on that. <gasps> it's the, it's the demon. It's the dear soy point. So it's soy, soy point, soy point. Soy, soy point, pointing at soy, soy. Everyone, soy point at the demon. My lord, you've come. And you're uh, a little smaller than I imagined. I, I love it. It's better than I imagined. That's all I meant. What do you offer, human? Oh, um, uh, I, I don't have much to offer right now. But if you help me out here, I can get you anything you wish. Is that a no-go? As you wish, human. My lord, thank you, thank you. Perish. Labor, thank you so much for the follow up on the stage. Happy to have you here. Darkness, darkness clouds your vision and you cannot see what's happening. By the time your vision returns, the, en the entity has vanished. On the ground lays the lifeless body of the cultist. I think my I think my plumbers need me real quick. I want to go check up on them real quick. I'm so sorry again, chat. I'm so sorry, but again, <laughs> he's gonna call me over. Yeah, I think yeah they're calling me over. Okay, I'll be right back. Be right back. They are gone. <laughs> they are officially gone. That means we can yell and scream. We can yell and scream again. <laughs> okay. Okay, we can we can yell and scream all we want. <laughs> thank you for being patient with me, guys. Thank you, thank you. Again, I did not expect them to come today. I thought they were coming coming tomorrow, actually. <sighs> 
I paid them too, so then we should be good. Yeah, back to hollering and shrieking. I guess a good point that they left too. Let it out to make up for when they talked about pregnancy. Ah! <laughs> Raising child with big brother. <laughs> My pregnancy, oh no, oh no. <laughs> oh my god, never fucking again am I doing. <laughs> Funny that you woke up in the big bed after taking up talking about pregnancy too. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Let's keep going, let's keep going. So, uh, am I, am I already, am I already delirious or did you see that too? Do we, uh, do you want to check on him? Well, at the very least, I want to turn off that CD player. That's what you're concerned about? I am not listening to this for the rest of my life, Andrew. You're making it sound like we're going to die any day now. Well, aren't we? Well, I'm not. There's got to be something that this guy can, this guy has that we can eat. Oh, burglary time! Sh shut up. Let's get in there. Okay. The door not taunts you from the other side. Okay, um... We need... Boxes are full of useless junk. Okay, so we need to find a way to get inside. So... Uh, got an ashtray. Maybe that's... Oh! Okay, that works for me. Turn that shit off. Okay. That's a lot of meat, you think to yourself. <gasps> Is this how the... So it makes sense why this is cannibalism, by the way. Okay, this... This... Okay. Just that one line... That makes so much sense. They're quite literally starving. They have to resort... <laughs> they have to resort to cannibalism, pretty much. I mean, it'd be bad if they let it go to waste. It is- I mean, yeah! Even Daddy, if God didn't want to eat people, he wouldn't have made them out of food. So true, Umfi. So true. Out loud, apparently. Though, I mean, it's still illegal if we didn't kill the guy. Is it still- oh, it's still illegal if we didn't kill the guy. Is what illegal? Well, you know. Oh! You want to eat him? Isn't that what you were insinuating? Nah, I just like making observations. Ah, uh, but we can't. If we do eat him, then that's it for us. There's no way we wouldn't get caught once they fin finally let us out. But it's not like we killed the guy. I think it's just messing with the court's crime too. Well, I think they should look past it. Given that there's nothing else to eat. I swore I heard them. <laughs> this game is like a beacon of all women who used to post AO3. They can't help themselves. They are drawn to a drag against the cults of society. <laughs> will the staff will the staff here admit that they didn't give us a food though? And before that, you're going to tell them that a demon killed them? Really? That'll fly. Listen, you're overthinking the hell out of this. Are we doing this or not? Uh, Andrew, I'm expecting an answer. Uh, um, yeah. Alright then, let's find something to butcher him with. Oh my god. <laughs> They're actually doing it! The I mean, if you're, if you're that desperate for food, I get it. I so get it. So, you get the arms, I'll handle the legs? First you- Oh, oh, we get to choose? We get to choose? Okay, chat, which one should we choose? Chat, you're coming on this adventure with me. Should we do right or left? Right? Left, left, left. Okay, I'm getting a lot of lefts. I'm getting a lot of lefts. Okay, there's a lot of lefts in here. There's there's a lot of lefts in here. <laughs> okay, I'll do I'll do left. Always get rid of the left first. Left is the devil's side. Okay, we'll do the left first. Next up is oh okay, right arm. We can't carry him out in the open like this. 
Just be quick about it. No. Can't you go get something plastic? Can you go get some plastic bags or something? I'll take care of the rest in the meanwhile, I, I guess. Thanks so much for the follow. I'm counting on you, Andy. Don't call me that. You hand in the cleaver. Okay, here we go with some plastic baggies. Get some plastic baggies. Get some plastic baggies. Uh, can we use something in here? You can probably still plastic bags. They're also full already. They're not carrying any everything to eat inside the trash bag. Find something else. Uh, okay. Let's look in. Maybe mom and dad's room? Uh, no, not in here. Uh, what about here? The laundry room. I actually must return this here. Oh, plastic bags. Okay, cool. We found it. Is this pork? Just a lot more of it. Gotta be the right balance. Extreme muscly base, but the meat has to. Why are we actually discussing how. How? Okay. Why are we actually discussing how meat tastes? Or like human flesh tastes? Human tastes like lean pork. New stream. New stream idea. Try human meat. Got it. Got it. Got it, chat. Got a left arm. Got a left leg. Got a right leg. Got a right arm. A small problem presents itself. The plastic bags aren't big enough to fit the whole torso in them. Crap, I didn't think we cut through the spine either. Just fold them over? I don't think that's going to work. Watch and learn! Yeah, see, if anyone happens to be looking out their window, it'll be a disaster. Maybe if I use two bags? Listen, this isn't going to- Ta-da! Ta-da! <laughs> good god, no! Don't make me laugh like this. I don't have the power to make you do anything, Andrew. Alright, alright, enough. Gather the lens up and go. There shouldn't be plenty- There should be plenty enough in there- In them for- In our freezer. I'll stuff the torso and the head in this freezer for now. Then I'll go cook at something while you're at it. Yeah, you'll cook with quite something. Did you lens up to free? Oh, okay, okay, okay. Let's go, let's go, let's go. He placed a separate lens in the freezer. Now, which one do you want to eat? Which one do we eat, chat? Which one do you want to eat? Which one should we eat? Leg? Left leg? Okay, lucky. Okay, but which one? Left leg, left leg, right leg. Okay, everyone at least wants a leg. Leg has more meat. Leg has more meat. Right leg. Right leg or left leg? Okay, I'm gonna choose leg. Now, now type either right or left. Type either right or left. Right, right, left, 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 right. It's pretty even, actually. I think left. I think everyone's choosing left. Everyone wants left. Okay, I'm choosing left. Alright, time to cook. Alright, time to cook. You fry some- I hate this cute music! <laughs> ah, I hate this cute music! You fried some meat! Do 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 do! <laughs> Dinner, Teddy! Right, so what are we having here? Pure deliciousness is what? Eat up! You first. Mm -hmm. Huh? What? Oh, you already... Okay. Eat, Andrew. You will not waste this. Um, right. Andrew takes a bite out of your cooking. I don't think he likes it. He begins retching. No, you shouldn't! Oh my god, she's literally me. She's literally me. She's literally me. I want to feed Big Brother. Oh. Swallow. All of it. Well, well, how is it? It's... God, I hate picky eaters. I made this with love. 
So you're not leaving the table before you've licked a clean the plate clean. Quit your nagging, woman. Then quit your gagging, you big baby. I want to make Big Brother gag. I want to make I want I want Big Brother to gag me. I'll eat it, all right? Just give me a minute. Under your watchful eye, he slowly finishes his plate. God damn it, you guys are so silly. Good boy, I'm so proud. <laughs> Good boy, I'm so proud. Okay, please don't, please don't spam, please don't spam. If you already did it once for, for a bonk, don't do it again for a while. Come on, like, be, be for, be for fucking real chat, come on. I see a lot of people doing it multiple times. I know, I know, I get it. You guys are I wanting to have so much fun with this, but it does affect stream. Just do, just do it once. Just do it once, and then just cool down yourself, and then do it again. Okay? Otherwise, I'm gonna have to take it away, and I don't want to take it away. Don't want to give you- I don't want to take it away from you guys, okay? So true, Ophie! So true, Ophie! Thank you for the brap! Thank you, thank you. Good boy, I'm so proud! Just fuck off, Ashley. Put an odd way to say thank you. Yeah, yeah. Thanks a bunch. I'll clear the table, so leave me alone. We've got a very limited set of spices left, but what do you think I should try next? Uh, I don't know. Maybe... Cor coriander? Alright, I'll try that tomorrow then. I'm off to bed now. Night night! Yeah, good night. Okay, I guess we go bed. We go sleep in Big Brother's bed. Oh, no, it doesn't let us sleep in Big Brother's bed. No, I hate it here. You fall asleep, fully conscious with your life decisions. Blank says she likes you. Oh my god, she's literally me. Who? My friend from school. Or at least I thought she was a friend. So you're going to be her boyfriend? Gross. No. <laughs> I should teach her a lesson. You are my brother. Mine! I'll make her think twice before stealing another woman. Oh yeah, you're a girl too. What's that supposed to mean? <laughs> Somehow you don't count as a lady in mine. Or as a person for that matter. Screw you! I am the most person personless lady in the world. So anyways, I'm gonna make her... But oh, sorry. Yoshi, please, stop. <laughs> Yoshi, no! He's pulling on my seat, I'm sorry. So anyways, I'm gonna take her to that old warehouse and lock her in one of the crates. Yeah, yeah. Seriously! Mom gave me some money to go buy groceries. Are you coming with? Focus, Andy! Let's, let's leave her sitting there all night. That'll show her. Let's not. <laughs> You should go and ask her to hang out. She won't say no then. Lele, I don't want to. Just go over and ask her to come with you. I'll take her to the warehouse and we'll see what happens. Come on. Mom said you'd help me with anything. I thought she's your friend. Well, I thought so too. And she can be my friend again afterwards. She just needs a reminder. She just needs a reminder how to do it proper. We'll get in trouble. I'll only let her on when she promises not to tell on us. <sighs> Do it, Andy. I guess. Hooray! You're the best! Today's episode is titled Andy and Lele and that and the bitch in a box. Damn! One day you're you'll be a bitch in the box and your friends will take turns pissing on the ground above. What do I do about these hussies around you? Where do you learn these words? The bitch is you. I'll take you out to play, and when I'm done, I'm back into the box with you. I really ought to kick your ass one of these days. Dude, she's literally me. She's quite literally me. What's taking him? He wouldn't have forgotten our plans, wouldn't he? Ooh. Finally! Huh? What are you doing here? Surprise! I wanted to hang out with you too! Oh. I mean, I guess that's fine. Say, 
Did you tell your mom you're here? No. Why? <laughs> Just wondering. I mean, I'm surprised she let you come hang out with the boy. No way. She thinks I went to study with Julia. Why are you here, Ashley? Divine intervention. What's that even mean? It means she's full of crap. Don't listen. So? Are we going inside or what? Is that allowed? I'll allow it! Let's find a way in right now! Oh my gosh, she's so psychotic! I love her! She's literally me! Uh... Go through... Go through here, right? Uh... Got hammer! Uh oh! We could go up here! Like that. Drop off from the other side of the window is too high. Though, I wouldn't mind convincing to jump anyways. To maybe twist her ankles, maybe break her neck. Is something wrong? Nah, but we can't go in this way. Okay. Um, maybe here? Why'd they nail this metal sheet thing to the wall? Looks like there's a hole behind it. Perfect! Tear it open! What? I can't do that. It's okay, I won't tell anyone. As in, I literally can't do it, dumbass. Not without some tools, at least. Huh? Even though it's this flimsy? Yes. I like smart guys over beefy ones. Who asked? <laughs> She's so me! Oh my god! She's quite literally me! Okay, uh... Oh. Steel mallet. Can I take away a mallet be useful in this situation? I sure can! As in, help us get into the warehouse. Okay, yeah. In that case, no. Ugh, Lele. I don't even want to know what you had in mind. What are you guys talking about? It's nothing. Let's keep looking. Uh... Are you sure I can't do this? Oh! Oh, okay, 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 okay. Yeah, there's a mean girl. I, okay, I am not a mean girl, but it's anything to be with my big brother, okay? Listen, listen. As long as you're not getting in my way of my target, I will be very, very nice to you. However, if you get in the way of my target, it's game over, buddy. It's game over. Don't get in my way. Don't ever get in my way. <laughs> you use the back of the hammer to pull out the nails. <coughs> wow, it sure is <coughs> kind of dusty here. Makes me worry about my asthma. It's fine, it's fine. Oh, I know. How about some hide and seek? Ugh, you're such a kid. Huh? And he wants to play too! You do? What? Oh, yeah, sure. See? Well, I mean, it's fun every once in a while. You totally want to play too, you child! <laughs> uh, I'll be it. I'm gonna count to ten. Hundred. Count to a hundred at least. Oh, okay, okay. One, two... All right, let's find a good box to shove her in. You still want to do that? Of course! She's... She said no one knows she's here. This is perfect! Lele... You promised! Now hurry up before she's done counting! Okay, we gotta shove her in a box, pretty much. Okay, um, I guess that box over there? Oh, now this will do. There isn't any lock on it, though. We don't actually want to lock her in. The hell we don't?! Place a stick or something in between the rings. That'll keep it closed. Won't the stick just break? No, well... If she's hunched inside, I doubt she had leverage to... Ready or not, here I come! Oh, crap! She's count she counts too fast! It wasn't that fast, really. <laughs> Let's hide! Hide! Okay, okay, we gotta hide. Where do we hide? Oh, 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 here. This crate can't be closed. Do we just hide here? Oh. This container's already full. Where do we hide? Oh. You're not done here. Oh, okay, okay, okay. There we go, there we go. Where do we get a stick anyways? And he picks up whatever wooden debris is at his feet. I guess this will do. Mm. 
Well... What do you think? Is she pretty? The stick? No, what do you think, dumbass? Ah, uh, she's fine, I, I guess. Mm. <laughs> Found you! Both of you. Who hides in the same spot, idiots? <laughs> it, it was my spot first! Then you're it! No way. And he stole my spot, so he's it! Yes, yes. I'll go count. Addie goes to count outside. <laughs> My hiding spots are the best. I know a really... I know a really good one for you. Come take a look. Um, okay. Oh, man, we're gonna put her in the box, aren't we? Oh, my fucking god, we're gonna put her in the box. Think you'll fit in here? Seems like a bad idea. How so? I'm gonna get my clothes dirty. Oh, boo-hoo, who cares? My mom does. She'll get mad if I... Hundred! Oh, shoot. He's coming. Hurry, hurry! Uh, okay. Hastily, your friend hops inside the crate. Huh? Huh? What was that? <laughs> I got you now! It's too weak to throw you off the lid. <laughs> this isn't funny, Ashley. Let me out! There you are, Andy, you slowpoke. Hurry, she's putting up a fight. <coughs> I can't breathe. <coughs> Is she all right? <coughs> Please, I... <laughs> Shut up already, you drama queen. Let her out, Lele. She's just pretending. No one ever died from some dust. <coughs> Come on, just let her out. What? You'll believe her over me? It's, it's not. Really about whether I believe her or not. Fine, you let her out then. Who cares about me anyways? <coughs> everyone likes her better. Bet you like her better too. But everyone already knows. <coughs> but you'd rather have a girlfriend that's been tied with me. Of course you would. Oh, come on already. I don't want that. <coughs> I mean, maybe she did, but... <laughs> it's not fair! <laughs> Why does everyone like her better? I'm loud and weird and annoying and no one likes me at all! <laughs> I like you better, Lele. Ruben, liar. <sighs> I knew it. Maybe you'd have more friends if you weren't always so... Did I not just say? La 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 Talk sure is cheap! God damn it. <laughs> there, are you happy now? <laughs> yes. Just until morning, okay? Yes, you're the best! I like you the best, Andy. Damn. You hear that? You can stay here until morning. No, please! <laughs> Ashley! Let me out, please! <laughs> Ashley, wait, don't <laughs> go! <laughs> Ashley, please! <laughs> Ashley! Ashley, are you awake? <laughs> oh, never mind, she's schizo, yeah. <laughs> she's so schizo. Least favorite part of the game is finally over, let's fucking go. I know, that was kind of uncomfy. I'm gonna. Is that kid? Dead. My prediction is that she's dead. You think she murdered a child? Yeah, no spoilers. Yeah, no spoilers. No spoilers, chat. No spoilers. I am now. Um, okay. What is it? Nothing. I, it's just. God, what the fuck did we do? You're still on about dinner? Fine, just starve then. More for me! How are you like this? Are you out of your mind? Listen, I didn't kill the guy, so I didn't do anything wrong. You mutilated, you mutil you mutilated and ate a corpse. What else are we supposed to do? Call the warden and let him know he died? Uh, yes. Um, sir, he summoned a demon and then died. I swear we didn't do it. Y yeah, uh, we... <laughs> 
we wouldn't have to admit that we were there. We could have just told him to go check on the guy. Andrew, what the hell? What? What the hell? We didn't both agree on this? I could have sworn it, your it was your suggestion in the first place. I was too hungry to think straight, okay? Now that's some bullshit. But fine, let's assume it was so. What do you want me to do about it? I... Whoosh, whoosh, there goes my magic wand. There, I've absolved all of your sins, so you never took a bite now. You're welcome. <laughs> well, gee, thanks. We'll see how that holds in the face of the law. Listen, who cares? Ugh. It isn't like something extremely circumstan- It's not like- th th oh, Sorry. <laughs> this isn't like some extreme circumstances stuff. Like, can we be excused? It's the water company's fault. First, they lock us in for months, and then they won't even feed us? And is cabin fever a real thing? Maybe we can plead insanity. I don't know, Ashley. <sighs> there, there, there. You know, I... I couldn't get his head off. Huh? He didn't fit in the freezer proper. So I needed to chop his head off. But I couldn't cut it. His spine was too... Ugh. Anyways, I kind of just... Uh, like a cutting around and pulled it off. Like some plant, I don't know. I keep thinking about it. Ugh, I can't fucking sleep, Ashley. It's... Come here. I don't know what's wrong with you. How are you so unbothered? I don't know. I compartmentalize. Kinda like we're compartmentalizing the guy in, into different freezers. Ashley. <laughs> Andrew, what is it, Andrew? 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 Andy? I I told you to stop calling me that. We're not kids anymore. <sighs> this makes me hit the desk chat. Laura's outside the door with her with her change at the No 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 they don't know I gave them I gave them in full cash. It's fine, they didn't give it I, I told them to keep the change. <laughs> hit the desk. I can't fucking breathe. I can't breathe. Idol kiss, mwah. Idol big bro kiss, mwah. <laughs> I told you to stop calling me that. We're not kids anymore. Then why are you crying like such a big, like such a baby? I'm not crying. Wah, wah, mommy, the big bad me did an evil thing. You shut your horn. Oh my fucking god. Oh my god. You shut your whore mouth. <laughs> Don't say you like that. No, I, I kind of did. I, I kind of did. Nah, this is... Listen, chat. This is my one time to just be degenerate for the fucking year, okay? Let me have this. Let me have this. Let me have this, okay? Make me, you little bitch. <laughs> Forget this. Hey, Andy. Remember when we used to go on adventures? What? Handy and Lele's quest for something or another, remember? Why bring this up? Isn't this just another one of those? I don't know. Can't you just play along for now? Until we're out of this crappy situation. Then we can unpack it all later. Or not. I don't think I will personally. You could go to therapy. Like, I could tell a therapist what I've been up to. Alright, just a thought. Let's just get out of here. Like, we should have done month months ago. Not if we've got food. Don't you want to keep waiting until they let us out? Hell no, I don't. They throw us in jail right after. And I don't know which is worse. Withering in this coffin of a house or getting railed in prison. Ah, so you want to escape not only this quarantine, but the consequences of our actions as well. Preferably, yeah. This episode is titled Andy and Lele to escape from the coffin. 
Yeah, whatever. I'm going to sleep now. Good night. Sleep tight. I'll try. Good night. I love you, Andy. Show that Andy jug up your ass already. My god, I don't love you that much. Ugh. You make me want to kill myself. Too bad diving down the balcony is just too romantic for you. Pill hits your face so hard you see stars. <laughs> okay, chat, before we continue on, first of all, I'm going to be standing for the rest of the stream because I need to stand. So I am going to unlock my desk real quick and then bam. Yeah, okay. So while it's standing up, chat, I gotta ask you. How has my voice acting been so far? I gotta ask you guys, like, how, how has the voice acting been for you guys? Um, 10 out of 10, great, pretty good. 10 out of 10? For every second Yeti stands, chat needs to do a push-up, get swole bros. Good, pretty good, solid, solid 9 out of 10, great. 10 out of 2, pretty good, damn. 7, seven out of 5, you're certainly cute, giving the subject matter. Andrew is okay, Ashley is 10 out Yeah, I, I, I'm not good at guy voices, but... Actually, I knew I could fucking nail. Really good. Thank you. 10 out of 10 liquid. Pretty good. Thank you. Thank you. Not me because of love idol. Actually, unironically good. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you so much. Plumbers outside your door. Out of 10. Fuck you. Fuck you. Everything is great. Andrew is all right. Yeah, I, I had a feeling. I can't do. I can't do guy voices. I can't do, I can't do guy voices, but I knew Ashley I would be able to do like really, really good on. So sorry if my Andrew sucks, uh, but, but uh, I'm so glad you guys like my Ashley voice. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> okay. Oh, I didn't get to read that. What was that? So is there a knock at our door? This is what I'm understanding. Oh, so what's going on? Wait, I didn't read that. I didn't get to read that. Where's Andrew? Your body is worth delicious nutrients from the food you ate. So where's Andrew? Is Andrew over here, maybe? Oh, he is over here. Hey there. Good morning! What you up to? I'm looking at the steam and summoning instruction manual book thing. Brave, given that things turned out so well for that cultist guy. Debatable. I mean, he was successful up to the point he lacked an offering. Anyways, it says that demons don't think much of humans. Well, that's good. We'll have something in common then. Yeah, yeah. So, there's only- So they're only willing to do business as long as there's a quick and easy for them. I take it you want to ask one to get us out of here? Well, I wouldn't want to get out of here the same way the cultists did. But I do think this is our best bet for now. So what will we ask from it? I don't know yet. Okay, then what will we bargain with? I don't know that either. Nice. I just barely woke up. Give me a minute. It says here demons prefer human souls. So obviously it's gotta be that. Where to get a soul while stuck in here? Hmm. What are you looking at? Oh, nothing. Ashley. What? I wouldn't. Thought about it, I see. Let me keep my thoughts to my own. Don't we already share enough? One second, though. Let's not do this. Oh, come on! I'm not gonna sacrifice you! We'll figure something out. Let's just set, a, set the ritual up for now. What's the need? Thanks so much for the follow! Thank you, thank you! I'm not done reading this yet, but you can start by replacing the candles for now. Okay, so we gotta get more candles? Uh huh. Must be able to hide in. Okay, I guess it's good to know for now. Got one candle. Got two candles. Replace candle. Okay, replace the candle here. Okay. Done. What now? Now we. Oh shit! <gasps> holy fuck! Holy fuck! Still alive and kicking, aren't you? You've been quiet. You've been quiet lately, pal. I'm getting a little worried here. Uh. <sighs> yeah, hi, hello. One of my guys isn't answering. The weird one. I think he croaked, but he's just a B-type anyways. <sighs> Fine. I'll check it after my rounds. 
The Warren's footsteps move away from the door. Is that all we would have to do to get this door open? Just shut up for two days? Oh shit, he's coming in and he sees all this. No, 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 no. Enough, go stall him at our door. I'll clean this up. He's still gonna find the guy missing. Unless he checks the freezer, which is where all his blood is pointed at. No, fuck. Go, before he notices we're not home. And keep him and keep him until I've mopped up all the blood. Maybe then he'll assume the guy jumped off the balcony or something. There should be there should be a quartz below then. You get to be that quartz if you don't get going already. Okay, okay, we gotta mop up the fucking blood. Oh uh, shit. That just sounds like feces. You feel zero inclination of investigating any further. Okay, okay. Um, fuck. What are you gonna do? Look, get the mop, you ba Okay, okay, we gotta get the mop. We gotta get the mop. Just wait behind the door for with a knife? Jeez. Yeah, I probably could. Okay, okay, let's get let's get the mop. Let's get the fucking mop. Oh wait, oh wait, that's that's the Shit shit. This soundtrack is really good, by the way. Is that shit real I actually like this soundtrack so much. Okay. Ashley, the warden's coming in. Oh, shit, 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 shit. <coughs> huh? What are you doing here? Oh, shoot! Sadly, the warden soon calls over his buddy. He can take it back to your apartment, after which you and your brother wicked- <gasps> Guess what? It went so badly for you that I'm going to let you try- Eh? Is that it? What? Did we not leave? We got bad end? Ah, oh, that was bad end. It's game over. We can retry. We can retry. We can retry. Ashley, the warning's coming. Okay, okay, okay. okay. No, 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 hold on, I get it. Listen, this isn't it. Okay, okay, I got it, I got it. No, 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 I get it, 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 I get it. Okay, okay. You hit in the cut. Okay, okay, I got it, I got it, I got it. Greetings and salutations. Huh? Anybody at home? Oh, great, another suicide. What the? How did you get in there? <gasps> oh! <laughs> uh -huh. That face. Wow, that face. Quite literally me. Quite literally me when my big brother saves me. Wow, so me. She's so me. Oh my gosh, she's so me. She's so me. <sighs> Oh my god, she's so me. <laughs> she's so me. Andrew doesn't seem too pleased with you right now. You wonder if it's a good time to tell him none of this is your fault. Come on then, Lele. Let's go play. Sheesh, I thought I got caught there. You did. Happens to the best of us. Aren't they like in their 20s? Okay, so what do we do? Wait, what do we do? What do we do? You're missing something. Am I missing something? Oh, the body? The warden is very dead. Well, you've done it now, Andy. You've actually killed a man. Like, directly. Yep. I was a little surprised there. <laughs> so where's your mental breakdown? I'm saving it for later. Lay off. Yeah, well, see how you sleep after this one, huh? Ashley, I'm not in the mood right for your shit right now. I... Oh, looky here! <gasps> key! We got key! So can we, like, exit here? <gasps> At last, you unlock the door and...
I love Kamedon. I love Kamedon. 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 I didn't know there was a Kamedon scene in here. I didn't know there was a Kamedon scene in here. Oh my fucking god. I didn't know there was like a fucking Kamedon scene in here. Fuck, 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 fuck. It so counts. No, it so counts. You don't get it. You don't get it. It counts. No, it fucking counts. I don't care what you guys say. I don't care what you guys say. I don't care. It so counts. Listen, as a woman, it counts, okay? Before we go, Ashley. Huh? I just wanna make sure we're on the same page about something. Whatever excuse we had for eating that other guy, just went out the window because of your screw up. Oh, I'm sorry. Did I ask you to kill him? What do you think is going to happen if I hadn't? Look, I'm not saying I'm not grateful, Andrew. I am. But what's your point? My point is that no matter what happens beyond this door, you won't speak a word of what went down here. To anyone. Yeah, obviously. Obviously. And it'll no, no doubt be obvious we did something. Once this guy shifts in and the next warden comes in looking around, it's best if we disappear while we can. Well, as you might have noticed, I'm trying. Yeah, see? I'm not sure you're grasping the gravity of our situation here. Knowing you, you think you're going to find mom and dad. But I'm saying all of that is off the table. I hadn't planned anything yet, actually. God, that's even worse. I... Okay, so you want me to never contact anyone I know ever again? Because you think they'll snitch on us for to the authorities? Is that it? Yes, exactly. Yeah, fine. Whatever. If you're going to be this flipping about this, it's, it isn't the authorities you need to worry about. What's that supposed to mean? Are you threatening me? Listen, listen, listen. Consensual Kamedon is so nice. I'm not going to jail just because you think of yourself as in previous two consequences. So you're going to take this to your grave, even if I have to put you in there myself. This is so sex. How is this allowed? Is this a chat? Is this allowed? Chat, is this allowed? Chat, is this even allowed? Is any of this allowed? Is any- is any- is that- Chat, is any of this allowed? I don't know anymore! Is any of this fucking allowed? Is any of this allowed? <laughs> where did my phone go, actually? What the fuck? Yoshi, where did mommy's phone go? Are you sitting on it? No, you're not. Okay, never mind. I'll find it later. Fuck it. You don't scare me, Andrew. This makes me hit the desk. This makes me- This makes me hit the desk. Hold on, I gotta- I gotta- I gotta- THIS MAKES ME HIT THE DESK! THIS MAKES ME HIT THE DESK! Can I just like kiss already? Can I just like have sex already? <sighs> this is a threat of actual violence, it's not sexual- No. Don't give me- oh, don't give me a reason to fuck. FUCK! FUCK! <laughs> don't give me- oh, I can't even voice out without just like... Going so right in the face. I know that there's so much fucking sexual tension! Andy, it snows in hell that day I'm afraid of you! Now back the fuck off! Who do you think you're talking to? It's... I'm stressed out lately. Yeah, I can see that. I need to know you're taking this seriously. There's a half-dead guy in our freezer with my fingerprints all over it. Trust me, I'm in no hurry to tell the world about it. Huh? All good? Can we go now? Yeah, I guess. 
He flushed when she yelled. I know she. He flushed when she yelled at him. Like what? Ah! Okay, finally. Though, Andy, what? I don't give a rat's ass about mom or dad or any of my so-called friends anymore. None of them felt it, it necessary to even answer my calls, or come fling flu, fl uh, fling food, uh, or or come fling food up our balcony. Would be quite the feat to throw something so high. There's no point to, and there's no, the point is no one even came to try. So my affections officially died with all the brain cells I lost while starving. Oh my god, me too, bitch. Me too, Umfi. Like, me too. Me too. <laughs> ha! But it's alright, because Andy is here with me. Even though he feels like threatening me for some reason. I'm sorry. I guess I lost some brain cells too. Can't lose what you don't have! Oh, fuck you. <laughs> all right, all right. Let's get the hell out of here already. Okay. Wait, I like they're mad. It says fuck off. I like that. Whoa! Kick and Dove, thank you so much for subscribing to tier one. Thank you, thank you. Welcome to, be, welcome to becoming a young subscriber. Thank you, thank you, friend. Thank you so much. I love that doormat. I need that doormat. Okay, so I guess, can we leave, or...? Actually, where are these notes on here? Hold on. A note on the door says 2XA, 1XB. Are these, like, equations? 1X0, but it's crossed over. So maybe they died. Can we, can we exit? The door staircase is locked. So an emergency exit this is. Okay. So I, I'm guessing we can't use the elevators out of order because of because it is a course. So okay. So can't use that. Can we go back into these like our apartment? This is all it took to keep us in the, in a wooden board. It's okay, Andy. I don't have much muscle either. Your eyes, you, your eyes say you're trying to comfort me, but your words do the opposite. Ah, uh, whatever. What's this slip of paper say? 2XAB. What's that supposed to mean? Oh, is that like the types? Because remember, they, they said like, a piece of like A type or B type or something? Yeah, 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 Cookie okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, so they must have like a, like, I, like, I don't think they're blood types. I don't think so. Yeah, let's just focus on getting out of here. They can't be blood types. Unlock the door. Okay. Okay, so I'm guessing, I mean, we don't really have much to do here. So I guess we gotta go to this 401. Oh? Oh, got a key to room 302. Okay, okay, okay. 302? Hold on, is there anything else in that room? Nothing on the fridgeries. Notice, from now on, AB types will be given supplies, except for if it's someone important. And no, the lady from 302 being hot doesn't count as important. Stop asking. Okay, 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 so this is... I'm guessing this is like the warden's office? It's a toilet, there's nothing of interest inside. Oh, there's another key right there, hold on, hold on. Looky, they've got a little surveillance camera! Oh crap, are we on it? No, it looks like it's recording the second floor. Hmm, let me see. Great, there's another warden there. Is that a gun holster? Did the... Did the warden we kill have one? Let's go... Let's go shoot this guy. Nope, he only has a key to the cultist room and a walkie-talkie. <sighs> Think there's a warden on every floor? Nah, they're probably working in a pairs of two. It's not like they have to do anything else than to keep curious people away. I pretend to feed us, I guess. Well, even then, how are we getting around him? Don't ask me. Ah, there's a key here. Fourth floor key, okay, cool. Okay, let's go check the the prison or the warden real quick. See if he has anything on him. Okay, no, he doesn't. He doesn't. So then I'm guessing can we go here maybe? No. Oh, maybe we can go here? Go to Oh, we can go to the third floor now. 
Oh, and there's a room for 302. This is where the hot lady is at, right? Hold on, let's read all the notes. A note from the door to B. There's two B types in there, and then one X, one A type. Okay. Oh! It's the hot girl! Hey, hold up! Wait, 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 I wanna give her- Can I give her a valley girl accent? Can, can I give- Chat, can I give her a valley girl accent? She looks like a valley girl. Like, I feel like she would get valley girl vibes. Can I give her a valley girl accent? Yeah, she's pretty hot, all right. She gives valley girl. Hey, hold up! Don't you dare come any closer. Who are you? Your neighbor's from upstairs? What are you doing here? Get out! Well, we found the key and thought you might want to get out of here. You thought wrong. Get lost. Huh? What don't you understand? You don't want to get out of here? That's what I said. Why would I want out? I get free food. I can play games all day long. I live like a king. I hope this quarantine never ends. Wait. Wait, wait. They're actually bringing you food? Of course. Literally anything I want. All you gotta do is ask nicely. Like, bend over and open wide nicely. Ashley. Fuck you! Get out, both of you! Okay. Well, that was something. How can we get such different treatment? Why don't I get food? Guessing you're just not pretty enough. You think she's pretty? I mean, wasn't she? Whatever. It's okay to leave her there after she saw us, though. Probably not. But you go in there swinging your claver, and she'll definitely scream. Then the second warning comes and it shoots us. Ugh, this is so hopeless. I think our best bet is to finish the ritual and use it, use it to get rid of the second warden. Hmm, well... If we can get this woman up to the cultist room, we've got us a soul to offer. How on earth are we going to convince her lazy ass to even leave her room? Beats me! Let's just finish setting up the ritual for now. Alright. Okay. Do you really think I'm not pretty enough? Oh, come on. So ugly I am I that I shouldn't even be fed? Or maybe they didn't think it'd be fun to screw you while I'm loitering around the house? Oh, yeah. Okay. Fair point. And I wouldn't let them anyways. Oh, he's so protective. Go to the fourth floor. Okay, let's get it. We're gonna finish setting up the ritual then. So how do we finish setting it up? Can we go here? So let's need to finish this ritual setup. Draw some runes on the floor with blood. Not sure what ruins though. I'll just redraw what the guy had already drawn. They seem to they seem to work. The rune is fade out. Okay, so can we take the blood from here? You don't take the warrant also has a gun and take it away something, but all you find is a walkie-talkie. Useless. I don't know. At least we hear if the other warden tries to contact this one. Which then indicates time is running out for us. Big deal! At that point we're screwed anyways. Hey, what if we call the warden over with this and have the demon eat his soul? That's not a bad idea, actually. Two birds with one stone! Though he'll come in guns blazing. Oh, right. Ah, uh, let me think about this. Got walkie-talkie? While he's at it, you dip your fingers into the dead warden's wound. Got blood! Wow, we got blood! Okay, one, two, three, four, five. I have an idea. Oh? Let's have the lady from downstairs lure the warden up here with the walkie-talkie. And, uh, how are we going to make her do that? You know how. Huh. All right, then. Let's go condense her. Or is that something else that you still needed to be set up? Just lighting the candles and turning on, on the audio. But I think it's best to do that once the warning is on his way. Yeah, wouldn't want to keep the demon waiting. Okay. So I guess we're gonna go back downstairs. We're gonna go back to the lady. The hot lady. Yay! 
you two again? Sorry, sorry. This, this, there's one last thing we forgot to ask you. What? I thought I made myself clear. Huh? What, what do you want? Hey, get, get off me! <laughs> What's going to happen now is like you'll cool into this walkie talkie. H huh? Tell them like you and his friend are. L tell them that you and his friend are looking for a good time up in room 405. I, I don't understand. You only need to understand we'll slit your throat if you don't play nice. N no, please! I'll do anything! I'll tell him anything! We'll see. Press the walkie talkie on. H hello Huh? Who's there? H Hi, Dave! It's me! Where's Malcolm? Um, Malcolm's here with me in room 405. Did you, uh, care for a quick visit? A quick visit? Huh? I mean, if you want to have a good time, that is. <laughs> Well, I'll be. I'm always up for a good time. Oh wait, wait, wait. I got. I gotta give him like. A, I gotta give him another voice. I gotta give him sort of worm. Can I get all the worms a southern voice? I think I should give them a southern voice. Well, I'll be there. I'm always up for a good time. If you know what I mean, hit <laughs> hit. What is it? Room four oh five. I guess that we are really croaked. Um, hit <laughs> hit. Nothing. I'll be right up there, sweet cheeks. All right. All right. Good. Let's go. I let go of her now. What do you think she'll do? I won't do anything. I promise. Go finish it. I'll keep her quiet until it's done. Mm. What? Get going, dumbass. Fine. Oh, yeah. I almost forgot. Lele, catch. You throw something. A lighter. Okay. You hurry back up and finish the ritual. Okay, okay. Cool, cool, cool. Uh-uh. One. Two. Three. Ah! Nah! There we go, three. Mr. Julie must light the candles and turn on the music. Okay, okay, and turn on the music. Yes. So what am I supposed to do? Ah, oh, something is there. Who are you? I can't see! Are you oh, wait, wait, hold on, I gotta do my demon voice. Are you asking me my name, human? Uh, yikes, did I mess up? I don't want to pay it for its name. I'm here. It's kind of dark, huh? And I'm not doing it with this kind of music on. Let's... Shock, the one reaches for his gun. Uh, him! I offer him! What the? Ah! So, uh... So, uh, well, how is it? Human. Wait, human, what color soul? I give you this. Got an uh, unidentifiable small object. Okay. Hold it for an occasion. Clever any dream. To gauge the troubles ahead. Thank you. The entity has left. And you're still alive, unlike either of the wardens. Man, that all happened way too fast. In the end, I didn't get its name, nor to ask for a favor. It just did whatever it wanted. And it definitely just gave me whatever trash was lying around in its demon pockets. Oh, thank you for the hydrates, guys. Thank you, thank you. I'm gonna need it. I, that demon voice actually kind of destroys my throat pretty fast. <clears throat> it's time not to linger on the fact that your soul is apparently a viscous pitch black mess. Guess you already knew that. Okay, let me double check everything. Make sure I'm not gonna- I feel like we're, we're not gonna come back here. Oh! Got a key to the second one, got a gun. At last, time to shoot Andy. Just kidding. I'll probably shoot the lady, though. Nothing else? Nothing else? Yeah, I guess that's it. Yeah. Yeah, nothing else. Let me make sure. Okay. That's fine. I feel like we're not gonna come back up here soon, so like I wanna make sure we got like I got everything that I can get. It's real quick. I'm just gonna go back over here real quick. I just wanna double check I get everything. Mm. 
Meat, yum yum, okay. Let me make sure there's nothing here. Yeah, I just feel like we're not gonna come back after this. I have a feeling, at least. They fucked in there. They fucked in there. Is the guy still in the freezer? Yeah, he's still in the freezer. Nothing? Nothing here? Okay, okay. I just wanna double check. Okay. I think that's it. Yeah. I just have a feeling we're not gonna come back up here, so. Okay, go to third floor. And we're gonna go to 302. Sadly, your plans are spattered by the lady's brains on the wall. <gasps> Ashley's hot AF. I so feel you, Umfi. She's literally me. Her corpse is already rest on the bed. Oh no, she died. What happened here? She tried shooting me with a nail gun. How on earth? I thought you were holding her in place. Well, I let go. Why? You were taking a while. I figured she would have started anything as long as I had my cleaver. Lesson learned. How interesting that you that you want to take your chances with that for no reason. What are you getting at? You did say she was pretty. Ugh. I didn't try anything with her. Yeah, yeah. And I was and I and here I was wondering why you insisted on staying behind. Andrew shoots his load while I risk getting shot by the warden. Are you unaware that the lady is dead right now? I guess she said no. Screw you, Ashley. I almost got shot too. That's your own fault for letting her go. God, I can't believe what a dumbass you are when it comes to women. For the last time, I wasn't trying to get with her. And even if I had, which I didn't, so what? She's dead now. Oh, okay. That makes it fine then. Good to know. God, I hate it when you get like this. What's your problem? Fucking every time. Every time, indeed. Every time some fucking floozy comes around. Yeah, I'm not celibate. What is it to you? It's always the same with you. You get to dip your dick in some bitches and the rest, the rest of the world disappears. Not true. Yes, it is, cockbrain. Now it's definitely not the time for this. I just need you to get your priorities straight. My priorities right now is getting out of here. Your priority should be me! Blow it out of your ass. I'm not having this argument here of all places. Hey! No! Shut up! I didn't screw the neighbor lady. And that, and on a note, will, will you will you back the fuck off of my love life, Ashley? What is that supposed to mean? Oh, I don't know. It's not like my girlfriend dumped me after you harassed the hell out of her or something. What? She told you? What a tattletale. <laughs> You're better off with the, without loose-lipped whores like that. So it really was you. Yeah. All I did was weed out the quitter for you. You're welcome. And I wouldn't harass anyone if you'd stop ignoring me when I need you. You always need something. You always have some bullshit crisis on the moment I'm supposed to be meeting up with someone. Bet you... Bet your bloody love it. I bet you bloody love it when I can't as much take a piss without you knowing. Ha! And I bet you'd love it if I killed myself then. Where did that come from? I. Uh, fuck. What a prime example of you. You! Just you! <laughs> would you? You'd you? I know it already. I'm right here. I'm right where you want me, huh? I'll do it then. I can. Just for you. You know, I have just a thing for that. Back at your beck and call just like it was way back when. What? No, screw you, Andrew. Don't act like I'm the bad guy here. I never once made you do anything. But it's always... I don't want to. I don't want to with you. Well, answer me this. What do you want then? Well, see, if I had listened to a word I said... If you listen to a word I said, you know what? Why don't you want to spend time with me anymore? I've done nothing but spend time with you for the past three months. See? Then why aren't we friends anymore? Ugh, of course we are. Just... Ugh, forget it. Can we go? Just what? Just go. No, answer me. What were you about to say? Stay then. I'm going. Oh, no, you don't! What is so bad about me? I've been looking out for you! Isn't that what siblings do? Just stop. What? Talking to me? It's not my fault! I didn't lock us in here! I didn't 
didn't kill the cultists. I didn't kill it. I didn't even kill the foreign. Which one? Neither. You did. And the demon. And I'm all innocent. I've not harmed a single soul. Of course not. You make me do it for you. I didn't make you do shit, Andrew. You chopped up the bastard all by yourself. And you chose to do everything you've done here. And guess what, Andy? Don't. You chose to walk blank, blank, blank in the crate where the fucking cunt choked. <laughs> Cry yourself to sleep to that, Andy. My poor Andy. So. That just came out of your mouth. What? It's true! You chose to do it, and you chose me! You chose me! Me! You bad cuddly fuck of a brother! You chose me! You did! You did! God, that's really hot. That's really- this is our fucking- <laughs> That's, that's kind of hot, actually. So I guess we're not leaving here together. You can do it! <laughs> you won't! You can't, cuz I'm the only one you can talk to! You can't sleep at night. You can't take it. I'm the only one who can make it go away. Fancy that. You're the reason why I can't sleep in the first place. I would like to go now. With Andy. I'm ready to go now. Go like... Blink did. Of course not! I want to leave this apartment before we get caught! With you! Can we go? I'd like to go too, but the thing is, you're pissing me off so much right now. We go and you'll just throw another fit later. Yeah, I probably will. I'll make such a scene too. Yeah, so I don't know if I can risk it. Maybe I'll end you here and I'll be done with it. Though if you can come up with a compelling reason not to, I won't. Well, I already said there are sleeping pills for that. Uh, yeah, okay. I got nothing. But I'd like to go with you very much. Though if I plan on ditching you, if you plan on ditching me anyways, then fuck you. If not going to be just the two of us, then forget it. it was us, so why does it matter? As long as it's just us, are you saying you'll behave? I'll behave if you behave. Isn't that how it goes? Who knows with you? Though, I assume we're getting out of here in the first place. Uh -huh. That's right, our quest continues. So, wh what did we name this episode again? Andy and... Okay, but I'm not gonna be Andy anymore. Huh? He's so spineless. And I hate Lele, like you wouldn't believe. Huh? So you better stay and die here with Andy. So you and I can leave. Fine. Whatever. I mean, in practice, I like you, but you're so exhausting. Nonsense. I'm invigorating. Let's leave and never revisit this conversation. Yes, I've got the keys to the second floor, and also the warden's gun. I'm surprised he didn't shoot me yet. <laughs> Maybe later. <laughs> Let's get out of here, Andrew. Oh man. Oh, that was a really good scene. Fuck. Fuck, that was a really, really good scene. That was amazing. No mental illness actually has mental cuteness. So true, Umfi. So true. What is wrong with you? No, it's like good story-wise! Not like good like, oh my gosh, she's quite literally me. It was good story- like story-wise. It- it shows like their relationship, okay? Okay? Also, that voice acting really fucked me. It is very well written. Yeah, I see you're loving to some stay here with my blood boiling. <laughs> Require relation to Tom's stuff incessant from hell. Yes. Listen, listen. I, I'm gonna, let me give you a 
a TED talk real quick, chat. I'm gonna give you a TED talk. When it comes to literally mean media, we're not supposed to like the characters, actually. We're supposed to hate them. We're supposed to like despise them. For example, American Psycho. We're not supposed to relate or like sympathize with Patrick Bateman. Yet somehow we do. Somehow we find him like, well, somehow we relate to him. And Layla and Andrew are pretty much the same thing. They're the same literally me style of media where they are deplorable people. We're they are they're not supposed to be people that we like. But we still love them. We still relate to them. That's what makes literally me media so great. Is because it taps into a lot of insecurities and like just emotional bullshit that we all go through that is not regularly talked about in media, okay? He's letting me for real, for real. You're not supposed to re That's the thing that you're not supposed to relate to them. Hold on, I'm gonna turn on my light. You're not supposed to relate to them, chat. But here we are. Still loving them. You're trying to, you're trying to decide about the characters because we are insane, yet they're so, they're, they're so confident and charismatic. Exactly. I relate to all of them. Pretty much, yeah. Like, seriously. Not everyone is in intended to be sympathetic, even if they're the POV character. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, we relate to parts and not the whole thing. But chat, have you heard of Huey Lewis in the news? <laughs> <laughs> they are literally me for real for real. He is the great, he is the greatest of us. The art, the music, the story. It's really good, fuck. Like, I get it. Incest, Mimi and all. I totally get it, chat. Hold on, take it off my, my, take it off my sweater. I get it, chat. Haha, ha, silly incest meme and everything. But it's unironically really good writing. It's ironically really good. Four is their best album. Okay, I guess we gotta get the fuck out of here. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Let me go see. Does she have anything that we could take with her? Take with us? Dead as a stone. Your happy is immeasurable. <laughs> oh, what's this? Is there something here? Oh. A nail gun. Okay. I already checked there, there's nothing there. Stop snooping around the lady's bathroom, were you? I had to wash her blood off of me. Oh, right. Excuse accepted. Thanks. Okay, just gonna- Oh, this thing- The fridge is full of food. Wow, we should probably eat that food. Looks like someone gave up in assembling their furniture. What was she watching? Does it- Does it say what she's watching? No, it doesn't. Doodles and drawings. Okay. I just said positive on Steam for a good reason. Happy Ashley is a good is good Ashley. <laughs> okay, I guess go to second floor, fourth floor. I guess second floor. Oh, is that a is that a way out? <laughs> Look, an open window. Great, jump. Tend to be not, Andrew. I mean, it is only the second floor. You really don't want to take your chances with that. Damn it! Isn't it like a rope or something that we can use to climb down? Okay, so we gotta look for a rope, I guess. Uh, oh, the rug! We can use the rug. What if we climb down with the, this window using the carpet? I'm not sure how we, how we're going to secure it though. You hold it while I descend. Oh yeah, and I'll just jump onto your arms once you're down. Would that actually work? Maybe you catch me instead. Hell no! Not worth it. We've got to set up something to hold the carpet in place while we climb down. Well, let's leave it by the window for now. Okay. Maybe we could use... This couch? No? There's a security camera there. I don't know if, like, that's okay. Um... Maybe this plant? You said they secured a carpet with. Yeah, no shit. It layers out of order. Um... Uh, Hmm. There's nothing here. Then says May sets in only that someone who has spent most of their lives with Ashley who ever stand by her long term in any capacity. So true, Umfi. Okay, what about third floor? Maybe there's something here. The chair? This carpet? The plants? Um, let's see. Oh, maybe the nail gun? Okay, the nail gun. Yeah, that's what it was. Why didn't I take it earlier? I could have taken it earlier. Go to second floor. Okay, we can nail it, right? 
Instead of you use a nail gun to nail the carpet to the wall. It doesn't look safe. There's gotta be something else. I'm going for it. If something else, maybe the carpet slows my descent down. I mean, I guess. <sighs> Alright. You first then. Damn right I go first. I am a lady. You climb down very unladylike. <laughs> I love that. You climbed down very unladylike. <laughs> so what happens now? Well, what happens now is I will skip town. We'll find a buffet restaurant. Oh! Then we'll see someone's identity or something to continue our lives. Easy peasy, huh? And then as long as we'll never come into contact with the law enforcement, we'll live a quiet life and die. You've got it all figured out. Good God, I have no idea what we're going to do, Ashley. First things first, Skippy Town and the buffet. Let's go on a real touristy location. Maybe some travel will drop their ID. Then we'll rent a place using that. And I'm sure we'll find some grunt work somewhere too. I, even then, I don't think that's going to... Shut your mouth, shut your mouth. It's all going to work. Let's, we'll, let's we'll live under a bridge or something. Like trolls! We'll eat those who won't pay the- We'll eat those who won't pay the toll to cross! <laughs> How can you laugh? It's anything but funny. How can you do anything else but laugh? Everything has gone to crap! <laughs> Keep it together. I am! Let's start by ch uh, chasing the bus. I'm happy. I'm happy to be out of there too. And otherwise? I'm a hair away from a panic attack. Thanks for asking. I didn't get to tell you before, but the friend I called while you were downstairs gave me a gift. Do I even want to know? Supposedly, I should be seeing visions from the future in my sleep now. But who knows? Well, I hope you do. I wouldn't... It would be handy when it comes to avoiding certain things. Yep, so you can relax a bit. I'll keep my sleeping eyes open. <laughs> but that also means you can't leave me now. You're stuck with me. Nothing new under the sun. Aww. Stuck, huh? Aren't you? Oh yeah, completely stuck. Ah! <laughs> Get on the bus and just- She can't! She can't! She hit Kester! Hit Kester! Hit Kester for that! Oh my god, he's literally me! She's literally me! I- Kissed. Get on the bus and drive the hell out of there. Vroom vroom, motherfucker! End of episode one! Whoa! Want to save or something? Save game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Save. Okay. Final one. Okay, I guess we'll do episode two. Fuck it. We'll do episode two. You're finishing up what's left of your lunch. The consequences of your actions have yet to catch up with you, which is nice. There's nothing interesting in the paper, right? I'm not done reading. It's been a week. The odds that there is something now are non-existent. Just let me check. Ugh. I'm bored! How much longer do we have to stay here anyways? We're almost out of money. Technically, I have money. I just can't use it without giving away where I, I am to the bank. So no money then. And I don't get why we, we want to check my ID for every fucking thing. Like, goddamn, I just want to stay at a hotel. Why do, why do you need to know who I am? I'm paying up front, aren't I? So it's not like I bail out on them. Boo-hoo, the motel is just fine. It's really not. I swear I heard gunshots last night. Or was that just you? I haven't shot anything. Yet. Ah! What? I think I left my gun back in the room. I really wish you'd be less nonchalant about everything all the time. Hey now, we can both be constantly shitting ourselves over every little thing. True, let's just get back to the motel before someone breaks in and steals the damn thing. Okay. Who is a girl there? Can we talk to her? Are you looking for something specific? 
Nah, just window shopping. Oh, in any case, may I interest you in leaving me? Oh, hello? Hello? Leave me the fuck alone. Oh my god. Hi, Yoshi. Hi, baby. And then you gotta run. Oh, just kidding. Get off the road, stupid. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Sorry. I guess we go this way. Wait, Among Us! Among Us! Sus! Ah! Among Us! Sus! The little Among Us! The little Among Us! Okay, I guess this is the motel. Eyes are a bra on the floor. Hey, get your fat ass out the way. Ass? I think you meant my awesome fat tits, you cocksucker. Move, you cow. Whatever, wanker. You tell a British person made this. Zarko bought a chemical leak in some city you've never been to. Zarko details the inst instructions for people in the area to stay home and seal their windows. Hasman workers will, will be sent to rescue people block by a block. Okay. Gondoko. It's a paper from Vegas. There's nothing worthwhile on it. Thank you so much for follow. Thank you, thank you. I suppose I should throw these in the washer while I still can. Whoa, did we sleep together? Leave it to Andrew to, ins to insist on getting a room with two separate beds. Only then to have a panic attack every other night. There is no pillow. Okay, cool. Throw the laundry in the washer. Nice. So where's the gun? Cause it's empty except for okay we got the gun nice though that's not really yours anyway whatever the warden's gun is yours now yay all done you're welcome G great thanks I really am such a sweetheart you're so damn lucky to have me yeah yeah I cook and I clean and I'm a feast for on the eyes <laughs> meanwhile what do you do watch TV all day like a slob Knock it off! Mm -hmm. You're not going to be in the news, Andy! Uh. <laughs> I should have known. Oh, what are you going to do about it, Andy? You're gonna choke me out again, are you? Are you? Do you want me to? Oh, come on. I'm kidding. It's all in good fun. I thought we were fine. We are! I'm just messing around. It's just a nickname. Get over yourself. It's the one thing I ask of you. And it's symbolic, dumbass. You and your romanticism. Shut up your ass. I don't know what I was expecting. Listen, I'm behaving. What more do you want? I mean so good to you. Are you? Because I'm getting the opposite impression here. Yeah, yeah. You think I'm so awful, huh? You want to see what it's like when I actually misbehave? I could be so much worse. Should I show you just how awful I really am? Go for it. Though, you're going to find me a lot less accommodating than Andy. And now some less important news. One of the quarantine apartments has, uh, has, has a bit of a situation. God, this is my personal <laughs> Andrew face pounce on this episode. Mine's fucking tired. He's so tired. Nothing major, just a fire that burned the whole place down. Everyone died. Yes, everyone. A representative of the water company is here with us today. Is there anything you'd like to add? Yes, my deepest consolations to the family members of the deceased. This apartment is most definitely not wholly mismanaged mess. Better burned to the ground. Damn, shit! Therefore, it's so sad that this happened. To ease the sadness, we recommend you try out Toxic Soda. We just rolled out three and new exciting flavor. Excuse me, sir. Something seems to be going wrong with your microphone. I'm sure you mean to say drink our trusty bubbly pop, popply, which happens to be our sponsor. And it doesn't even make our organs bleed out of your ass, unlike some alternatives. Damn, what the fuck is going on in this universe? Holy shit. That's what our apartment, wasn't it? Was being the correct tense in these. Did I leave the oven on? I said everyone died. Oh, that's great, isn't it? Um... They must think we died too! And all the evidence of our escapes 
let's say, have been incinerated. I wonder about that. <laughs> I told you it'll all work out. That still leave us homeless and just about penniless. Whatever. Things are clearly going to sort themselves out. I'm gonna get some sleep. Good night! I'm gonna stay up a bit longer. Maybe the late night news will have some more information on the fire. Say yourself. I sleep in that bed. <laughs> As usual, we fall asleep without a care in the world. Oh no, what's going on? Someone has entered the room. <gasps> what? Ha! 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 Oh, okay, okay. Dude, I, I... Oh my god, that actually scared the crap out of me. Ugh. Wake up! We've got to go! Get up! I had a vision! We're about to get killed! We've got to go now! Do we have everything? Do we have everything? Okay, okay. Is so you gotta go this way? Park is that way, but there's nothing interesting at this hour. Okay, okay. So, want to stay here and see if the killer actually shows up? And what did I do to deserve to get murdered by in my sleep for anyways? Might be a bit risky staying here. You don't know which direction they came from, right? Assuming anyone shows up anyways. They will, I'm sure! And you stand there and wait. And wait. Anyway, oh, they had cigarettes. <laughs> Angie lights up his fourth cigarette. Another one? Way to blow money. Blow it out of your ass. I'm bored and cold. You're probably cold because that crap messed with your blood circulation. Okay, mom. Makes you impotent too, by the way. It didn't sound like I'd be meeting any girls anytime soon anyways. Who is stopping you? Ah, uh, I said enough! Quiet, you. I thought we were hiding. Mm. Lucky for you, it wasn't the guy who you expected to come slit your throat. Though he sure looked familiar anyway. Didn't we eat that guy? Don't say that out loud. Oh, sorry. Didn't we chop up that guy up in the store? Him in our freezer? Ashley, come on! <laughs> Seriously though, I guess come I guess there's more from where he came from. Where do you suppose he was off to? Why, a sex and drug party with demons, duh. Why are you asking me? Whatever. Sounds... Should we follow him? But I'm trying to see if my, visitor co if my vision comes true or not. It's not like we both have to be here. I really don't want to stand here alone in the middle of the night. We're also curious about what the cultist lookalike is up to. Ugh, fine. You go. But come back soon. You are Andrew. Okay, shit, we're Andrew now. Whoa! Okay. Did it say we can read something here? Oh, no, 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 it's just Ashley. Okay, so I guess we're gonna follow him over here. Oh. <gasps> Wait, hold on, the door, please. Run, sucker, run. The elevator leaves before the third cultist can board. Ha 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 ha. Curse you brats. It's hey, Ashley to follow. Thank you, thank you. Okay, I guess we gotta go up here. Asking for a passcode. Oh, six, six, oh. Six, six, six? That's such a stupid password, actually. <laughs> of course, that was so fucking easy. I didn't know why I even entertained the idea of being anything else. Huh? What? Who let you in here? Sorry, I was not supposed to be here? This is a private event. Shoo shoo. Sorry, I got lost. I meant to go somewhere else. Is this the unemployment office? That's upstairs. So I'm pretty sure they're closed at this hour. Great, thanks. Let's see if any you're doing though. You're unfortunately demise if you don't beat it, you jobless jackass. 
All right, sorry to bother you, gentlemen. How could this, how could this idiot get the elevator code? Now we have to change it again. Again? <laughs> are they gonna change it? Are they gonna change it to? Are they gonna change it to like 777 or something? So I'm guessing our neighbor was part of these little guys' little club. Pretty far from the home though. Maybe they gather at multiple locations. Can't these guys actually summon demons though? I mean, our neighbor managed it eventually, but I guess I should go inside somehow and find out. Hmm. Mixed ways. Locked. Ah, why do I carry these clowns up to anyways? Decide if it was a way for it doesn't strike you, but well, you're done with your smoke and just call it quits. Then just as you're putting your smoke out, there's a key under the cigarette butt jar. Well, an employee key. Okay, 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 okay. So it goes up here. Nice. Whoa, cake! Top layer's full of cake. Lower has some paper cups. Someone's left a note. It reads, To whoever may ate my casserole, I will have your head on a plate. And the, ah, uh, the office life. Same shit, same shit, different toilet. <laughs> LMAO. It's a couple of note in trash. It reads, stop eating my lunch, you animals. Copy it. What's with the case? It's quite a bit late for a work meeting. Oh, shit, 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 shit. Did I go back down? Oh, okay, 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 okay. Ah, uh, this is going to take two trips. Grumbling, he goes. The cultist takes one of the carts down to the elevator with him. Okay. Remove paper cuts from the cart. Cleaning closet. Nothing worthwhile inside. He pulled down one of the curtains. Got a curtain. Okay. He'll be up for the other cart soon. Aww. Okay, you are yourself in the curtain like a ghost and stuff yourself inside the cart. Oh! Okay, 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 okay. I see, I see, I see. Hmm? Also, Hazley shoves a piece of cake into his mouth. So true, Ophi! As you should! Oh, Dark Lord, that is good. <laughs> I'm gonna use that for now. Oh, Dark Lord, that is so good. He carts you into the elevator. How is this cart so much heavier than the others? Ah, could it be the weight of my sins? <laughs> No! Okay, be cool, be cool. No one has to know. It's between me and the devil. Just act normal. D did I miss it? Shh! I can't see anything from here. Oh, man. Ahem! <clears throat> Whoa, this dude, this dude looks ancient. Now that I know you're all excited- Oh. Now that I know you're all excited about about the free coffee. Oh, I'm sounding like a fucking southerner again. And uh, how do okay, what kind of voice should I give him? I should give him a mm, I know you uh I know you're all excited about the free coffee, but first things first. All together now. Show yourself Lord Unknown! This is such fun! Reveal yourself to us, Lord Unknown! The cultists keep calling for the Lord Unknown for a while. It's coming increasingly clear that nothing's going to show up. Wow, look at this amateur hour. My Ashley. My Ashley. My Ashley. My Ashley. Ah! He's so, I know, he's so proud. He's so proud. Oh God, he's, he's a saint. He's he just doesn't show it, okay? He just doesn't show it. He just doesn't show it. You just, these guys just don't get it. Okay, okay, okay. My Ashley summons something on her first try. Though, that's probably not a good thing, is it? <laughs> I feel, I feel Lord of is with us today, but only in spirit. Um, I brought the cards down. Someone stole one of the cakes. I don't know who. Oh, can we have some now? Ugh. Yes, please enjoy yourselves. Oh no, no, Andrew! No, Andrew! Where are your robes? Er, sorry. The thing is, I spilled some coffee on them, huh? Idiot. Now you got your answers, you Miss Ashley. A 
Okay, can I go down? Or do I just go out through here? Hey, didn't we tell you to beat it? Oh, are there already done? How did the summoning go? Dude, ah, no! Look, man, you're ruining the whole vibe of that getup. Yeah, you can't come in here just like that again. The whole point is that we don't know who's who. You know what? I think you're right. Shame on me. I'll leave right away. Um, er, um, er, um, erm, 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 what the spruce? Erm, what the spruce? Erm, what the spruce? Just don't let it happen again. Have a good night. Okay. We miss Ashley. Ooh. Oh, I miss Ashley! Oh, I miss Ashley! Oh, my, my little sister! Oh. Are you done snooping the, on the cultists? Yes, yeah, so there's apparently a little cultist club where they all gather around for some demon treats. But they can't summon for shit. Absolutely nothing showed up. Nothing showed up in the end, on this end either. I don't understand. It was a vision for sure. There was like... You hear a car. <gasps> there he is! Th that's, that's him! That's the guy who slit her throats in my dream! Yikes, he really went in our rooms just like that. He still doubted me? Where did he get a key? Should we just leave? We're supposed to vacate the room in the morning anyways. Our stuff is still there. What stuff? We s sold most of the junk you were hoarding. And I can't live without the trash and laundry. Or I can't live without it. Well, like someone pointed it out, we can't keep wasting money on buying new clothes. I am not risking my life getting there on there to rescue your socks. It's my better bra, actually. This this new one sucks. It's still not interested. In fact, I'm somehow even less inclined now. Ah, you know nothing of my troubles. Regardless, I think we have to kill that guy, though. There's no random burglar. He's specifically out just for whatever reason. Like, somehow he tracked us down. So even if we run away now, won't he keep coming after us? That's not wrong, but... Ah, uh, and why is he still in the room? We're not even in there! Well, if it was him, I figured we're out getting food or something. So he's probably waiting to kill us upon entry. Unlikely, since he wants to go about this quietly. Um... Mm. He's definitely hiding in the closet or something, waiting for us to go back to sleep. Then he'll kill us in our sleeps, just like in our vision. Just like in my vision, again. And you know this, how? I know because that's what I do, duh. Plus he's using a knife, so there. Listen, Andrew, just trust me. I've thought these things through. He questioned not why she, he questioned not why she's thought about such things. <laughs> Enough dilly dallying, let's get in there and pretend we forgot something. Then we'll lure him something with somewhere less conspicuous. And then what? You have to ask? So... Okay, I guess we go? Yeah, I guess we go? We're going? Okay, we gotta pretend like we forgot- we forgot or something. Alright, leave this to me. This has gotta be the stupidest thing we've done so far. Personally, I think shooting fireworks indoors is dumber, but hey, opinions. Which, if I may add, was also your idea. I was 12! You should have stopped me. So, should I talk you out of this one, or... No, shut up and follow my lead. <gasps> We're Ashley again. Oh my gosh, she's literally me. No one has stepped forth to kill you yet. Oh gosh, Charlie, Andrew. I just realized our impromptu knife walk to the store has left me parched. Is that so? Let's return to the gas stop at once. And since we want to be oh so quick about it, let's take a shortcut through the park. Where we may frolic amongst the foliage shielded from sight. <laughs> She's so dumb! She's literally so dumb! Uh, Nyanda, before you leave, read the billboards. Okay, I can read the billboard. How's that sound? Huh? Terrific. Let's go. Not so fast. Let me grab my things first. I just, I don't trust the staff here. You know, she just realized after staying there for probably a while that she doesn't touch the staff. Or she doesn't trust staff. Okay, let's go ahead and save here. 
All good? Can we go? I didn't pick up my things yet. Come on, hurry up. Okay, what's our things? Oh, okay, I thought he would be in here. Got washed the laundry. Okay. Well, congratulations, you have found the hitman and died, which is the best part. The record, Andrew doesn't fare much. Because the cutting people up, the hitman's whooped his amateur ass. Oh no, we died. Oh no, I bet you're happy about that. And if you were too fucking. The hitman wins, and. <laughs> oh yes, this is a much better offer. However, this is anticlimactic, so you get a free read. Okay, thank you. Okay. Ah! We got our laundry? Okay. So the hitman's in there. Nothing else? Okay. Holding the door open for me, are we? What a gentleman. Just letting in some fresh air and the sounds of the city. Hurry up. Get your things already. I already did! Okay, so you guys told me to read the signs. Are you tired of living? Inquiries that ask your doctor for euthanasia is right for you. Wow, oh my god! Hitman's car, the car is locked. This is that guy's car, right? Wanna break in? And wake every single person on the premises? Why on earth would you want that? Huh? You thought, I thought you wanted to, you know, off this guy? The last thing we need is an audience. Oh right, cars have alarms. Oh. Hey, at least I asked before doing it. So true, Umfi. Is he coming after us or not? I don't know. I thought he would. Let's pick a corner so we can ambush him from. What corner? It's all bushes. An advantage on the cart. Very classy. Um. Here, this tree will hide us nicely. What are we going to do if he just stays at the motel? Well, I guess I'll just leave then. We'll grow, we'll grow eyes on the back of our heads and keep watching over our shoulders at all times. Ah, oh, what a pain. I can't believe I'm actually hoping he'd show up now. Good! Don't feel bad about murdering a murderer! And on that note... Not it! <gasps> no! I didn't put it! <gasps> no! You're making me do it again? Dude only has a knife. You got this. Uh, I hear footsteps, I think. Actually, wait, I've never fired a gun. Oh, what a pussy. <laughs> Crap, I think he stopped. I can't hear anything anymore. You can't ambush a killer that's wanting to ambush you. You can't very well start looking for him either. Not without letting him know that you were, you, that you know that he's, Crap. Did we whisper too loudly? Is he on to us? Why did he stop? To see what we're up to? But it looks all- it- this all looks suspicious as hell. It doesn't look like anything. He shouldn't even be able to see us from behind this. An idea hits you then. Oh! You dirty boy, no! We can't do it here! Wait, 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 hold on, hold on. I got this, I got this. Wait, 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 hold on. Can I redo this line? I want to redo this line. Chat, allow me to redo this line! Allow me to redo this line! Oh, you dirty boy, no! We can't do it here! <laughs> Off I go, come and find me! I don't want to! Ashley, seriously, I don't think- I don't, I don't know how this thing works. No peeking! Time has come to play hide and seek with the killer and Ashley. Okay. Oh God, it's just you. What are you doing, you absolute? Shh, you didn't find me, keep looking. Do you want to die? What if he sneaks up on you or? Shoo, shoo, leave. Okay. And it tends, uh, an attempt or several have been made to place trash where it belongs. So close. Okay, that's not it. Oh. Nothing here. Oh. Nothing but trash. Okay. 
It's like someone has gone through the bushes here. Okay, we're close. Nothing. Ah! Ship, 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 ship! Did... Is he dead? Nice work! Ashley, your canes are gone. Dude, you emptied the whole thing! I panicked. The thing is useless now. Well, I mean, no one knows it's empty. I mean, you obviously know it's empty if you if you hear if you hear like a certain amount of gunshots. Come on. I guess so. Do they sell bullets to just anyone, or do you need a license or something? I have no idea. Sorry, Ashley. Although I wouldn't have wasted them all if you hadn't made me shoot him. Are we still playing the finger pointing game? I thought we agreed to leave that behind. Let's just get out of here before someone sees us. Oh yeah, and what the fuck was that? What was what? You're running out of the blue? What, you need an excuse to start rummaging through the bushes? Now that the hitman thought you were you were looking for me, he sat there waiting to kill you. He didn't know you had a gun and would kill him instead. I'm a bloody genius! And what if he was in the bush you ran off to, huh? Genius. Well, he wasn't. Ugh. But you're bitching. It all worked out! Clue me in on the next time you have these genius ideas. So that I could tell you off. <laughs> We're back as Ashley Bros. Let's go. She's a bit of a fixer. She's a bit of a fixer upper, you know? British. Hey, you have a license for that? You have a license for that? British confirmed. Okay. I guess we keep going. We gotta, I guess we gotta get the fuck out of here. I can fix her. I can fix her! I can fix her! Let me see. Y'all tell me to read a sign. Can I read that one? It's locked. Okay. I sure would have. I'm a dumb as a snow. What's your excuse? Alas, I am a mercy of winds, darling sister. Well, you should have read my mind then. God damn it. Ha! Huh. My bad, must be the lack of sleep. I'm sure he's still right where we left him. Okay, I guess I can't read it. Eh? Do I go back up? Go back up to the room? What do we do? Eh? Is the room you're staying at? Thank God for the putrid stench wafers from it. Uh -huh. Where do we go then? Check the kill- Oh, check the killer body! Oh, okay, 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 okay. Okay, thank you, chat. You know, I actually haven't needed that much help from chat today. I'm pretty surprised at myself. I'm really bad at these type of games. Do we just leave him here? Why not? As long as no one saw us do it, who's gonna have a clue? It was us. Hell, that guy carries knives with him. He's clearly a criminal! Maybe the authorities will assume his friends got to him or something. Ever the optimist. Ah, uh, whatever. Let's just get- Let's just go before some- Someone comes to walk with their dog or something. Got car keys. Oh yeah, baby. Let- Leave those fingerprints all over that guy. That's just great. I'm sure you meant to say something else. I guess it doesn't matter since you've never gotten your fingerprints taken. Have you? Yeah. Ugh, motherfucker. What for? My driver's license. Well, good thing it's me man handling this corpse then. A very dead hitman. <laughs> okay, I guess we can go in the car now. There's an envelope with various papers inside. The most notable one reads, Dear Mr. Washing, Mach a washing Machine, Consider this a receipt for your cleaning service. We're extremely grateful that you've accepted to clean our laundry for us. We're so confident for your services that... We will not be needed to any progress reports. In fact, please do not contact us. And if anyone w were to ask, we less, the less we know, the better. As a bonus, we included free samples of the new soda flavors from our sister company. Happy washing! Are we the laundry? Seems that way. <laughs> Yikes! I guess we go now? Do we go? Take the car and comb. Boom, boom! So, where to? Um, could you elaborate? We're off to somewhere, right? Got the car and everything now. This isn't exactly the best situation to go joyriding in a stolen car. We barely have enough money to feed us. Fine, 
Let's go take mom's. For fuck's sake, does everything I say go into one ear and out the other? We're never going to talk to anyone we know ever again, remember? Did I say squat about talking to her? Let's go rob that bitch blind and leave. What money do you think she has exactly? I'm sure she's got something. I thought she inherited some jewelry from grandma. Well, yeah, she can't sell those. She can't, but I sure can. Mm. Uh, no. We still can't go over there. Why not? We got pursuers or something. Our parents' place is definitely something they've looked into. Listen, Andy. Wrong! <laughs> Wrong! Wrong! Andrew, the pursuer is taking a nap in the park right now. Do you honestly think anywhere near important enough for someone to hire two? If anything, it seems like they assume that guy took care of us, and that's that. But the thing is, I'd rather be overly cautious than dead. <sighs> we'll be quick. Get in there, rob them, kill them, and get out! So now you want to kill our parents? Great. He just said we can't talk to them anyways, any any anymore anyways. So they might as well be dead. I'm way too tired for this. Fine, we'll just rob them then. What? Well, Lolong, thank you so much for the raid on YouTube. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> thank you so much, Lolong. Welcome, welcome, everyone. Let me go ahead and choose yourself right everyone. Send. No, take a five by seven, five by five by five. Yan, yan, yan. Hello, everyone. My name is Yan. I'm the eternal stream star idol. Of she reckon she had your production since super nice to meet you guys. Ow, I just hit my hand. Ow, thank you, thank you so much, Dr. Lowline, for the raid on YouTube. Thank you, thank you. Welcome, welcome, everyone. We're playing uh, Coffin of Andrew and Lele. I have been doing a lot of voice acting today, and I hope everyone's been enjoying it. Uh, and what were you guys doing? It's okay, Nyad is a feature, but she has no brothers. I, I am, I don't have uh, older brothers. I am actually the oldest out of all of the grand, almost all the grandkids, and um, all my siblings, so you don't have to worry. You're safe. <laughs> You're safe. Bro, I, bro, I, let's go. Thank you, thank you, Red Man. Welcome, welcome. Probably now she's just a bunch of LLMs who live in a different apartment and have to get their sprinklers fixed. <laughs> no, I don't live in, I live in an actual house. Mm. Uh, yeah, that's a blessing. <laughs> Nyeri Mama won't need to worry. Yeah, just admitted to grooming her younger. I Thing. My brother has a girlfriend. My little brother has a girlfriend anyways. He's, he, he, he takes very good care of her. And I'm happy that he's happy with her. Yeah, he's a groomer? Yeah, I'm grooming you right now. Grooming you right now, chat. Isn't that the reason why you're here? You got groomed into, like, watching me? Yeah, exactly. That's what I thought. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and continue reading, but thank you so much again, Broline, for the raid. If you can on uh, Twitch, please go check out Broline. He streams exclusively on uh, YouTube, and it would be really cool if you go check out his streams. Yeah! Yeah, it's kind of a big sis of you are. How's. <laughs> Damn, that's a kind of big. Wait, big sis of you? How scan. A big sis of you? How scandalous? How's that scandalous? There's a time for spam bonk that it was here. How? How? I don't understand. Whatever. Okay, anyways, let's get back to this. Let's get back to this. I want to finish this. Break in while they're at work and get some money and then get lost. I'll take it. Where do they live now anyways? I know the place. I don't remember the exact address. She actually told you the address? Yeah. Huh. The only thing she told me was to stop calling her. She probably figured I'd tell you then. Well, what a sloppy job you did. Do you forgive me, Ashley? It didn't seem like relevant information at the time. Whatever. Just drive. I haven't driven a car in over two years. Will you be fine? Just don't distract me with anything. Okie dokie. Feet on the floor! My god, it's not even your car! Shut up and put your seatbelt on. Boo, this sucks. Yeah, yeah, it sucks. Now hurry up. I'll be goddamned if we get caught in a dead man's car just because we pulled over for some stupid shit. Make me then. Do you or do you not want to go rob our parents? <laughs> what? <laughs> God, I love that line for some reason. That's a fucking good line right there. I said, make me, Andy. I, okay, what do you want? If it's to piss me off, then you're nailing it right now. 
Oh, come on, it's just a joke. I know it's not a joke. I... Yes, it is. You get so mad, it's just... It's just funny! Like, I don't know you, Ashley. You pulled this shit before. I have no idea what you're talking about. You'll keep going Andy, Andy until I get tired of correcting you. And suddenly it's Andy and Lele and stupid bullshit all over again. Way to read into it, I was honestly just joking around. Well then, it's not funny. You're going to stop. Nothing's funny to you anymore. <laughs> well, are you going to drive or what? I just don't want us to get in trouble. You don't have to be such a hard ass about it. I do though. And you're such a dumbass about it. Just drive. Are you angry? I'm looking out for us. Fucking drive, Andy! Drive, Andrew! And so he finally does. So he does. <laughs> correction! Correction! Mention! Correction! Correction! Mention! Let's go, Chuck! Oh my gosh, he got corrected! God, I wish that was me. God, I wish that was me, chat. Okay, give me a sec, chat. Gonna pull down my... Gonna take a little seat. I'm like hardcore flexing with this. Okay, there we go. And we'll go... Give me a sec, they're so toxic. Braddy Cow will need big brother correction. Need big brother co correction. Right around, what says bot? Okay, there you go, yay, okay. Put this back up. Remember to trust Andrew. <laughs> that correction was weak, Andrew is a bit, nah, nah, that was good, it was fine. She, she, as long as the correction is like, you know, it, it works. It doesn't matter if it's weak or strong. As long as it works. I decided to give Andrew the silent treatment until he apologizes. You're not sure what he needs to apologize for exactly, but he won't forgive him. That is such bratty behavior. I do this. I do this so much. I will say, I am very guilty of this. You're not sure. I, I personally, I'm sometimes, I'm like, I'm per yeah, woman moment. Truly woman moment. <laughs> I even do this. We're all just like, I'm not sure what you need to apologize for, but you won't forgive if it's me. <laughs> the woman of some moment. It's making me so mad. My sister was guilty of these same manipulative tactics. Oh, I'm sorry. See, unironically, this is not cool. But. In a fantasy sort of space where it's like, okay, it really has no, like, consequences to myself or the others around me. That's when it's like, oh, hell yeah. But I, I would see this, like, suck it a lot and this is actually your sister. So while you wait for him to notice you're not talking to him, you fall asleep. Yes, like geeky girl boss. What the? You're pretty sure you're dreaming. But at the same time, you feel wide awake. Okay, I guess we gotta go. Oh. This feels like Toho. It's giving Toho vibes. I feel like we're in Ginsokyo. So. Huh? What? Who's there? Where are you? And where am I? Is this another vision or what? There's no response. There's nothing to step on. What do I do here? Hmm. Uh. What do I do here? Step on me, Ashley. Yeah, any isn't there. There's nothing to step on. <laughs> yeah, and shut up! Shut up! Hmm. Okay, let's see. There has to be... There's some puzzle to this. Oh, there you go. Pick red flowers. Okay, we got it. We got it. Oh, yeah, it's a good rest of the day. Thank you so much. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you, thank you. Hope you have a good day. Oh, you got your memes. Oh, you got your memes. Okay. There's little eyes there. Okay, okay. We see. I guess we gotta find more flowers in order to get to the little... That little part. 
Avatar summon you can't tune in. What? You're all muffled. I can't hear anything. Let's continue talking, but you can't make the heads or tails of it. Ah, oh, whatever. I should focus on getting out of here anyways. I gotta find more flour. Ah! No. That was wrong. Oh, I see, I see. Wait, wait, wait. I see, I see, I see. I see. I see. Mmm... Maybe if I go... Bam? No. Ah, there we go! Fuck! Where am I? Everything looks the same! Okay, we got the red flower. So then we put that here. Okay. And now there's little eyes everywhere. Okay. Oh, there's this there's a demon! Blades of the void falling down to an eternal void. Lucky! Ah, it's you! I saw you from before, right? Human, you've come. Where am I? In a dream, I call you here. Well, can you wake me up then? I was in the middle of something. It doesn't even occur to you that you could be afraid of the soul stealing your creature. I have summoned you to make a deal. Great, but I can't do this now. What if Andrew's trying to talk to me? He needs to know I'm deliberately in- <laughs> This is so woman behavior! <laughs> this is such woman behavior! <laughs> he, he needs to know I'm deliberately ignoring him instead of being in a coma or something! This bitch is womaning to the demon! What? Truly, this, she's me. She is so me. Demon couldn't care less about a lover spat you've had with your brother. <laughs> it's carrying on as if you hadn't said a thing. You've used my gift. What? Was it useful? Seeing the future? Ah, yes! The chicken you gave me! It's been very useful, thank you! Didn't you want to see the future again? Sure, I just have to keep holding on to it, right? It's out of energy. I am able to recharge it. Do you want to make a deal? Of course you do. Never never has it ever been a bad idea to make deals with devils. <laughs> Let's hear it then. What do you want? Human souls. Well, you're not getting mine. So that was it then. Not yours. Tar soul. Tar soul? Is that like an insult or something? Who's then? Just any of us? And why don't you go get someone soul yourself? I cannot enter the human realm unless summoned. You cannot enter here. I am unable to reach you only because of my tal talisman. But even then, one can only re retract between realms through the- I cannot read this with the fucking, like, capital letters and everything. It's- <laughs> Do we have a deal? Oh, did I really read that in a cute <laughs> I don't really get it, but I can't say I'm all that interested either. Listen, I really need to get back to my brother. If I offer you a soul, will you make my talisman trinket dream thing work again, right? Correct. Sounds good. Uh, I do have a soul or two in mind, actually. But I'll see what Andrew has to say about it. He's kind of... I don't know. Something is shifting. I don't really like it. Demon says nothing to that. Probably wasn't the right entity to talk about it this with. I <laughs> Like woman problems to a fucking demon. God, I love her. She's literally me. Here, all right. I'll see what I can do. The demon changed the voice from Ikemen to cute girl, so that's concerning. <laughs> so how do I wake up? You wake up once your mind returns home. Huh? Farewell, Tarsal. The entity has left. Okay. Um, flower. Okay, and then we pick up more flour. What if I get that flour over there? How do I get that flour? I wanna get that flour. Okay. Where am I? Oh. I wanna get that flour. Where am I? Oh. Ah, there we go. Yay! 
then can I go back here? Where does it take me to? Uh, oh, and I get another flower! Nice! Wow, I can think I got all the flowers! Alright, is that all of them? Tar... Tarsal... You can pay for all... Uh, what is it? What is a tarsal? I don't get it, chat. I guess I can go... Here? Oh, yeah! I'm going to the one with the flowers. Storage decorated red flowers. Enter? Yeah, I want that one. Oh! Nice! Okay. I guess we keep going? Oh, there's more flowers! I like the flowers, chat. They make me very happy. Whoa, okay, okay, we're moving. So I guess... Whoa, there's a little gift up there! Okay, but I want to get all the flowers first. I want to get all the flowers. I don't even know how many flowers I have. Okay, there we go. There's that one. It's a red flower. Okay. I guess I can go here. And then I can go here. And then get a little gift. Found a present. Inside is... <gasps> 11 muffin disgust... Uh, 11 muffin disgust is a birthday cake. Woo! <laughs> oh man! Kind of takes me back. Get lost in your thoughts for a bit. Whoa! Oh, flashback? Oh, okay, hold on, I gotta drink some water for this. <sighs> okay, <coughs> let's do it. <sighs> I'm home. Oh, what's that? Oh, oh, sorry. Oh, what's that you got there? My teacher gave it to me. That's nice of her. She gives me... She gives them to everyone on their birthday. It's not special. She's not getting paid to do it, and she's going out of her way to try to make you smile. Mm. Hey, Andy. Yeah? Isn't it interesting that when, you, when it's your birthday, you have your classes come over and stuff. But when it's my birthday, we can never afford anything? I got some pocket money. Want to go buy a cake? Nah, it's not like my friends will show up anyways. They're always busy when I ask them for anything. Even when I haven't set the date yet. More cake for us. I don't know. Come on, let's go get you something. <laughs> okay! Frozen cakes? Quiet you, I'm on a budget. Yikes, 20 bucks for whatever the hell that is? No thanks. You watch Andy as he scouts the cakes for more accurately their price tags. Say, I've got an idea. How about instead of a cake, we get a muffin value pack? What? Those muffins taste like a lemon extract and sadness! If I put whipped cream on them, they'll have a dozen cakes instead of just one. Uh, you just can't afford a cake. Okay, fine. But you'll have to... You'll also... <laughs> We'll also, but you'll also have to watch Hypergore Splatterbrain 2 with me. That's age restricted. You'll have to ask Dad to. No, we still have it. We do? I thought we rented it months ago. Yep, Mom said to keep it at this point. I never go back to that shop again. <laughs> so true, Umfi. So true, Umfi. Oh, what short term thinking? Well, whatever. Deal. Yes! Um, um. Ah, die, you son of a bitch! No, spare me! I'll never fuck your ugly, horrible wife again! <laughs> ah, my intestines! Why do you like these movies again? Because I was told I can't watch it! Ah, uh, of course. Well, happy birthday, Lele. <laughs> thank you, thank you! I'll remind mom to put some money aside for you next year. Nah, that's okay. Huh? I think this birthday stuff is fucking stupid anyways. Watch your mouth, you little shit. But it is! So what if it's been another year? It's all nonsense anyways. Who cares? Well, I for one. That makes a grand total of one person who cares! Fine, I'll just buy you something on my own then. And I happen to like these side lemon muffins too. So guess what you'll get next year too. <laughs> what if they stop making them? They won't, but if they do, I'll make my own just to spite you. Your sisters will forever be celebrated with lemon favorite dough and preservatives. God, no, no! At least get the chocolate ones! What? 
You like those better? Why didn't you say that at the store? I thought you wanted the lemon ones. Only because I thought you liked them? No, and didn't you just say you liked them? I was lying so you could keep playing coy. <laughs> okay, sorry. Next time I'll get the chocolate ones. Nah, these are growing on me. Thanks, Sandy. You're my favorite lemon... Chat, you're my favorite lemon muffin. Chad is my favorite lemon muffin! <laughs> Yay, see, I'm being sweet and nice, chat. See? Very sweet and nice, Nyaru. <laughs> what? Thank you, BT! Thank you so much, Ray! Thank you, thank you! You caught me right, right as I was talking to chat anyway, so perfect timing! Welcome, welcome, everyone! Thank you so much to the rain, Pickle BT! If, I, if my mods can shout them out for me, that would be super, super cool. Uh, while they do that, let me go ahead and introduce myself for everyone. Say, no! Tiger, Fiber, Cyber, Diaper, Fiber, Bye Bye! Nyan, Nyan, Nyan! Hello, everyone! My name is Nyan, I'm the Eternal Strength Star Idol at Shigeru Productions, and it's super nice to meet you guys! Thank you so much for coming by! Thank you, thank you! Welcome, welcome! Today, we are playing the, we are playing the Coffin of Andy and Lele. We are currently doing lots of voice acting for this, actually. <laughs> Um, a lot more voice acting that I had intended. It's the wo it's the woman team. We're having a woman moment. Yes, we are. Thank you so much, O3 Hanson, for coming in. Welcome, welcome. Short stack is short and narrow. Oh yeah, short stack. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I hate it here. <laughs> Andrew is a lemon moment. She is even though she eats Andrew foresh foreshadowing. No, oh no, no, don't say that. We gotta make lemon muffins now, chat. <laughs> Thank you so much, Pickle. What were you guys doing today, actually? Hold on, let me see real quick. What were you guys doing? Oh, did I move up my thing? Oh, I gotta lock this place. Okay, there we go. Um, so Pickle BT, what were you playing today? You guys, are, oh, you guys are drawing today. What were you drawing? No, you must understand the Hanson. That's the sh oh, it's the Hanson. That's the short. <gasps> He's the short stack. Oh my goodness. I can't, I can't believe it. I love short stacks. Well, yeah, come here. Drawing, Daddy Ling, by the way, welcome, welcome. What were you guys drawing? I like art streams, sorry. <laughs> I'm always curious, if everyone ever streams me, I'm like, oh, what did you draw? <laughs> you know? <laughs> I'm 5'5", five five, that's small, that's small. Uh, is that smaller we than, I'm 5'4", so I'm more shorter. I'm an inch shorter, he 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 he. But yeah, welcome, welcome, guys. We're playing uh, Coffin and Andrew Lele. We're doing a little bit of voice acting alongside with it. And, um, oh, thanks for Giant Yui knows me well, fan. Oh, nice! Nice! Tiny little sis. I don't know, it's 5'4 short. I don't know if it's short. I've gotten mixed, mixed responses from people thinking that it's not short and people that say it's very short. I don't know. Alright, we're gonna go ahead and continue on with the voice acting. So sorry for not reading chat that much, but thank you again for the raid. Thank you, thank you. Everyone, please go check out uh, Picky, uh, Pickle VT and check out their fan art of viewing those new models. Thank you, thank you for tuning in. And thank you for the raid again. Thank you, thank you. Uh, Alright, let's, let's go back to our favorite little muffin, Andy! So you pretend to like me. Nice, nice. <laughs> Wish for something. I wish my brother loses all his friends and never finds love. Wow, thanks? <laughs> You're welcome. They're so toxic for each other. I hate it, but I love it. Mm -mm. They're so toxic for each other. Heh, <laughs> the good old bad times. Mm, I want to go to that little path over there. Oh, okay, okay, okay. There's nothing to step up. Oh. Did I not get all the flowers? Am I missing a flower? I feel like I'm missing a flower. Uh, let's see. Mm. So, Nyeri, you got a big brother? No, I don't actually. I guess there's not. Oh well. If I really want to look at anything else, I'll just be sure to like play it again. I'm gonna be playing this a couple times, so. There's still more? I thought this would this way would take me home! And good god, I'm so sick of these fucking flowers! 
Oh, can we pick all these flowers? Oh. Oh, we gotta step on them. We're stepping on them. Oh no, oh no. I think we're not supposed to do this. I don't think so. Ah! Ashley? Andy, is that you? Help! Get me out of this shithole! Come on, wake up. It's not funny. I'm trying, jackass! Do something, help me! <sighs> oh, thank god. His smile. His fucking smile. His fucking smile. I'm sorry. It's so good. Fucking end me, chat. Fucking end me. I was a hair away from taking you to the hospital. Huh? Why? That would that would screw us over, wouldn't it? You wouldn't wake up no matter what I did. God, Ashley, don't scare me like that again. Ugh, what time is it? Like 10 in the morning or something. Mom and Dad should both be at work right now. Why can't I have a big brother who rests my head on? Why can't my... Why can't I have a big brother that worries about me and takes care of me? Why can't I? Why can't I? That should be me! It should have been me! It should have been me. <laughs> so, whenever you're ready, I guess. You only been... You only been nice. You're only being nice now because you're treating me like shit last night. It should have been me. It should have been me. It should have been me. I treat you the way you deserve to be treated. Or actually, no. Scratch that. Considering you, considering you kept pushing me around all day, I think it was pretty fucking lenient with you. Ooh. So anyways, this episode is titled Andrew and Ashley at the Home Sweet Home Invasion. What kind of knockoff cash grab show is that? I'm not interested! Well, it's definitely all about cash grabbing. <laughs> I mean, boo! No thank you. No, I saw that. You're into it. Let's go. No, it sucks! <laughs> But I'm so n I'm so nice, so I'll roll with it for now. Why on earth are we at some park? Reparking, that's why. Mom and Dad live somewhere down the slope. Oh, okay. I guess we go. We start going. This can't be the right place. Look how nice everything is. No, it's got to be this. She just sound happy when she talked about their new place too. What's what's their last name anyways? What do you mean what's their last name? Name played on the doors. Did they go with dad's name or mom's? Dad's name, right? Why would change why would they change it at this point? I don't know, to throw us off? They really make it sound like they don't want to want us to find them. Just a feeling I got. Hmm. Well, whatever. Let's find the house of Mr. and Mrs. Graves. Grayson? <laughs> Sherson! <laughs> Sherson! That's a good one. Jones! Okay. Ah! Here we go! Don't just knock! No one comes to open a door. Alright, all good. Whatever, let's just find a way in. The parents trash- Oh, we could go this way. Maybe? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, come on, look at this place! They've got a garden and everything! Doesn't matter, we'll fill our pockets and go. Let's see, is there anything we can look at here? Oh, a stick. Okay, a stick. Thank you, thank you, stick. You check under the flower pot. Oh, got a key! Not! Joel, there's a fucking- Fuck all under the flower pot. Oh, fuck all? Back door is locked. Oh, those little rocks. The little, little highlighted rocks right here. Oh, no? Oh, oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, I think the window was open. Can you reach it? Nope. Hmm. Oh, the little wood plank over there. Got a wooden plank. Okay, nice. Let's go here. Place the wooden plank there. All right. 
Ah! It's still too high! Lift me up! Well? Ah, uh, no good. It's open. But it's on a place by a latch that's on the other side of the window. Damn it. My fingers can't reach to unhook it! The stick! Get the stick. Okay, nice. Let's see, let's see. Aha! Andrew has to climb through the, the now open window. Give me your hand! I'll pull you in! Thanks a bunch, but I'd rather you just open the door for me. Oh, yeah. That would be easier. Welcome, welcome! Thank you. Not so fast. Now, what do we say? Thank you very much. Wrong! Try again! Exceptionally well done. That was an earth-shattering performance. Yes. To think you opened a door swiftly with such grace. Stunning, marvelous, breathtaking. You were, these are but a few words that you describe your ability to trespass. May I come in now? You may. Great. Then let's split up. I want to get out of here as fast as possible. Uh, hey. I was... There was something I was wondering about. Right now? Can't it wait? Our situation is kind of time-sensitive. Well, it can, I guess. Good, then tell me later. Mm. Find a letter and it reads, Sorry to hear about what happened with the kids. I agree, it was probably a blessing in disguise. Don't feel guilty, it's not your fault. Lord has it sorted out for you. P.S. Since Andrew won't be finishing college, is there any chance my daughter could have his textbooks? Those are this expensive. Thanks for it in advance. Much love to you and your husband. You never told me you dropped out? I didn't. It was just on pause until I got out of quarantine. Though, given the situation right now, I guess I did drop out. Well, tough luck for their daughter. Your textbooks are, are all in ashes now. Yeah, that's really fucked up. Okay, um... Looks like there's a downstairs area over here. Your parents had lived here for only a few months. They somehow managed to hoard all the stuff as a spare bed to boot. Money is clearly no longer an issue. An extra bed implies there are either no issues or social life is either... Ew! Rubber gloves. A washing machine and a tumbler dryer. Your parents are living it up. Cleaning supplies such as vinegar. Dirty laundry. Rise are top. Ah! Some sexy laundry right now! How uncomfortable! Ew! Next in quality mop. I don't like the toilet upstairs. This one actually works. The floor drain sees a little clogged, but it's not your problem. On the table, so it's a, on the table lays some documents in a, about a purchase of a house. There's also a key. Oh, dresser key. Okay. Metal box full of screwdrivers. Christmas decorations. Christmas stuff. Okay. Check down here. Can we take the gloves? Okay, I guess not. Our parents seem to have picked up some new and exciting hobbies. Tell me more! I, uh, don't think I will. But for now, it makes sense why mom kept hassling us to move out. Don't even not know what parents have been up to in this bed. Oh, you found the key. Nice. What's in there? No sign of any jewelry, but you saw some paperwork. It reads, Dear Mr. and Mrs. Grace, you have to opt it out for a compensation of damages caused by our company's error. Our representative will be glad to meet with you. Please come discuss the matter further at your earliest convenience. Flip through the folder, something else catches your eye. It's a desert group. It's of Ashley and Andrew Graves. Huh? Huh? I didn't even know we died three months ago. What the hell is this? I guess it explains why mom kept telling me not to call. This must have been spooky getting phone calls from a ghost. That's... Someone's entered. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. It's... Isn't it this too early? They shouldn't be home yet. It's a shame that you wasted all of our bullets. Like we shoot anyways? Is someone there? H Hi, Mom. It's just us. Oh, fuck. Are you serious? Welcome home. Oh, no. She's hot. <laughs> Oh no, she's hot! Oh no! Oh no, she's hot! Mommy! Mommy! She's hotter than Ashley! What are you doing here? Surprise, we came for a visit. Oh, I see. 
How are you home so early? Didn't you get fired? It's my day off. I was just out shopping. How'd you two get inside? You left the door unlocked. You should really be more careful about that. Did I really? Here, let me help you with those groceries. Thanks. You should have let me know you were coming. How about some coffee? Where do you keep the grounds? In that top cupboard, but what about the cor- In the top cupboard, but what about the quarantine? Any milk in yours? Sure, let me go wash my face. The hell are you doing? Just play along for now, please. Guess I'll make some coffee. I guess we go to the kitchen? It's putting away the groceries. Okay, okay. Coffee. Uh, coffee. Oh, coffee. Okay. You brewed some coffee. So I saw the fire on the news. What happened? Why do you care? Ugh. Well, first we got evacuated after they gave us the go-ahead to leave. Since we've been cleared for the parasites anyways. Huh. Interesting. On the news, they said everyone died. That would certainly make the story sell more. Anyways, here we are here we are now. Neither burnt nor full of parasites. I'm just glad you're safe. <laughs> the fucking face that she has! Oh my god, the fucking face that she has! Oh, glad you're alive. She looks like, I'm sure she meant it. Yeah, sure looks like it. Oh she yeah, it actually notices! So uh Quite the upgrade from our previous place, huh? Where'd you get the money for this place? Did you finally win the lottery? Ha! I wish. This town needs some serious repairs. They are so worth it, don't you think? Perfect non-answer. They even hold barbecue events in here within our neighborhood. Barbecue events, just like on TV. Just, I thought it was all bullshit, but no, they actually do that stuff here. Bet you, bet you stick out like a sore thumb. You'd be surprised. I'm actually quite a liked. Oh, she's such a narcissist, isn't she? She's a narcissist, isn't she? She comes off like that. Though I'll probably... The will probably thanks to my cooking skills. It's a shame our Ashley didn't inherit any. Hey, what the hell? <laughs> this conversation is definitely boring. You don't contribute anything to it because you can't keep up with Andrew's lies. If you're being honest, you don't want to talk to your mother in the first place. Well, it was good to see you. Your father should be coming home soon, so I really need to start making some dinner. Oh no, don't worry about it. I'll make something. You know, full well, that was her way of telling you to get lost. Um, oh boy, I can't wait to hear how dad has been. He must have, he must have all kinds of stories about repairing this place. That's true. Anyways, why don't you go rest? I'll fix us up something. <sighs> I'll take you up on that. Thank you. Mother leaves. You are Andrew. Okay, cool. We are Andrew now, chat. We are we are Andrew. We are single-handedly Andrew. Somehow your burglary attempt ended up without cooking with you cooking your victim's dinner. Go ahead and make something, you smooth talker. Bitch, you could probably make something out of that. Who what, Who knew? Kitchen knives. And nothing to cut. Dish rack and a blender. We don't know what to make yet. Okay, then what do I fucking make? There's meat inside the fridge. Yes, there's meat inside the fridge, but what the fuck? A sink. Oh, you rested a cookbook for some simple recipes. What? I got this. You can go do whatever. I'm alright. What is it? It's nothing. You're stuck with an honor to pull this bro <laughs> this broody bitch. <laughs> you're you struck with an odd urge to pull this broody bitch into your arms and force her to force her to say it's I wish she was me. I wish she was me. I wish I was her. Just should it should have been me. It should have been me, Chad. It should have been me. It should have been me. But you push, but you push us an idea to the back of your mind. Ray may fester with all the other thoughts you wish you. What are your thoughts? What are your thoughts? Is he thinking about? 
That's just all the other thoughts you wish you never had. <gasps> oh my gosh. Either way, you left your to hover over you for now. Found a simple soup recipe. You need meat, carrots, potatoes, and onions. Chop everything up, boil in a pot. Okay. Got meat. Don't have all the ingredients. Oh, oh, we could go get the onions and the stuff from the garden. That's right. How nice our parents had all these fresh ingredients. While we languish in our apartment, it only makes one appreciate just how much, how much they love us. Come on, we'll get ours. We just have to figure out how to go about this. Now that she's seen us, leave no witnesses. Let's not jump to that just yet. I fucking knew it. Please, let's just... Please just let me think. I'll figure something out, alright? <sighs> get the feeling she has something more to say. You can't tell whatever it is is going to start an argument. So you leave it be for now. Got carrots, okay. Got potatoes, and then now we need onion. Got onion, okay. Can we go talk to our mom, actually? Where's our mom? Your mom's purse. Got a bit of cash. It's nowhere enough for you. That's fine. Oh, she's down. She's doing laundry. Don't you two ever get sick of each other? All the time. I hear absence makes the heart grow fonder. That's the very last thing I need, to, I need is to... Is to grow fonder of that nightmare of a woman. Hmm? Okay. We got all the ingredients. You don't have all the- Wait, what's the ingredients then? Wait, wait, wait. Meat, carrots, potatoes, onions. I- cho Oh, chop everything up. Okay, okay. 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 Just curious. Do you just use the cultist clever cleaver to cut all the ingredients? Yes. Why? I hope he washed it first. I've got to clean, obviously. Anyways, that should be all the ingredients. You throw the ingredients in the pot and wait. Alright, you can't take this anymore. Ashley, I can tell something is up. Spit it out. I have something to tell you. But first, you have to promise you'll agree. I will absolutely not promise that. Okay then, never mind. Stop being annoying. What is it? Ugh. You're going to be a, such a bitch about it. I really wanted to come to this conclusion by yourself. But since you won't, let me spell it out for you. We have to kill mom and dad! <sighs> no! No! None of that! I actually need their souls to recharge the uh, clairvoyancy dream thingy. Do you really, or are you just saying that? Huh? Pretty fucking interesting that you'd mention this now of all times. I did try to tell you before, but you blew me off! And again, I was hoping you'd come around on your own. Shame on you for expecting anything from you. Let me think about it. What's there to think about? Oh man, the dad looks so fucked. <laughs> says dad, uh, says dad with all the enthusiasm of a dead fish. One extremely tiresome dinner later. There's no art for the dad. I'm so sad. I actually want to see like art of the dad. What did we talk about again? Anyways, I'm sorry, kids. I'm exhausted for work. I'm heading straight to bed. Can you two clean up? No R for a male, but Andy! Dad's a cuck, cuck, cucks don't get art. <laughs> Picked up the dishes. Picked up the dishes. It can't be done. The dishes, the robbing, or the killing? Robbing nor killing. The more I think about it, it's less doable than it is. Let's take one report to the authorities and put us on their radar. And if anything happens to our parents, what do you reckon as, as their prime suspects? Well, surely not their two dead kids! But were those documents even official? Well, even then, surely they're poor- Yoshi, what is wrong? Yoshi. <laughs> well, even then, surely the poor grave siblings perished in the fire. Trust me, it only takes one person to start digging into it. And suddenly, we've not only alerted them uh, that we're alive, but we're also revealed our, our recent whereabouts. We're better off mugging random strangers who have no connection to us. 
And what makes you so sure this bitch won't snitch on us anyways? Seems like she, seems to me she's already sold us off once before. I mean, she... Assuming she believed me earlier, there'd be no reason for her to do anything. She's the kind of person who'd rather stay out of it anyways. I fucking knew it! I knew it! I knew it! W what You're all about being so careful. But when it push comes to shove, you stick your head in the sand. Hell, since you think everything is so good, why not stay here and play Happy Family some more? Bet you like that, huh? You seem, you seem to get along so nice. You know I'm only keeping up appearances, right? And so is she. Felt to me like it was the same as ever. Ashley, are you kidding me? Mm. Okay. Listen, I choose you, didn't I? I choose you. <gasps> he chooses us. Chat, he chose us. So if anyone is playing Happy Family here, it's you and me. So you're saying you're not happy? Not that I didn't know that already. Fuck off with that, that's not what I said. If you keep your end of the agreement, everything would just be peachy. I've been behaving. No, you haven't, but that's not what I'm talking about anyways. I agree to behave, and you agree, and, and, and you agreed it's just, now, it's just us now. Funny, because I remember agreeing to bury Andy and Lele. That is funny! I think you're misremembering. I'm not, because it's the only reason I'm here in the first place. Then you must have misunderstood me. Mm. What? If you don't like it, why don't you just stay here with your mommy and daddy and be a good little murderer boy? Why don't you leave me to rot? Clearly you don't even like me. You're the only one who doesn't like me. It's all about Andy with you. No. <laughs> no. Ah! Where's my goddamn? There I made the soup. You idiots! Oh my god! Just I want them to fuck already, please. But guess what? Andy is dead. You're right. I really don't like Andrew. Sorry to hear that. Fuck! No! <laughs> I'm self-inserting chat. No, I'm self-inserting. I'm self-inserting. Oh no, 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 oh no. <laughs> I'm self inserting, Dan. I'm self inserting. <laughs> Just kiss already! Jesus Christ! Because Andrew is all you get. It's n not this time for this, anyways. Let's just leave. I'll figure out what we'll do about the money and the trinket. If you're leaving, anyways, with this trinket charge, we at least have the means to stay safe. The mom always looks just so fucking done with life. I get that, but if we leave quietly, there'd be no need for any anyone to look for us. That was me. God, I wish that was me. Ahem. What are you two whispering about? Nothing. Did you need something? Just like peas in a pod. Huh? I don't suppose you've got any friends you could go stay with. Oh. There isn't enough space in the house. Despite being far larger than the last one. And you're both already in your 20s. I don't know how else to say it. No, no, it's... Yeah, we're not fucking planning on leaving on living here. Thanks for the invitation, though. 
It's not like you're unwelcome to visit. There's no room to keep housing you indefinitely. Yeah, I get it. But since you're already here, I guess one night won't be a problem. But you need to start looking for somewhere else to stay first thing in the morning. And it should probably be two separate places. Oh, she knows. She fucking knows, chat. She knows. <laughs> she just fucking knows. <sighs> That's a tall order after all our earthly possessions just burned to the ground. It's amazing what money can buy once you have a job. Speaking of which, I have a morning shift in tomorrow. There's a spare bed in the basement. Andrew, you can take the couch. Alright, good night. Good night. Well, aren't you going to bed? I'm not tired yet, so... You are under my roof right now, and you will go to your designated sleeping areas immediately. Uh... Sleep now or get out at once! You pretend to go to bed until your parents fall asleep. Going to sleep is the worst. During the day, all the noises and Ashley's never any bullshit keeps your mind occupied. But at night, alone with your thoughts, there's nothing to distract you from yourself. Despite having every intention to go pick a fight with Ashley, <laughs> you jumped off to sleep. Oh shit. Eh? Oh. Green saber, hast thou to have thou arrived to borrow sweet granules of sugar? Behold, as though my wit does not, not by not but flesh doth I possess the present unto thee. <laughs> All ghosts appear required to speak like this. Yes, even in the recent, even the recently past ones, you you read too much poetry. <laughs> Be alert, young Mister Graves. It is time for you to com compartmentalize. What a lassie. Do I just do I just go get go get those or oh Do I just go? Okay. Alright, Ashley already cooked that one. Ah oh Ashley? There is no hand, Nora will budge. Oh, oh, Ashley! What are you doing here? I. Ashley, no. Don't answer. I don't care. Get lost. You're not supposed to exist anymore. Says who? You? You're not the boss of me, Andy. Forget this. Stop following me, you little shit. Oh, oh, it sure is dark that way. Good thing I have these candles. Great, hand them over. <laughs> no way. Ask, ask nicely or kill her. Kill her, kill. Chat, should I save? Oh, I can't save anymore. Ask, ask. Why are you guys saying kill? I don't feel- I feel like I shouldn't listen to you guys! I can't save anymore! I can't- Oh! May I have- Okay, I already- Nope! And why is that? I- Oh, well, I already picked it! I already picked it! Cause I only have- I only have so many left! And then my lemon muffin cake has no candles, I can't pretend it's a cake anymore! Just eat it then. Oh, thanks for the model flip! I'm gonna go back to the side. Ooh. There we go. Hold on, let me also fix my model. Because otherwise you can't read the text. There we go. Okay. Back to the game. The way you can pretend to eat the cake, it won't need candles anymore. It's too precious to eat! God, you're such a tool today! Okay, whatever. Oh, let me get that. Now they place a candle uh, on the candle holder. Nothing happens. You're welcome. There's nothing to light. 
Oh, do I have a lighter? Use your lighter to light the candle. Oh! There's another candle over there. Huh? There we go. There we go, there we go, there we go. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, what is that? Oh no, I don't like that. Chat, I don't like that. I don't think I like that. Chat, I don't like that. I don't think I like that. Julia? You've been quiet all day, what's up? Oh God, who is this? Who is this, chat? Are we gonna have to obsess over this one? Julia Top Peak. She's gonna get murdered. Is this the asthmatic girlfriend? No, 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 no. It's his girlfriend. No, it's it's nothing. Oh, actually, I've been thinking about something a lot lately. I'll give her a cute voice. She seems very shy. But I don't know if I should bring it up. With that much buildup, you kind of have to now. <laughs> well, okay. But please don't get mad. I never ever once even raised my voice with her. You know you can tell me anything. I, uh, talked to my sister about what you said the other day. And she agreed with me. And maybe it's, like, maybe it's better for Ashley to learn some independence. Even if it's just for her own sake, you know? Uh, and maybe for our sake too? I just think... I, I think I'd just be nice if you could stay over more often. And not like always cut things short or cancel on me so much. Sorry. Uh, I'm not reprimanding you. I can't make her learn anything though. N no, but you could like, you know, not always go when she asks. If your sister needed something, wouldn't you go? Well, yes, but only she, uh, but she only asks if she actually needs something. I suppose. Sorry, maybe I shouldn't have said that, or brought this up after all. No, it's fine. I guess I'm still shook up over what happened with your friend way back when. Ashley may not might not look like it, but I think it affected her a lot too. So that's probably why she's, why she is how she is. I really don't get that impression at all. For someone so obnoxious, she's surprisingly difficult to read, isn't she? Mm -hmm. She's difficult. She's difficult in general. Sorry, I didn't catch that. No, no, nothing. Go on. Anyways, I worry about something like that happening to her. Or happened to you. It should have been Ashley. <laughs> It should have been- it should have been Ashley. I'll be fine when- if you're with me. Mm. Would you tie your hair up for me? Oh heck no! You're pulling it on it again. <laughs> oh, but don't- but don't you know how it- but don't you know it's how boys show their love? Well, that's just awful! <laughs> Suppose she still lingers. Hasn't been that long. I just kind of forgot about her when all the chaos is going on. She's not gonna take you back, you know. When did I ask you? Okay, what? Check the phone? The phone? Where's- Oh, the phone. The phone. This? You have 127 new voices. Oh, hell no. You're not listening to all that. Okay, I checked the phone. What about it? Look, I don't know what your fucking problem is. Audio has been distorted, but where you recognize that voice anywhere? I told you to fuck off! I warned you! Do you think you're all that? Do you think you're somehow special? You're just another hole. And, and you're not even the only one. He's got a slew of floozies just like you. Enjoy what you have because you are well on your way out by now. What the fuck is a floozy? <laughs> What the fuck is a floozy? The 
only reason he's with you is because he feels sorry for you. You're just some ugly cunt with a dead best friend. Hurry up and kill yourself. Holy shit, she's not me, okay? She's not me. And when you get to hell, ask your friend what happened to her. <laughs> Bet you'd be... <laughs> you'd be so surprised. Fucking die, you worthless piece of shit, slut. Go slit your wrist for some more. And this time, do it proper. Jesus Christ! She's actually not me. You think I'm better than me? Just because you can fuck him and I can't? You think that's love? Are you fucking delusional? Kung Dusters like you are just like that. He will never love you. Not like he loves me. I am the only one. I am everything. I am the secret you'll never hear. When he lies in bed at night and when he needs someone to hold on to, it's not you he seeks out. It is me. Holy fuck. I can fix her. I can fix her. Guys, do you really think you can fix her? You cannot fix her. <laughs> okay, one more. One more. Oh, that's enough of that. Okay, never mind. Never mind. And if you approach this thing. Okay, I ain't approaching that though. I'll never see her again. And the fact that it doesn't really bother you. Okay. So what now? Trash cans full of letter, mostly death threats. Study supplies are just pencils. What do you hope to find in there, pervert? Collection of photos and notes for your girlfriend cherished, or your ex-girlfriend used to cherish. You're pretty sure you wouldn't be up there anymore. So what's that? Okay, now what? Do I go over here now? What do I do? Doshiol. What do I do? Ah! Someone stares inside the room with unblazing gaze. Okay, what the fuck is that? Do I just do this? Sex doko? Sex doko? Mmm. That's the Ashley stalking Julia. Ah! Okay. So I go to this door now? No. Okay, do I go over here maybe? No, over here? Hmm. Or do I go back over there? Hold on, I'm gonna go back over there. See what's going on. Maybe there's something. So what do you want to play today? Nothing. Go to bed. Boring! I don't care. Go to sleep and never wake up again. I don't want to sleep. I want to draw. Draw then. Just don't leave the spot. I could draw without my coloring pencils. <sighs> well, if I nick myself, I can get red. I'll get you your pencils. Thanks, Andy. You're the best. Okay. We gotta get the pencil. I'm guessing it was those coloring pencils that we saw earlier. Mm -mm -mm. Okay, color pencils. Got them. Okay. Yes, thank you. What should I draw? I wouldn't want to hinder your artistic genius with my bad ideas. Hmm, good call. Well, whatever. As a thank you, I give you a candle. Treat it carefully, as if it were me. I'm lighting it on fire. Not cool. The flame is for you. Ha 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 ha! Boo, you suck! Got a candle. So I guess we could use it for that last one here. What is that, chat? Ashley wouldn't want to kill this one anyways. You couldn't leave any witnesses after all. So they comprehend why this hasn't been even mentioned to her on the news. Surely someone found her before the fire burned the apartment down. Is there an investigation going on? Can this be linked back to you? Other than that, it doesn't bother you. You killed this one to protect Ashley. No regrets. Back when he and his buddies still fed you, this one was always leering at her. Never mind. This one, there is one regret. You wish you could have killed him slower. Damn. This one you had to get before he got to you. It worries you. It worries you. Someone wants you dead badly, even to hire this guy. Found Ashley in the closet. There you are, you menace. Ta-da! I'm missing that Lindy cook. I figured you'd have it. It's in your stomach, right? And mine. 
Are you going to cut me up to get it? I'd rather not. What do you need it for anyways? There's plenty of lenses behind you. That's true. Got a severed limb. We meet. Well, well met, young graves. Okay, let's go back over here. So do I just gotta... How do I get that one? Ah. There we go. Got a limb. Dost thou reckon my mortal frame was consumed by the flames? Forsooth, I do not... May things that innards of a freeze doth do not combust. Perchance it may cook or burn. To it I know it well. Verily, the most foolish deed thou... Oh, this is so annoying, by the way. Has committed to, was to leave mine own remains in thine own dwelling. Praise the heavens that some souls sought to protect themselves and kind kindle the flame, which engulfed all. Okay. Do I get your torso now? It's blowing me. Perchance it's a little concept. Oh my goodness, this is so annoying. Place all several limbs in the freezer. This reminds you of something. Uh. Uh. Rise and shine, Nina! <laughs> Did you have fun tonight? I'm sh I sure hope you learned your lesson. Huh, I guess you're sleeping. Lele kicks the crate. Wake up, sleepyhead! Come on, don't. You open the crate. Oh, oops. Wait, wait, what? What, is she dead? How did... What? That can't be right. What's going on? Whatever. You're so weak like... You're so weak that you die just like that. They're killing not... There's killing nature doesn't want you to live. Sh shut up! Shut up! Forget this. Let's just leave. Let's just leave her here. So you took the stick off. It looks like she went there on her own, anyways. N no, it doesn't. Why would she have crawled at the? Cr Why would she have crawled at the crate until her fingernails split if she was there in there willingly? Oh well. It's not like anyone knows she's here. Let's just leave her. No, she'll it'll stop rotting. And something will come- and someone will come looking to find her. I mean, her family is already looking for her. It's only a matter of time till they come back- come check here. So what do we do then? Oh my... F fuck Let's just hide it then. Well, uh-huh. If no one knows, then it's not a problem. They're gonna know, Lele. They're gonna find the body, they'll know. And then they'll throw me in the prison- They'll throw me in prison for the rest of my life! Me too! It's fine if it's both of us. No! No, you fucking idiot! You don't get it, don't you? Guys and girls don't go to the same prison. They're going to take you away from me. How was I supposed to know that? You figured, some, figured something out then, since you're so smart. Okay, okay, just listen. Uh, like, move her somewhere. Yes, a grave. Let's dig up a grave for her. Alright, where? Anywhere in the forest should be fine. I mean, there's a park right outside. Yeah, yeah, that's probably fine. But first, we need to wrap her up in something because no one could see us carry her there. Okay. Uh, there was a tarp. There's a tarp. I know. Here. This will have to do. Okay, tarp. You wrap Nina's cords inside, and uh, so her name was Nina. Her name was Nina. I couldn't find a shovel, but I figured these wooden planks would do, too. Mm. I mean, they're kind of shuffly. Just watch your splinters. Splinters are the least of my worries right now. Let's pick a good spot. Easy to dig spot. Got a wooden plank. M maybe here. Doesn't seem to be any roots in the way. I'm tired. Yeah, there's a... This is way harder than I thought it would be. This isn't deep enough already. The grave should be six feet, right? Forget it, she fits in here just fine. I, okay, fine. Oh, we gotta pick her up, I think. You and Lady pushed the body into the grave. 
Okay, I guess we put the dirt back? Yeah, we put the dirt back. Crap, this doesn't look natural at all. Looks fine to me. No, there can't be this. This obviously of a this this obvious of a spot and needs to be hidden too. Wanna hide it with some leaves and such? Okay. Get some leaves. More foliage is needed. More foliage. Uh oh, right here. Oh yeah, this looks so much better, huh? Also, this is getting getting blown away by the breeze. It's gotta be something in here we can hold them in place. Some rocks, maybe? Some stones? Yeah, a stone. Dang, Sixty wants to write her name on it. Out of the question. I wasn't going to do it. I was just saying. <sighs> Brown tuber. Hello, Simply Cheese. I swear you were sent chatter. Welcome, welcome. What did they find her? What did the police dogs stick her up? Listen, forget it. I can't. Of course you can. Did did you know that if you don't think about something for a really long time, it's like it never happened? Oh, thank you so much subscribing with your prime, Simply Cheese. Thank you, thank you. Welcome to being a yum subscriber. And it's super cheese to meet you. Sorry, I had to do that. Because you can't remember it anymore. Let's forget about it. Lele, I need you to know. I need you. I need to know you won't say anything to anyone. Promise me this stays between us. I just said we'll forget. We'll forget all about it. He said one thing and do another. Promise me that this time you'll, you'll honest to God keep your mouth shut. I promise. You won't say anything. Hell, I'll never even say her name again. What was it anyways? I don't remember anymore. <sighs> there, there. It'll be fine. Just kidding. <laughs> I'm gonna tell on you. If you won't do what I say, I'll tell everyone about what you did. Who's gonna play... Who's going to play with you if I'm in jail? I'll send you letters! I can't read your copy handwriting. Guess you'll have to do what I say then. Otherwise, you'll be all alone in prison. I'm your best friend from now on. You already were, Lele. Don't lie to me! I'm not, I think, whatever. It's you and me now. No one else will like you. Because you're bad. You're a bad person, Andy. But I won't tell anyone. Of course not. You'll be in trouble too. So what? No one likes me anyways. But that's fine, because you'll be around now. God, you're stupid, stupid girl. I've been here this whole time. None of this needed to happen. If you just... I know you don't like me! Andy, I know. But that doesn't matter anymore. Because from now on, no one will like you either. So let's always be friends, okay? Be my friend, or else. <sighs> I'll be whatever you want me to be. <gasps> really? <laughs> then from now on, let's always be together. You had a million thing, you had a million things you wanted to say to this creature, none of which were pleasant. <laughs> but absolutely nothing came out of your mouth. Several days went died without a hitch. Can I eat your ice cream? Go for it. Huh? Really? I can't seem to eat anything lately. Nom 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 nom. Why did I let you put this jam thing in the strawberry ice cream? It's gross. I wish there was no jam. You wish you had the capacity to care. <laughs> Has anyone asked you anything about things? Yeah, my teacher asked everyone in class. Some officers came by too. And did you say anything? Nope. I only asked Julia if she was expecting to see anyone the other day. Why? You know, because a certain someone told her mom that she would went to study with Julia. So I thought maybe she told Julia she was going to come to see you instead. Well, did she? I don't know, because I didn't want to just come out and ask. But Julia said she was visiting family that day, so she doubt she had, a she had any idea. You promised me fucking nothing. Huh? Why are you being so cold to me? You're worse than you were before, jackass! I gave you my ice cream, yet I'm the jackass. 
Ah, uh, wait, I see how it is. You're still pinning for that bitch. Here we fucking go again. She's dead, yeah, you're still all about her, aren't you? <laughs> it's never <laughs> that fucking face. So true, Oofy. I, I kind of feel him. Honestly, I so feel him right now. So relatable. So fucking relatable. Here you go, man. He's like nine. Oh, my God. <laughs> He's been through this for years. I I feel for him. Like, honestly, I'm more on Andrew's side. What a snake. I bet she died on purpose. I need a knife. <laughs> huh? Where are you going? Are we really gonna get a knife? Are we really gonna get a knife? Picked a knife from the sink and give it a quick wash. Got a kitchen knife. What are we doing? Oh god, what are we doing? What are you doing with that knife? I was wondering if, you, if killing her would be worth it. I'm going to make a blood oath with you. But in return, you have to promise me something too. Okay. Keep my secret and I'll keep you my company. And what if I don't? Guess. <laughs> You're all bark. You wouldn't do anything. If you'll ruin my life anyway, what reason is there for me to keep up with appearances? Moreover, I'm doing this for you. Then what happens if you break the promise? I won't. If you won't. I'm not buying that. Lele, you are a miserable, loathsome being that has wormed its way into every aspect of my life. And for... And for that, my heart will always have a rotten, moldy spore spot just- <gasps> Mold? Mold reference? Mold reference? Oh my god! Mold reference? <laughs> and for that, my heart will always have a rotten, moldy spore spot just for you. Make that a what you will. I mean, I'll take it. But sheesh. Gently, you asshole! How does one cut someone gently? A better man would know. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. And thus, she forever kept her mouth shut. Only as long as you keep your eyes closed. Hmm? Let's no hus Let no hussy steal your gaze. It's just us now. I said I'd be around, I noticed that there would be others. Ah, uh, what? No, I want a do-over! Too late, a promise is a promise. Angie, that's not fair! Oh, don't be like that. I'll make you a priority, just not the only. It's not enough. Why can't you just... Kill our parents? Huh? Hold on, that's not what she said back then. Do it for your cute little sister. I know you want to. Kill the, them to solve all your problems. Kill them to feel something. Kill them for food. Kill them to avoid the things I'll do... I'll do to you if you don't. What is that supposed to mean? Look who's awake. Good morning! Oh, night. It's still nighttime. What do you want, you little creep? To offer mom and dad to the demon. Right now? Right now, while they're asleep, I'll set up the ritual up and do it. Mm. I've given you plenty enough. I've given you plenty enough time to figure things out. Yet you still haven't. So we're doing it my way. Mm, okay. Ah. Oh, oh my! My efforts were far more effective than I thought. Welcome back, Andy. That's not it. But you have a point that Mom might snitch on us. I knew that even before we got to our apartment. I don't know why I let myself think anything else after talking to her. It's because at your core, you're just a soft, gooey marshmallow. If it weren't for me, all the vile women would gobble you up already. Jump! <laughs> wait, wait. Jump! <laughs> Cringe. Cringe. <laughs> there we go. Bunk. <laughs> 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 
are you doing? A demonstration. God, you're so fucking dumb. I should... Andrew, are you still awake? Y yeah, what? Why are you still up? I thought you had work tomorrow. I want to talk to you without Ashley. It's not really a good time right now. Look, I know it's late, but this is important. I've been thinking these over, and I believe I owe you an explanation. That's all right. I don't really need to know. I'm really tired. Andrew, I understand if you're angry, but at least listen. The whole situation with Ashley was. Oh. Oh, go on, Mom. Don't mind a little old me. <laughs> that fucking smug face! Oh my god! <laughs> Look where he's holding- Ah, oh, he's hiding his boner! He's hiding his fucking boner. Oh my- The boner pillow. He's hiding the boner pillow. <laughs> oh my god. And, and he's hiding the, the bite mark too! The Mm, for the love of God, that better not be what it looks like. Ha! Whatever! How does this look to you? W where did you get- What's it looking like now, Mom? Uh, Ashley, come on. You know, there aren't any bullets left in that gun. But your mom sure doesn't. Ashley, put that away. There's no need for this. Be quiet and start walking. We're going to the basement. And don't get any funny ideas, because I will shoot! Andrew, get a rope or something. I'm try I'm tying this bitch up. And don't kill dad. You did not need to be told that. <sighs> okay, we gotta go find rope, I guess. Um, I think there was rope in here? Was there rope in here? I know Yoshi. Renovations are afoot. Um... Where's some rope? Hmm... Maybe out here? Some rope? Unsurprisingly heavy rocks. Okay, that's gonna be relevant for later. Where do I get the rope? A purse. Um... Let's look in here. Oh! Wait, wait, wait. There's something. Phone of Mark, uh, never calls you with. Keck. Okay. That's asleep. There's some rope in the closet along with other equipment. I wonder if this is fine. As you untangle the rope from everything else. Ah, oh, shit. Nice one, Butterfingers. Son? What are you doing? Or er, sorry, I need to, uh, that's a no quick situation while you're running, rummaging through their sex toys. Oh, ew! Oh, God, nasty! Nasty, nasty, nasty! I want to t and the truth, I want to tie him up, it doesn't sound any better. I want to fuck myself? Oh yeah, that'll do. Where's your mother? She went to get something from the basement. Actually, I think she could use some help. Confused, your product goes to check up on your mother. God, rope! Maybe you should hang- <laughs> No! <laughs> no! No! Absolutely nasty! I mean, maybe I should, honestly. Maybe I should. Well, everything's all right. Take out your cleaver. Oh, no! What's going on? Whoa! Dad art! Dad art! That's a dad! We got dad art! Yeah! We did it! We got dad art! We got dad art! Let's go! See? Dad is real! He is real! He's not just a figure! Like a mysterious figure! Giga cut, Dad. A Andrew, where are you supposed to be? Ah, what? Where are you supposed to be masturbating? Just walk down, slow and steady. You tie your father up with it. This whole family's a fucking degenerates. Can't help but notice some old rope burns uh, into his wrist. Better not dwell on it, as you rather not visualize how that came to be. Ew! 
Andrew. I'm just checking if she has something on her. Well, does she? No. Don't move, don't scream, or I'll shoot. Why are you doing this? Don't talk either, just shut up and wait. Okay, what do we gotta do now? Uh. What do we do now? Uh, do I get something from like a certain place or just wreck in a blender? Okay, no. Check mom again two times. Oh, two times. Okay, 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 okay. Andrew, what? I'm still looking for something to tie her up with. Look elsewhere. Don't talk to her. Get away from her. Don't even look her way. Oh, come on. I can't trust you not to get all misty eyed. Eat shit, Ashley. Whatever, Marshmallow Spine. Go get that fucking rope or whatever already. Beloved, don't test me. Okay, okay, sorry. Get a sense of whatever trust she had in you is quickly eroding. Okay, okay. We better go find another fucking rope. Oh no, she's getting so jealous. We better, we better find it. There, there, has to be, there has to be a fucking another one in here. No? No? Mm-hmm. Mm, bottom left of the basement? Okay, okay, thank you. Bottom left. Oh, Christmas lights. Okay, there you go. You tired of mom uh, using Christmas lights? That's what your life has come to. Alright, good. Do you remember how to perform the bit? Hold up. Mom, what's the pin for your credit card? Is that what this is about? Money? You got this far just for a, for a quick buck? What's the pin, and where's the card itself? In my purse. Tells you the pin, and you scribble it down on a note. Okay, then I'm gonna go try this now. Ashley, you stay here and don't do anything. This depends on them. If she's if she gave me the wrong pin, and you end them, then what? Again, it depends on if they behave or not. <sighs> All right, I'll be quick. Okay, got the credit card. Whoa, 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 what are you doing? What are you doing here? Get back downstairs! They're not gonna try anything. Only it takes one of them to start screaming for the whole thing to go blow up in their in our faces. It's amazing how cooperative a person is with a gun pointed at them. Yeah, so go point it. I'll be right back. It's just... Come out with it. I need to get going. You with me on this, right? Sacrificing them? Didn't I already say so? You have, a, you have a habit of flip-flopping. Late. Fuck. <laughs> Look, just trust me, Ashley. We're doing this. <laughs> You're the best! Come back soon! Yeah, yeah. I'll see you in a bit. They kissed! They kissed! Well, Angie's busy picking up the money you decided to set the ritual. Or at least what you remember of it. Let's see. Um... Ruins, Candle, and Blood. This one. There was a big magic circle already drawn. You know yourself a common place with the mirror. Yeah, something like that. It shouldn't be too hard. Okay, let me save. Let me save. Something tells me to save. Okay, did I save? Oh, okay, okay, okay. It did it, it did it. Okay. So we gotta find candle. Oh, there's probably wax candles in like their in their sex dungeon thingy. No? Okay, I guess not. Mm. Where can oh Anything in here? Oh, candles. Okay, cool. Candles. One. Wait, candles. I need candles. Yeah, I need. Here be candles. Vinegar. Surely a cellar mop. Okay, hold on. Can I try talking to them? Can I talk to them? 
Didn't even shake Saxon and blood stood on the floor. But he had nothing. He had. Okay. So what do I do? Hmm. Oh, kitchen knife. There we go. Okay. Okay, okay. So I'm just gonna cut them up, right? I just cut them up enough. Alrighty, so here's what's going to happen. I'm gonna cut one of you to draw some blood. And if you scream, I'll blow both of your brains out. How about that? Just take the money and go. What do you need our blood for? Oh, so now you care about what, I, what I'm about. Don't you fucking act like I haven't tried with you, Ashley. You're the one who shut me out. But even then, I stuck my neck out for you all this time. Oh, like that time when you left me to starve for three months? Was that looking out for me? Oh, gee, thanks! You know, God, I well what I'm talking about. No, tell anyone what you two little psychos did to that girl. <laughs> what are you on about? Take your, take your meds! She literally said take your meds! She actually said take your meds, chat. She actually said it. Meds now. I know you and Andrew did something to, t to that classmate of yours who went missing. I knew that the second she she was found dead near that warehouse she used to play out. <sighs> Whatever. If I didn't love you, I could have rid myself of you right then and there. When it comes to being a mother, I am a fucking saint, Ashley. A saint! Ah, yes, the patron saint of covering one's own ass. Don't you have any idea that would have done to you if they found out? Now then, if you're, you're paragons of virtue, let's see whose blood I should use. Um... Should we cut mom or should we cut dad? I think we should cut dad. Should we cut mom or should we cut... Okay, you guys choose. You guys do. Mom? Mommy? Father? Mom? He's gonna get off... He's gonna get off to it. Oh, that's true. Shakun, by the way. Welcome, welcome. Dad? Boka, welcome, welcome. Dad? Dad's just, dad's just a prop. I mean, yeah, that's what, that's what I was thinking. I don't want to hurt the mom. I feel like she's she's important for later, so I'll do the dad. Hey! Which part of no screaming escapes you? Mother would like to gouge your eyes out and feed them to you. <laughs> Bane to your heart. Bane to your heart. Great delight. God, blood! Alright, let's see here. Something like this. I drew a circle! Do you even know what a circle is? Because it's not that. The nerve of you. You never. No, don't let her get the rise out of you. Candles, candles, candles. Candles are right here. Then we place one, two, three, oh, three, four. All right, that's all the candles I had. Welcome back! You. Give us a hug! You have to draw you have a draw limit for your card? I do? <laughs> I do? <laughs> you do. I can only get a couple hundred before it locked me out. Ha! Suck it, bitch. Being insufferable Being insufferable runs in the family! God, I loved you love to see it, chat. You just love to fucking see it. Yeah, well guess what? Now we now all we get to witness is the wonders of customer service. Get up, you have a call to make. Ashley, take her to the phone. You draw your gun. Off we go! Such a, I know, such a toxic family, jeez. You're in luck, as the customer service line is just open for the day. Yet some others are already a million hour wait. So guess what, you wait. Mm. Mm. Please hold, a representative will be with you as soon as possible. Please hold. <laughs> mm. Ruff, roughly a quarter millennia later, your mother gets a hold of someone. I'm sorry, let me just confirm. You say you want to remove the draw limit altogether? That's what I said, yes. Wow, that's crazy. What if your car gets stolen? Indeed. I'm not all being held at, uh, not all being held at gunpoint here. <laughs> mm. 
There we go. You're gold. Is there anything else I could help you with? Apparently not. Alrighty then. Have a nice day, Mrs. Graves. <laughs> She's so mad. She's seething. Chad, she is absolutely seething about this. Oh my god. Now it's back to the basement with you. I don't think for a second I didn't see the stunt you were trying to pull there. It was just small talk. The car should have been freed now. Unlike your mother who Andrew quickly... <laughs> Unlike your mother who Andrew ties back up quickly. Man, I love this. this is actually the best chapter, I think. This is the best fucking chapter. Let's just say it's not quite there, is it? Yeah, I don't remember what the little runes look like anymore. God, your memory is such shit. Though we already figured out as much as to sketch them out for you. Why don't you just draw the runes themselves? There's blood right there! Because he might have had a good reason for not drawing them yet. All right, fair, whatever. Give me the card. I'll go pick up the rest of the money. I really don't like the idea of you wandering around by yourself at this hour. It's a rainy morning, though. Well, yeah, but I mean, still. Just hand me the card. I actually, I can really leave. Can I really leave Andrew alone with my mom and dad? Uh, who knows what they'll say to him and how wishy-washy enough as it is. Ashley, you wonder if you could trust Andrew enough. Okay. Fuck. I say fuck that. Trust him? Should we trust him? Trust brother husband? Trust brother husband? Save game? I can't save the game! Oh wait, save game. Hold on, hold on. Wait, I can. I can. Okay, okay. So trust him? Trust him? Okay, everyone says trust. Okay, everyone say, hmm. Just give me the card. I'll go get the money. I got the credit card. Please be careful. Aren't I always? When are you ever? See you later! It'll be fine. He won't turn on me as long as I have the trinket. Oh man. Oh man, I don't like the sound of this. Nothing you can do about the missing audio, but at least you can draw the missing runes. Then where did Ashley get all this blood? From your dad, of course, got blood. Is she making you do this? No. Are you going to kill us? Come on, of course not. Technically, anyways. Then what's with all this witchcraft looking nonsense? Just because... Just let her scare you a little. We'll leave you alone after that. How about it? It's hard to say whether she believes you or not. Okay. Mm. Fire doesn't have anything to say. It's always been like that. Just gets... Just going along with your mother. Wow! Like father, like son! Truly like father, like son! Am I right, chat? Am I fucking right? It's either, you're not gonna take it back! <laughs> no! No! Like pottery! God damn it. <laughs> There's something I tried to talk to you about earlier. I don't really care, honestly. About Ashley. What is it? I wanted to apologize to you. For always making you look after her. That was wrong of me. It's fine. Can you imagine what it's like for me back then? When I was your age, I already stuck with uh, I was already stuck with a seven and five year old to care for. Think you had fared better than me? I wouldn't know. This isn't an excuse, mind you. It's an explanation. I never hated you. It was just a fuck up. D don't say that, honey. We did fine. Ha! So fine. Look at where we are right now. Anyways, Breeze, you were such an easy child. I thought we'd just be fine having another. I wasn't counting on Ashley to be so... I'm sorry I made you raise her. I thought you were getting along, so I didn't want to see what, what was happening. And for that, I apologize. It's all my fault. I apologize. Well, it is what it is. It doesn't have to be. I think we can, I can just so, still sort this out. Is that right? If money is you need, I can help you get a job. They're hiring at your company, aren't they, love? That's right, if I put in a good word- I hate that they don't have art for the dad, fuck. A good word for you. You're you're good as hired. Be forewarned though that there are a lot of difficult there are a lot of difficult customers there. I, no, I but I know you can handle it. Should be easy after handling Ashley all this time. What do you say? Prints are off. Save. Don't trust mom. Decline then. Do we do we accept or we decline? Chat. Accept or decline? Decline? 
Don't do it. Defend Ashley's honor. Decline. Ashley needs you. Decline. Okay, we're declining. Well, about Ashley. Wish you wouldn't talk about her that- Oh my god! Ah! Ah! <laughs> I need water chat. I need water. Oh my fucking god. Uh. I wish you wouldn't talk about her that way. But let's not fight. There's a solution here somewhere, I'm sure. What were those death cer certificates about anyways? It's a life insurance scam, nothing more. How's that work? There's this doctor, well, surgeon, actually. They told us you'll be stuck in the apartment. We got redirected to him. As far as the records go, you're, you die from the parasites. I didn't even know I had any life insurance. Well, I got it for you too after you got quarantined. I'm kind of curious how they let you do that. So then when we died, were you in on it? Of course not! I really thought you died! They said your bodies had burned because of the parasites. Or, or, well, had to be burned because of parasites. So that's why I never got to confirm it myself. Ah, uh, she's full of shit. <laughs> she's full of shit. So true, Umfi. Well, where are you going? I have to finish setting things up for her. Oh, come on, forget about this nonsense. We can, sort, we can sort the documents out. Hell, you can even live here if that doesn't work out. You can leave this whole mess behind you just like that. That's okay, I'm not really interested. What? But that, that doesn't make any sense. Why would you not? Ah. Oh no. Oh no! Well, I see where Ashley gets it from. Oh god. Oh no! Oh no! Hmm? Yeah! <laughs> and there it is, chat! And there it is, chat! There it is! I need to sit up now. I gotta sit up now. I gotta stand for this, don't I, chat? I gotta stand for this. <laughs> standing ovation. It truly deserves a standing ovation, chat. Oh my god, you fucked her. You fucked her. What? Huh? The dad knows! The dad knows! No! The dad! Oh, that's disgusting, Andrew. She's your sister, for God's sake. I haven't done anything. What the hell, Mom? Then what doesn't she give you that makes it all worth this? Well, that's none of your business, is it? I knew something was up. How did I ever fuck up so bad? I'm the worst mother- Oh my fucking God. Where is the I should have put a heart rate up monitor on me. You're so right, though. You're so right. I should have put a heart rate monitor on me. No, I mean, yes, you are, but I have never- I'm back! Now of all times. I got the money. Did you miss me, handsome? Did you? Did you? <laughs> no! Oh my god! This is just painful! This is just so painful, chat! <gasps> oh my god, this is painful. I want to die! Ugh, whatever. Summon the fucking demon already. I was so eager. Let's see if it shows up, though. Since there's no music. Wait, what are you talking about? Quiet, you. I'm still armed. Andrew, light the candles. Oh. Okay, last one. Alright, get to it. All right, we're back as Ashley. The other thing's wrong, but this is the final nail in the disappointment coffin. <laughs> Ahem. Hello, hello, Mr. and Mrs. Demon. I'm sorry, I didn't have the mood music, but I have other stuff to ask for. There's no answer. Maybe if I sing something? Please don't. 
Do you yourself that to spare everyone of their second hand embarrassment? Oh god. Ah! Tar soul. What the fuck is that? I offer those two. The demon stole their souls. Huh, I wonder if I should feel something. Well, anyways, so the, so the music wasn't needed to summon you after all? Why did I have to play it last time then? The circle is hard to find. Sounds is easy to follow. However, you have my talisman now. It'll make you easy to find. Speaking of which... A deal's a deal. Charge it up, please. Your trinket works again. Thank you! Hmm? Well, hello. This is the brother? That's right. My pride and joy. And now you can't have his soul. It's mine. We'll see you again, Tar Soul. Sure, I'll make another offering once the trinket needs to be charged again. I will summon you. Oh, sorry, I made him away. <laughs> sorry, I gave him mo um, I gave him I gave him I gave him gap mo away. Bring this one with you. What me why? Hookie ducky! Bye bye! The entity leaves. And that's that, the trinket is charged. We didn't mean it'll summon you. Who cares? What do we do about the bodies? Who cares, she says. Are, are, are you... Are you kidding me? The bodies, Andy. Focus. Right, right. The bodies. Uh, well, on one hand, we didn't kill them. On the other hand, them had to be, them having gone missing would definitely be better for us. Maybe they just fucked off somewhere? Who knows? Maybe if there's a murder investigation. Right, so let's make them disappear. Right, we can start by chopping them. Can we just dump them in the oceans or something? No, Ashley. We're going to make them vanish, not wash up ashore somewhere. Uh, how do we go about this? We can't leave a mess behind. Well, there's a train right there. All oh, right, you are. See, I'm not a dumbass all the time. No, just a dumb and an ass. Oh, wow, check out this smart ass right here. Andrew, untie your parents, but stops. What? Wait, what? What is it? Is Dad breathing? You look. You take a look at for sure enough. His chest is moving ever so slightly. Ah, oh, he is! Mom, too! <laughs> oh, God! Pain! You tried various things, but nothing to get a response from your parents. Yet their hearts are still beating, their lungs draw in air. Oh, God. What is this? Maybe losing your soul just turns you into a vegetable? That can't be, the cultist died. And the warden, too. Well, I mean, did you actually check? Uh, I sure didn't. I just went to town and started chopping. No, no, please tell me he wasn't still alive when we ate him. <laughs> what the fuck is so funny about this? Come on now, I'm sure he died pretty quickly from but Oh, come on now, I'm sure he died pretty quickly from blood loss. If not, you ripping his neck off must have done the trick. Oh. It'll be the same with these two. Get to cutting. No, that this changes everything, doesn't it? You want to leave them like this? That's, they're not getting their souls back. Though, if you want to leave them to starve, I'm all for it. Wouldn't it be a little poetic? I'm sure you like that. Ah, uh, I don't know. I need to think. Oh, come on! Where are you going? No, Andrew, look! Look here for a sec! What? Jesus Christ! You get your father's too. Wh what are you doing? There, all dead. Now tell me again how I always make you do all the dirty work? Uh... He'll bitch and moan. <laughs> he'll bitch and moan. Surely he'll bitch and moan as per usual. But you did not miss that sight. But you did not miss that sigh of relief. Anyways, you drag your parents' soulless and lifeless bodies over to the shower. Okay. Okay, what do we gotta do, though? Alright, I'll start cutting. You got the blood into the drain with the shower head. Gotcha! Whoa, whoa, stop, stop, stop! Stop, it's flooding! Huh? Oh, wait, what the hell? Gross! Oh, great, the drain is clogged up. The lid is screw shut. I need a screwdriver. You just keep chopping the bodies. I'll get you something to unclog the drain. Okay, screwdriver here. How do you unclog this thing anyways? 
After we unscrew the lid, we can pour down some baking soda and vinegar down the drain. Okay, okay. So now we get the baking soda. We get the vinegar. Okay, and then the baking soda. Is there baking soda? Maybe there's baking soda upstairs. Has to be baking soda upstairs. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Baking soda, got it. And you unscrew the lid drain, pour some uh, vinegar, I guess the baking soda? Does this matter? Oh, well, we tried. I gave you some rubber gloves. I'm the one who's gonna have to get it in there. You can't expect you to do the main job. Fine, just get me the gloves. Okay, okay, okay. Gloves. Here you go, have fun! Henny entered the rubber gloves. He digs out God knows what out of the drain. Silly never any amount of God knows what. Oh God, that's disgusting. I'm gonna, oh, I'm gonna gag. You're not helping. Fuck, that's, that is gross, Andy. <laughs> Both of you to call me when I, when I am armed. <gasps> you want it? Come here. Any last words? Forgive me, Andrew, Andrew, I'm sorry, I apologize! Fine, you are spared. For now. The drain works. Let's get it over with. <laughs> She's so, she corrected once again. I love seeing her get corrected, not gonna lie. And decapitate them. You also make some mental note of, to yourself about Andrew. So you know, oscillating between freaking out and apathy, you like to expect him to... Oh, wow. Aww. Who is it? What? N no, nothing, Andrew. If you're tired, I can take care of the rest. What? No, it's, it's really nothing. I must be seeing things. Uh, what? I think I, I'd even bear witness to you being distraught over our parents' corpse. Oh, right. Nice watch to follow. Thank you, thank you. Then again, I bet you're just moping over finally getting your hands dirty. And, uh, you? Hm? What? Are you doing alright? It's alright as I can be, considering the circumstances. That's good. You're... being... weird. God, I wish that was me. God, I wish that was me. Look who's talking. <laughs> All right, enough time wasted. I just continues. <laughs> okay, there's a knot in your stomach. Oh no, is she having regrets? So what's the plan for all this? We dispose of, of it all. Yeah, but how? We'll use whatever means available in the house. Let's look around and see what we can do. Got a head, got a pile of organs. It's a lot of limbs. Okay. Got a head. Okay, nice. Is there anything here that we can use? Or just a functioning toilet. Okay. Uh, let's go up here. Maybe in the kitchen? Got chopped meat. You skin their heads. Got okay. What do you do with their faces? Make masks out of them? I don't know. Throw them in the fireplace? What about the skulls? Well, the skulls we can deal with later, along with the other bones. Ugh. Pour down the kitchen sink. I'm genuinely surprised you didn't offer me any. What? You didn't want a disease or something? Of course I wouldn't offer you raw meat! You really take me for an idiot, don't you? I take it for what you are, idiot. Watch your mouth! This idiot just poured your parents down the drain. Ha, huh, all right. That was pretty smart, I guess, for an idiot. Huh? Oh, my know, let's turn some of their meat into soup. Throw in some vegetables, maybe spices, and then throw the rest away as scraps. What do you mean the rest? What do you think? I'm eating some. Do what you want. What was that soup? Oh, shit, fuck. 
The recipe is right there. Read it. Shame on me for thinking you help. It was meat, onions, potatoes, and carrots. Chop everything up and throw them into the pot. Ah, there we go. Thank you. I know you memorized it. You fucking nerd. <laughs> oh boy, family dinner. <laughs> You're welcome. Okay. Let's go get the onions. Got potatoes, carrot, and onion. Okay, cool. Go back in. Oh, shit. Okay, okay, all chopped up, ready to go. Look at that, much better than your soup. No way there's anything else that we're still needing to deal with. Oh, thank you so much, Harkless, for getting us all to Cecil Way Back Gaming uh, Machine. Thank you, thank you. Thank you so much, friend. The soup is brewing. Okay, so we can put... Oh, can we bury the bodies here? It'll be like cremation. No, there's no way the temperature of this thing gets high enough. Boo-hoo, watch. You place a torso above the fireplace. Andrew rolls his eye, but lights the fire for you. Well, w well, would you look at that? Nothing is happening. Give it a minute, god damn. This isn't working. Makes it kind of hungry though. <sighs> He just be for now. You throw the face in there. Do you think the soup is ready yet? Okay, let's go check the soup. Dinner's ready! I'm eating too? Of course, this is the last hearty home-cooked meal for a while after all. I suppose. That's right. Now say, ah. Uh... Ah. Uh... Unexpected. <laughs> well, well, how is it? It's okay. God, I wish that was me. Just okay? I mean, it's better than last time, but... Why are you so picky? It's really dry. You overcooked it or something. <laughs> Mom's just a dry person, all right? <laughs> Baby, my thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the stage. Happy to have you here, friend. Thank you, thank you. And how the hell is it dry? It, this is soup. No, Mom should be more salty. This is just bland and dry. I rate this a waste of ingredients out of 10. Who would not eat again? <gasps> You'll retract that statement at once! I slave away in the kitchen for you and this is the thanks I get! I'm sorry you can't cook. You're not forgiven! Oh? Jackass, eat shit and die! Well, the food is certainly shit. Oh, come on, I'm joking. It's not that bad, it's fine. More than fine! Yes, yes, it's fantastic in my in in a way my dumbass can't appreciate. How about that? Hmm. Why, yes, indeed, this cooking is beyond my mortal comprehension. Correct. And out of this world culinary experience, which that which the likes of me cannot even taste properly, because my taste buds simply aren't evolved enough in the sense of all subsidies. Truly, when I say waste of ingredients, I meant it's a waste to feed on, feed it on me. Food of this caliber should only be fed to kings. No, gods. That's more like it. So exquisite is your cooking that it, I will write it, you a shitty poem about it. Oh, God. <laughs> Lo and behold, I implore you, come feast your eyes on her. Oh, and there's food too. To erase, to erase your weary soul, she brewed a broth to give you quite a fright. There must be magic in her fingertips. A cook such a delight. And yet the meat is drier than her lips a quarter past midnight. Ugh. Should I buy a lip balm? And the meat isn't dry, goddammit! It's just right! <laughs> oh, whatever. Humans are t humans are hard to cook. I'll get it next time. What? Next time? Oh, whatever. Anyhow, I think we dealt with the flesh to the best of our abilities. We still need to do something about the bones. Well, first of all, I need to ditch the leftover soup. While you do that, I'll clean the kitchen. Should be fine just to check this in the trash bin outside, right? Alrighty. Oh, we switched it to, to Andy. Or, yeah, Andrew. Oh. I need to figure out what to do with all the bones. For now, I'll just collect them all before Ashley loses track of them. Okay. Ugh. 
But the bones remain. Okay, we have to we put them in one plastic bags. Okay, is there bones down here? Double check. Oh, so they do with these skulls. I'm thinking of throwing them into the ocean along with the rest of the bones. So much for making them disappear, huh? We did, we did, what did we do all this other crap for? Quiet, you. As long as the teeth are removed, it should be fine. It's somewhat logic. The dental records, I guess. You guess? How nice. Forgive me, old beloved, for I have never forgotten the rid of a body. For I've never gotten rid of a body before. I'm hoping one can identify someone based on their bones alone. Do bones float though? Aren't they kind of like sticks? I'll find something to weigh them down, just in case. Got a whole bunch of teeth. To the skull. To the skull. So you lift a teeth, bag of bones, and some rocks, and call it a day. Got it. Okay. Let's go get that rock. I know there was a rock highlighted. Yeah, that rock. Yeah. Got some rocks. He placed it in one of the bags. Okay, cool. Let me know when you've gotten the teeth, bones, and rocks sorted out. Oh. Is there more bones somewhere? Eh, what do I do? <laughs> do I need to get another rock? Are there more rocks I need? Are there more rocks that I need? Uh, in the fireplace? I already got the ones in the fireplace. Yeah, I got those already. That's all the rock. Nice rock in the fireplace. Okay, then I got everything. What am I missing? Let me know when you got the teeth, bones, and rocks sorted out. Okay, I got them sorted out. I got the rocks. Toilet downstairs. Oh, toilet downstairs. Oh! Oh! Miyaru Honto. You flush your teeth down the toilet. It takes a few tries to get them all to flush. They're all gone. You wish you could have done do this all to your problems. Finally, all that remains is clean up the basement. Uh, do we have to? Yes, obviously. Why? We'll have to sacrifice someone again later anyways. Huh? Why would it have to be here? We're going to live here, right? We just have to keep paying our parents' rent or whatever. I wish we could, but eventually someone's going to go, Hey, Mr. Gr Miss Grace hasn't showed up to work in a while. So they get fired. So what? I doubt either of bosses will care enough to file Mr. Person's report. Also the fact that they apparently mingled with the people here. The neighbors will notice them gone, despite their names still being on the door. We can't tell- we can tell some lie! We're house-watching our parents and so on. Listen, not everyone gets your shits like you. They have co-workers, friends, and other family besides us. What a bunch of whores! Why- <laughs> What a bunch of whores, you know? What a bunch of whores! Why- Why weren't they happy with just each other? I didn't apply they fucked any of them. Irrelevant! It's all the same. Anyways. They can't all go. Haven't heard from those two in a while. Oh well. Someone's gonna come looking with the authorities. And who will they find here? Their children who didn't report their parents missing. Officers, how, how the fuck aren't, aren't you dead anyways? If you don't want to stay here, just say so. I just don't think I... It's not that I don't want to. I just don't think we can. Well, can we at least use their IDs? Can be the new improved Mr. and Mrs. Graves. We run into the same problem with our, as with our own ideas. Once the authorities start looking for them, they'll see what we've been up to with theirs. <sighs> Sorry, Ashley. I wish it was that easy. Whatever. I'll just clean the basement then. Alright, we're back as Ashley. Let's do this. Damn, I've been at this for like five hours. Jesus Christ. God damn it. I really thought we were in the clear after all this. Oh, whatever. I need to get a mop. Mop. But I'm really enjoying it. I'm gonna keep playing it until I can. Or at least until, like, I finish this chapter. The end is near? Okay. The end is near. Go upstairs and talk to Andy? Okay. You did not clean the basement this fast. Hurry up and go do it proper. I just want to come talk to you for a bit. God damn it. Oh. 
It's not a very good time right now. You can chat when you want after we dealt with the bodies. But I miss you and I want to talk to you right now. Miss me how? Where do you find the time? Ever since the quarantine, I haven't been away from you for one godforsaken hour. Those have been godless hours indeed. How I've languished the absence of your complaining. <laughs> Get help. Great idea. Let me schedule an appointment right away. Boy, I can't wait for some professional to hear all about my life so far. On second thought, don't ever get help. <laughs> don't you miss me when I'm gone too? Hard to say, you're never gone. Maybe I should leave for a bit then. I'd rather you didn't. <laughs> you're so dumb, you'll get caught and a whole new fiasco right there. Man, fuck you. Ha, huh, go clean the goddamn basin. I'll see if I miss you or not. Ooh. Okay, I think that's it. Oh, did we did we did we not finish? Did we not finish? Do we put the mop back? Maybe. Everyone has this one brilliant mop here. Is that it? Put candle. Oh, put the candles away. You're right. Return all the candles to the box. Okay. That should be it. Oh, done. Are we ready to go? I think so. There's no way to tell if we're missing something still. Other than maybe we'll see if you have a dream where we're caught, I guess. I offer two souls. So it stands so it stands to reason I have at least two visions to come. How about I take a nap and see if a disaster awaits us? Please do. Okay, we go take nappy. We go take it. Oh, wait, do we go to our parents' bed? Oh my god, wait, do we go to our parents' bed? Please, 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 please. Oh! Ah! So, what are the conditions to get a vision? As in, what did the demon say about it exactly? Hell if I remember. You don't? Ugh. Could you possibly give any less of a fuck? That'd be great. Oh, do forgive me, your highness. i It's been a week or two. And up and up yours. You didn't even remember our parents' address. Which is, of course, just as important as this. Look, I. it just said I needed to hold on to it to have a claver in dreams. That's it. It was in my pocket last time when it happened. Then I could... Then I Could I hold it this time? It gave it to me. So maybe it wouldn't work with you? What's it hurt to try? God, you can't read between the lines for shit. That was me telling you no! I did get it. I just don't care. Stop being so selfish at all and all the time and let me try. It's my trinket! Ever heard of sharing? How am I supposed to share this? Do you want... Do you want to cut the trinket in half? I'm sure that's a great idea. No, just... Mm. We're not cutting it! That's not it, but I'm sure we can both hold it at the same time. See if either of us get a vision. How? It's a bit small. It's a bit small, Chad. It's a bit small. Between our hands, right? Oh my, how romantic. Come again? Holding hands when we sleep together? Man, fuck off. <laughs> Alright, forget this. Good night. I'm kidding, I'm kidding. It's fine. Though, I still think I'm gonna be the only one to have a vision. We'll see. God, I wish that was me. Good night. Good night. <laughs> Fuck this. How am I supposed to sleep after you went and said something so off color? <laughs> it doesn't help that all moms said something outrageous, too. Oh, yeah. I heard that. You did, huh? So what was that little show was about early? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Wait. Are they actually going to do a nasty? Are they actually going to do a nasty? Did you see her face? That was great! I hope she regretted her entire life just then. 
Pretty sure she just regretted giving birth to us. I'll take it. If for once she regretted the both of us, then I'm happy. What? Nothing. Good night. It isn't long until sleep takes you over. Alright, here we go. Bunny! TV won't turn on. Got a pink plushie. Oh, I see. I see. Who drew all this garbage? Oh. Oh. Better red crayon. Okay. Nothing but static. Okay, the red crayon means a sucky drawing. Oh. Okay, green crayon. Nice. Okay, so then that green crayon should be this drawing right here. It's where we go get okay, we go get the blue chalk. Okay. Blue crayon achieved. Blue crayon achieved. Okay, and then I guess we gotta go to the bunny drawing. Okay, hold on. Let's go back here. Double check. Okay, now present the crayons to the bunny. Okay. Oh, okay. The TV, uh, TV and you watch each other. The more, more importantly, this episode is titled Lele and Lele Alone. <gasps> oh no. Pink plushie, uh, take it. I'll take it. Uh, father plushie won't budge. Mother plushie won't budge. Got a green plushie. Okay, I guess that's our brother. Seat down the pink plushie or the green plushie? I guess that one? Got a stool, okay. Place the pink- Oh! Oh wait, I think I got it. I think I got it. I think I got it. Yay, the plushie seems happy together. Yeah, I did it! All by myself. Okay. Pearl plushie won't budge. Yellow plushie won't budge. Uh... This chest is locked. That's locked. He's missing sustenance. Okay. Oh! Oh, I get it! Wait, I get it. I get it. So the green... So the green... I know. Got a green plushie. I know. I know. So this is supposed to be... There we go. Yep. Okay. The trash can can now be utilized. Can you... It really can. Okay, cool. And then... There's nothing in the chest yet. Okay, so then... Get the purple plushie. Locked away the not exactly where it belongs. Okay, I get it. This is supposed to be representing, uh, Ashley's childhood. Purple plushie figures for quite a ladies, man. <laughs> okay. Let me get the pink one. And then... We'll put it over here with the brother plushie. Oh, am I not supposed to do that? Hmm. Okay, I'm gonna put it back here. I'm gonna put it back here. What's done is done. Okay, dad plushie and mom plushie. Now I go put them over here. Do your mom and dad push you into the pot? Got the best thing in the world, which is her brother. Okay, and then there's something in the cage. That's all better. Yeah, I did it! I did it. Okay. Um, flower? Got flower. 
And dagger? Okay. Place down the... Oh, wait. Place down the flower. There we go. Okay, got sunshine. Got the heart. Finally, you monster. Got a broken heart. Okay, okay. So, I want to place down the heart. And then the broken heart goes here. Oh my god, I'm so smart, chat. I'm so smart, chat. Actually, wait, wait, wait. Sunshine. Okay, no, sunshine get those go there. The end. Once upon a lousy life. The end. It... Oh, reverse them? Reverse them. Okay, heart. Broken heart. No. Ah, wait, wait. I got it, I got it, I got it. So, this is supposed to be the heart. This is supposed to be the sunshine. Sunshine. And then broken heart. Ha ha! Got it! Ha ha ha! Wait. Wait, I should save. I should save. I should save right here. I should save. Save. Yeah, he knows what she's about. Yeah, you should save. Okay, okay. This isn't a route you guys want me to do anyways. So, it's fine. The cage is locked. Okay. There's a key over here. Got a key. Mm. Oh, the key is for the brother. It's for the brother bunny. Got the green plushie. Okay. And then I guess we put the green plushie... We gotta put him down somewhere, right? This is such a schizo -ness. Oh yeah, this is like... This feels like a schizo dream. That's what it is. For your thoughts? No deal. Come on, give me one word. Mortifying. <gasps> they fought! They fought! Oh my god, they fought! They fought! <laughs> the fight of my god! Thank you for the follow! Oh my god, they fought! Huh? Didn't seem like that a minute ago. So I think you meant to say gratifying. Big words don't fit in your mouth. Yeah, something else fit in just fine earlier. <gasps> oh yeah, so mortified, aren't you? You know, I'm, I'm easy to distract. Some guilty conscience you've got. than yours. Come here, you. <laughs> Wait, just gently, gently, goddammit! <gasps> this is to end it without you dying. So who searches that, suppose? Well. Ah, oh, did he see it? Did he see it? Oh, no! I wonder if Andrew saw it too. <laughs> He's so into it. Mayhaps. <laughs> oh shit, you're awake. Well, hello to you too. Uh, yeah, good morning or evening, I guess. Whatever. 
Right, so hey, did you get a vision? B probably not. Really? Do you see dreams like that a lot then? No, I don't! <laughs> so you did see it! Aww. Quite a vision, huh, big brother? That was not a vision. The demon is messing with us. Y yeah, that's it. That's just it. It's because we tried to be cheap and get two visions for the price of one. So they gave us a fake vision and said, that's the only explanation that makes sense. Oh, please. I mean, it is your trinket. Clearly you were right and I, was supposed to, I wasn't supposed to use it. Sure, sure. Keep selling it. I'm totally buying. Screw you. Yeah, you just might. Fuck off, do you honestly think that? <laughs> I don't know, you tell me. Listen here, you. Fucking spare me, I don't want to hear it. You just help me discreet our parents uh, desecrate our parents' course courses. Yet getting laid is what you're freaking out about? No one is getting laid. You keep telling me I messed up, what a joke. Oh, we're not like that, are we? I don't know. Mm. You come off that way sometimes. Huh? How so? Tad jealous. Oh dear, what's that? Wishful thinking. Tell that to my ex. Let's not pretend you don't have a bit of jealousy streak yourself. Now that's wishful thinking. Bad chance, get over yourself. <sighs> I don't think I need to I don't think I need I don't think I need to ask you this, but let me anyways. It's never gonna come to that, right? You and me. Let's be so real, chat. Never say never. Never say never. Never say never, chat! <laughs> never say, never say never, Andrew, my dear. Oh my fucking God. <laughs> it's not funny. Don't joke about this. Why, am I getting your hopes up? Or maybe something else. <laughs> say, didn't that vision get you? I'm out of here. Why is this such a massive issue to you? We've done it way- we've done way worse things together. Honestly, figured it would happen eventually. Why, 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 why are you like this? Why would you say- why would you think this? I- wow, what a landmine, huh? Well, yeah. Ah, oh, forget this, forget this whole thing. Fine, but I was clearly- it was clearly a vision, so it'll probably come up sooner or later. Well, in your last vision, a guy slit our throats, yet here we are. So let's just leave it at that. Alrighty then, if you say so. I just let the elephant under the rug and called it a day. Anyway, let's go throw mom and dad into the ocean! <laughs> yeah, let's just go throw our parents in the fucking ocean and forget about everything. Yeah, 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 let's do that. Um, there's something I need to go pick up, right? Okay. Princess, let's go. Let's fucking go. <gasps> oh no, oh no, oh no. <gasps> oh no, oh no, oh no. I hate you. It's not my fault. It's a stupid bag with its own. I don't care. Hurry up and pick them up. Thank God no one is here at this hour. Room, room. Okay, so don't stay too far into the light. Just in case someone does pass by. Hmm? Oh, right here. Okay. Andrew drops the bag into the bones with the rocks in the ocean. Since my bag broke, do you think we'll make sure the skulls sink? They'll probably be fine. Well, in that case... I bet I can throw further than you! Bet you can't. Oh my fucking god. Oh yeah? Definitely. On the count of three. One, two, three! Ah! What was that? It looks like I... Or, oh, what was that? Looks like I... Sorry, I turned it... It got my way. Sorry, got my way. Filthy cheater! Nope, you never said pushing wasn't allowed. Oh yeah? Well, here's your fucking prize, Jackass. It's a fist in the face! Duh, hug, why thank you, thank you. Whoa! <laughs> mm. You're a little different lately. 
Am I no fun anymore? Oh my fucking god, they just need to fucking, like, they, they, she needs dick. She needs fucking dick in her pussy and her fucking mouth. Holy fuck, just, yeah, just sex already. Holy fuck. Yeah, mine. <laughs> yeah, mine. How have you been sleeping lately? Are you actually looking for a fight? No, I'm not talking about that. I mean, just in general. Your insomnia and nightmares, how are those? Ah, uh, and decent, all things considered. Yeah. Unexpectedly, you seem to be doing just fine. Don't be happy for me or anything. Haha, <laughs> and he's all grown and doesn't need me anymore. And he is dead. I don't think he needs anything. Aww. Even so, there's the trinket too. You're apparently the only uh, you're apparently the only one allowed to use it, so there's that. I don't know about that one, but that certainly showed me one way to keep him around. Heh, <laughs> I suppose. Right. I honestly pissed I'm honestly pissed we don't know what's coming next. It's really hard to plan what to do now. Alright. So what do we do? The money has still bought us some time, but we still need to figure ourselves figure find ourselves new identities. Do we really though? Can we just live in the car? And mug random people for a living? That's just not going to work for very long. Every time we try our luck, we're more likely to get caught. Then can't we buy fake identities? I know people do that sometimes. Point me to the guy who's selling them and I'll and I'll get them on, on that. Ah, the cultist club seems like a really sketchy spot. Maybe someone there knows who, someone who will sell them. Probably not, though. Stop being such a defeatist. Let's go take a looky-see. It's a crap idea anywhere go, to go anywhere near the, where we killed that guy. Also, that motel was the only one that let us stay with, stay with cash. Fine, but we're we're leaving the car in some random parking lot since there's definitely an ongoing investigation for that hitman's death. Right, cool, whatever. Let's get going. Well, thank you. So is this what's meant by some people need correction? Yes, exactly, Umfi. Thank you so much for 100 bits for some chat, Dan the, Dan the Man. Thank you, thank you. I had a mole there? Are you coming or what? In a minute, let me finish. Waste of time and money. Waste of time and money. I love it. Uh-huh. Oh, shit! Oh, shit! No! I want to say that save? Yeah, save! <sighs> Chat. Why is the story actually good though? Like, yeah, okay, funny incest game. I get it, Chat. I get it. Funny incest game. But why is it actually good? Why is it actually good? I really, think it's such a good thing. It's what's up to keep it all the time. Thank you, thank you. I've been obsessed with it for. I'm obsessed now. This is gonna be my new fixation. No. This woman gets it. Like yes, funny, funny incest, Mimi, and everything. But it's so fucking good. What the hell? It's saying the most invested I've been into incestuous cannibal <laughs> cannibalism ever. It's ridiculous how the writing and dialogue is like- Right! It's almost as if the writer has experience. Huh? <laughs> With Danny Hawk huh? <laughs> and Yeti <you> stare. <laughs> New fixation acquired. So true, Luffy! Oh no, oh no. So see at least two more chapters coming. Oh my fucking god, I can't wait. I fucking I just fucking can't wait anymore, chat. I just can't. Your enthusiasm bled through. <laughs> Alrighty guys, well, we've been at this for like five and a half hours. Thank you everyone who came to the coffin of Andy LA. Like we will definitely be doing episode three when it comes out and any other episodes that come out in the future. Probably one at a time since we finished two of them today. Um Wow! I'm gonna be hyper fixated on this until the next episode. I already fucking know it. Why was this? This was so fucking good. 
There's actually two more chapters that are just two, uh, 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 just the two different versions of chapter three. Gee, they're, they're, oh yeah, that's right. Cause we, we could pick different routes based off of this. Holy fuck. I could go back and like do, and just like play around later. Oh fuck, I might do that. That might be a different stream. I've always been a brother lover. I've always been into Brocon, but it has to be big Brocon. <laughs> different ramps normal. Thank you so much for the follow. We'll go to stage. Happy to hour. Happy to have you here. Okay, guys. This was an adventure, but I do have to get going for now. But thank you guys so much. By the way, I hope you guys enjoyed the voice acting that I did. I don't, I'm not an expert voice actor, but um, I did try my best. I think I did really, really good with Ashley. I'm sorry about my Andrew. Uh, sorry about all the other voices, but like, <laughs> I like the voice acting. I've been here. Thank you. Oh, thank you so much, Ashley, for the one, two, three, four, five hundred bits. Thank you so much, friend. Thank you, thank you. High train. Oh, we got a high train going. <laughs> We got a high train going. Thank you. Thank you for the high train. Thanks for the good stream and amazing voice acting. Thank you. I think, honestly, I'm definitely gonna have to clip the part where, like, Ashley was just going fucking insane with Andrew. Um... <laughs> like, you, you know that part where, where they were- where he killed, like, the, the- the hot girl in the apartment? Like, I have to clip that part. Fuck, I think I did a really good job at that part. I'm gonna use that for, like, a fucking reel or something. That was way too good. Dance for our amusement. Okay, I got you, Umfi. There you go. I dance for your amusement. <laughs> yeah, the hysterics are very well. I loved it. Damn, I'm, I'm kind of blushing so much right now because like, ah, I'm not. I never done. I never done like professional voice acting or anything. Or <laughs> to channel any my points. Damn it. Oh man, I'm so sorry, friend. Dang, I missed that part. Don't worry. You can look back at the vod. You can look back at the vod. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, the yeah, voice acting was peak. I'm definitely clipping that part. That part was too fucking good for me, like, not to use for, like, a fucking reel or something. <laughs> well, you're amazing, and, inf and inflections were great. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Thank you. <laughs> alrighty, alrighty. That's all we got for today, though. Thank you so much, guys, for tuning in again. Thank you, thank you. This was probably one of the longest streams I've done, where I actually was up to do a long... S I was actually... I had the energy to do it. Um, so let's see if we can go say hello to anyone. Um, let's see. There is no one online on YouTube, so we might just end it there on YouTube. Alrighty. Alright, YouTube will definitely be ended there, but for... For anyone else, let's go ahead and see if we have anyone on Twitch we can go raid, definitely. Let's go say hello to... Let's go say hi to Leaflet. I love Leaflet. Leaflet's so good. I love my Leaf. We'll tell her we played the incest game. <laughs> Alrighty, so if you don't have a sub, you can use- Whoa! Thank you so much, Apache, for tier 1 of 32 you months! Was on the same wavelength with this game. You almost couldn't tell if it was Nyaru or Ashley talking. <laughs> Am I gonna be the canon- the can canonically correct Ashley? I, I would be very honored if that was the case. <laughs> Thank you so much for the high train. Thank you. Thank you. Um, uh, let me go ahead and type out leaf love for the raid message So if you don't have a sub you can use leaf love, but if you do have a sub gotta get the sub whatever it may be You can use we're not using incest raid. We're not using that one you fuckers Leaf love. Oh my fucking god. You better not absolutely the fuck not. No, I don't approve of that one. I don't approve of that. No. Too late. It's not too late, actually. It's not too late. Fuck you guys. <laughs> Alrighty. Thank you so much again, everyone, for tuning in. Thank you, thank you. I'll go ahead and see y'all later. And thank you so much for the simulcast as well. I hope you guys have been enjoying it. And let me know what you think. Yeah, thank you. Thank you so much, guys. Bye-bye.